Great Voyage, Rob Nami onto the boat. Author, Naruto Start, Chapter 101, Chapter 101 The Ice Girl Emperor shocked the audience, report. Double Admiral Paddling, the sea in the distance. A small boat stopped at the edge of the ice, and Luffy jumped on the ice and rushed to the battlefield. Golem, brother in Ace's mouth, good courage. Whitebeard glanced at it and laughed. The red dog on the other side said coldly, no matter how many people come here today, they will have to die, and how long can you last? Golem Lala, the little devil who only has a candle, it is not your turn to educate Lao Tzu. Whitebeard punched him with anger, and just burst out, and he couldn't help but half kneel and vomit blood. It's not just injury attacks. The great filial son, Skew Yad, had also stabbed Whitebeard in the back before, but Whitebeard chose to forgive. Hades, taking advantage of your illness and want in your life, the red dog sees the opportunity and suddenly the magma turned into a fist and exploded. Boom. At this moment, the battlefield is frozen. Under the sluggish gaze of Ace, Jaws, Beast and others, their father's abdomen, directly penetrated by magma, emitted black smoke. Boom. The white beard snorted, and the shock fruit covered, and a punch shook the red dog into the air, suddenly vomiting blood again. Looks like you're really old, Newgate. Sengoku whispered and waved his hands lightly. An instant, ten thousand cannons are fired. Guns and bullets rain. Various attacks were directed at white beard who was shot in the face by a cannon and shot in many places on his body, and many generals also shot. Golem, Lao Tzu is a white-bearded man. Whitebeard stood up, and the concussive force erupted, directly shaking all the attacks apart, and blasting out a wide passage under a knife. Don't worry about Lao Tzu, you rush over. Done. Whitebeard rushed into the battlefield again, and the war entered its second phase. On the spaceship, Bayou's gaze fell on Luf's men, even he brought it, it seems that the straw hat was photographed flying to the headquarters of the Revolutionary Army and also brought a few helpers sub. Two years later, he was chief of staff of the Revolutionary Army and second in command of the Revolutionary Army, offering a reward of 620 million berry. And now, slightly childish, Luffy was photographed at the headquarters of the Revolutionary Army and seen by sub, and the memories of their lost ones suddenly rushed to his brain, and the two recognized each other and came together to rescue Ace. How did the two of them come out? White Feather actually saw the demon of Ankov, as well as lightning. The two of them should have been on the 5.5th floor of the city, because Bayou didn't want to see any Shemile, so he skipped it. Hip hop, since it's Luffy Boy and Saba Boy's big brother, let's rescue it together. The Queen of the Kingdom Akuma Baker, Ivankov shouted, after Bayou moved into the city and left. Sensing something, Ivankov and Lightning and the others stepped out of the 5.5th floor, defeated Hannibal, and rushed to the ground floor, only to encounter Magellan, and Luffy and Saab as well as the giant Moi who is very familiar with the Advance City, also came here late at night. After a fight, knowing that there was no one in the Advance City, the crowd immediately rushed to the naval headquarters. Luffy, don't be impulsive, let me think of a way. Although Saab regains his memory by seeing Luffy at headquarters and is currently eager to save Ace, he is still very calm. The battlefield is too chaotic. The rear is full of generals, and it is difficult for them to rush through the sky by strength. Sabathon looked at Lightning and Moi, and made a special gesture to prevent others from hearing. Gesture meaning, cut a road on the surface. We rushed over to attract attention, secretly, Moi, you went through the ground with lightning, rescued Ace and cut the Sea Tower stone handcuffs, trouble you. Lightning, a scissor fruit capable person, can cut any substance. Moi, the pusher, is the creator of the 5.5 floor of Push City. In the state of battle, lightning acted as a male, with a serious expression, I'm ready. Oh ha ha ha, Saab, don't look at me like this. I'll be shy. Giant Moi has a very special personality, twisting like a little girl at the moment, but very lively and smiling. Saab got used to Moi's personality and held Luffy deadly. If you want to save Ace, you must not be impulsive, here? I see. Luffy snorted. If it wasn't for the second brother Zabo who opened his mouth, he would have broken free and rushed over. Click. Lightning cut the ground to make a bridge to the execution table, and Luffy and Saab rushed over. Ivankov single-handedly blocked the incoming navies. Moi also pushed out a larger passage on the ground leaning into the ground, moving underground with lightning towards the execution table. Cut the fruit, cut the seat tower stone. Sensing the actions of the crowd, Bayou also understood Saab's gesture and suddenly smiled. The plan is good, but you are running in the wrong direction. Lightning cut the direction of the passage and happened to pass by the location of the seven martial seas. The three new seven martial seas had already gone to fight, and the only current positions left were Bear and Hancock. How dare anyone disturb the concubine's thoughts of her husband. Noticing that someone was running over, Boa and Cook frowned and looked a little colder. And the bear, who also looked at the two people who ran with no expression, did not wait for Han Cook to shoot, and slapped it. Pressure cannon. What? Seeing the bear shoot at him, Saab was shocked, thinking of something, and his eyes were full of sorrow. Luffy, you go and save Ace. Grabbing Luffy and throwing him away, Saab wrapped his arms around his hands and attacked with both fists at the pressure cannon. 
dragon's breath. The high-speed fist collided with the pressure cannon, and the power exploded out in one breath, with a roar, and the surrounding hundreds of meters all collapsed, and the dust rolled. And on the spaceship, Penny suddenly put down the flesh in her hand and looked at the cold robot like bear in a daze. He, what happened to him? Wasn't he okay when I saw him before? When Bei Ayu took her to meet the bear together, the other party was not a problem, but now, the bear you know is dead, he's been completely transformed into a weapon, and has lost all his memories of being a human being except for certain settings. Bei Ayu said this cruel truth, and Benny burst into tears in an instant. Without waiting for Boni to say anything, Bei Ayu comforted, rest assured, he will change back, you have to believe me. Well, I believe you. Bonnie cried and laughed and wiped her tears. Bei Ayu suddenly said, so, you are his daughter, right? What are you talking about? Boney looked like I don't know what you're talking about, and Bei Ayu suddenly knocked her forehead, really unruly. Even if Boney didn't say it, Bei Ayu was basically sure. 1. Bonnie is 22 years old. 2. The aging Penny looks the same as the Queen of Solby, the bear's mother. 3. Boney's wish, let Burger Pun change his further back to the way he was. Bonnie worried, then sent him to your gravity space, don't be broken. Bei Ayu nodded, and was preparing to strike. Sensing something suddenly said, I think it is better to freeze the bear, to avoid losses, and when my ability is further developed, I can completely restore him. Frozen, Bonnie wondered, one after another, you disturb the concubines to miss their husbands, and you really make the concubines angry. Hancock stepped out of the dust of Saab and the bear's collision and glanced around indifferently, freeze the concubines, click. The next moment, under the shocked eyes of many people, within a few hundred meters of Hancock, everyone instantly froze, including the nearby bear, as well as Saab and Luffy who ran hundreds of meters, was sealed in ice. Sizzle. The battlefield froze for an instant. What happened there? General Pheasant air strikes. Turning his head to look at the stunned pheasant in the distance, the yellow ape had an exaggerated expression on his face. R. Green Pheasant, what is your move? Thousands of meters in the air, thousands of people frozen in the air, you're really terrible. Not me. The pheasant looked slightly solemn, there is no slightest cold air leaking out, there are so many people frozen in the air in an instant, and some people have a stronger control of the cold than me. The attacks of the natural system are all leakages of their own energy. Like the red dog, he couldn't let lava appear out of thin air in the distant sky, but could only erupt from his body. In the scene just now, there was no outbreak of cold, and the cold air directly appeared out of thin air and froze the people around them. This is not the case even if nature is awakened. There is a big difference between the two. It's that woman, how could she have abilities like a pheasant? Seeing that it was the female emperor who shot, the warring state's brow frowned. But now is not the time to think about this, the warring states can't help but shout, Boy a Hancock, don't mess with your abilities, how many navies have you just frozen? What? Do you have an opinion? Hancock's haughty reply, not only the warring states couldn't help but be stunned, all the naval brains were stagnant, was this woman so brave? Sengoku's A's were cold, and he subconsciously said, do you think you are Bay are you, that little devil? Shut up the concubines. You are not allowed to speak of a concubine husband. Hearing the two words of the little devil. Hancock immediately drank coldly. What the? Is she the Demon King's woman? Fake it. Suddenly, the battlefield froze for a few minutes again, and Whitebeard's movements were slightly delayed. And the countless people who watched the live broadcast, there are too many people who are stunned to stay in place. The yellow ape instantly retreated hundreds of meters, and hurriedly probed the surrounding perception. He won't really come, right? Sengoku glanced back at the yellow ape and looked at Hancock coldly. Good husband, it seems that you have also betrayed the world government. The fifth seven martial seas of the Demon King's forces. Yes and how? Since this was the case, Hancock didn't bother to hide, and suddenly scanned the whole field. The husband does not want the concubine to come. But the concubine wanted to see for her husband the full strength of the naval headquarters, and now she finally understood. As he spoke, Hancock pointed to the red dog, except for that desperate guy. The other generals are unreliable waste. On this occasion, they are not willing to contribute, and the acting is the same as their real thing, either paddling or watching the play and there is no threat to the husband. Yellow ape. Ugh, how terrible. Pheasant. Alas, what a hassle. Unexpectedly, Hancock found two old six, and the observation was really careful. Bei Ayu and the girls laughed. Good, very good. The red dog was suddenly bruised. He vomited blood. These two people are just slightly dirty clothes, together with you two playing the old man, right? The scene was extremely awkward at one point. Many navies look at each other, such a serious occasion. The two admirals also have to work hard to paddle. Sengoku shouted angrily. Kizin, Porusalino, you all give the old man a serious look. Golem, warring states, it seems that you are very depressed as a marshal, so you might as well go with Lao Tzu to be a pirate. The white beard laughed, suddenly perceived something, and the essence under his eyes flashed. And Karp, who was sitting on the execution table, also looked faint. After the angry warring states took a deep breath, he sorted out his emotions and sensed something. But it was one step too late. Boom. The next moment, the entire execution bench collapsed. 
once again bringing the battlefield to a standstill. The warring states jumped into the distance, his face suddenly darkened, and he had just been angered by Hancock and the two paddling generals, and he was careless. Carp, Sengoku burst into laughter. The guy didn't even do anything when he let the execution table collapse. Cough cough. I'm here. Carp walked out of the collapsed ruins, full of fear. I didn't expect the execution table to collapse suddenly. It really scared me. Is it another actor? And Sengoku's face is even darker. Sengoku immediately shouted, immediately turn off the live broadcast screen of the telephone worm. Click. There was a sudden cracking sound in the ruins, followed by Ace's excited voice. The handcuffs are broken, although I don't know but thank you for coming to save me. No, we're here to help Sab and Luffy, so run away. Lightning finished speaking, and Moi continued to push the ground, leaving from the ground. Sab, you say Sab, was that guy really Sab? Ace was stunned and directly punched open the ruins. Boom, as the flames soared into the sky, the navy was stunned, and the pirates immediately cheered. Seeing this, Whitebeard was also relieved and laughed. Golem, Ace rescued, take him, you get out of here first. Green pheasant, yellow ape, immediately go and besiege Whitebeard and if you don't make any more effort, you will wait for confinement. Sengoku shouted, Ghost Spider, your lieutenant general is going to round up and kill those captains, Red Dog, and now go and kill that little ghost who plays with fire. The three generals looked at each other. In the fury of the warring states, the lieutenant generals rushed to Marco and the others, the pheasant and yellow ape rushed to Whitebeard, and the Red Dog rushed to Ace. The battlefield was once again in chaos. On the spaceship, Bayayu raised his hand slightly. Space transfer. On the battlefield, the bear was transferred to gravity space and promised Boney to cure him. And Hancock, too, disappeared and came to the ship to make it. Nami glanced at Hancock, who was snuggled up to the white feather, and was surprised, that Firefist was actually rescued. Looking at the situation on the battlefield, Bayayu was very sure, the great general Red Dog is pursuing and killing with all his might, and he is dead. Chapter 102. Chapter 102 Your sons are all waste. What about people? After a startled glance, he found that Hancock and the bear had disappeared, and the warring states suddenly alerted, White Feather's space transfer. Kipu, hearing this sentence is also a Lin, after perceiving it. He was surprised, there is no one else in the hundred miles, even the breath of the pirate female emperor has disappeared. No, he must be nearby. Sengoku didn't see it either, but his intuition made him look up at the sky. Can be blue sky and white clouds. Nothing. If you want to perceive the invisible spaceship under the cover shield of my breakthrough level, you are still far away. Bayayu was not impressed by the vigilance of the two, and grabbed Hancock, who pounced on the ship as soon as he came to the spaceship. Husband, won't you shoot? Hancock asked with a confused blush. Nami puffed her face and said, How many times have you said that don't take over Bayayu when there are other people? Does the concubine know you? Little sister. Hancock suddenly regained his arrogant stance. Don't stop me, I'm going to suppress her. Nami gasped and was pulled by Koya and Vivi. Okay, sit down. Bayayu asked all the women to sit down and then looked at the broadcast screen and said, The Warring States side has closed the live broadcast, so let's broadcast the higher purity. Yes, Master. Athena obeyed. Use the image phone worm to shoot the broadcast screen scanned by the radar and transmit the live broadcast signal. A few seconds later, people around the world watching the live broadcast suddenly found that the live broadcast was restored and clearer. Kia was also puzzled, it seems to be over. Isn't Big Brother Bayayu involved? No rush. Bayayu looked in Ace's direction, everywhere is too chaotic. Wait for the battlefield to quiet down. Whitebeard, who was wounded and seriously injured, was besieged by the pheasant and the yellow ape and fell into a bitter battle. Ace took the lead and ran to the place where Hancock was frozen. Saab broke the ice, and after breaking the Luffy ice cube, the three brothers ran together. The red dog in the distance suddenly gave a cold drink. It seems that Whitebeard saved a waste. His own father is going to die, but he only wants to escape regardless of it. What do you say? In the distance, Ace stopped and turned around full of anger. Daddy won't die here. Ace don't you? Saab looked nervous and headed toward Ace, but Ace threw his hand away and glared at the red dog in the distance, who won't die. Look with your waist Ace, how long your dad can last. The red dog sped up as he spoke. Daddy, with just one glance, Ashton burst into tears. After being warned by the warring states, the pheasant and the yellow ape attacked Whitebeard with all their might, and looking at the blood-stained Whitebeard, Ashton wanted to rush over. Knowing that he could not defeat Ace, Saab went up and slapped him. Stop me. What can you do when you run over? I don't want Whitebeard to die here without even being able to save a son, so I will leave with me immediately. While Ace was being blinded, Saab dragged Ace and ran away, and Luffy shouted and followed. Big Spitfire. The Red Dog took a strong shot. The Lava Fist slammed out like a volcanic eruption, and in the middle of the road it turned into countless volcanic bullets, covering the blows of the three brothers. Phoenix Seal. Marco saved the field in time. A huge shockwave hit the volcanic bomb and exploded in the sky. Ignoring Marco, Red Inu said coldly, Escape. You are a waste, 
and Whitebeard is a loser of the last era, you be damned, Ace broke free of Saab again, and the whole person turned into flames, turning angrily and rushing towards the Red Dog, such an impulsive Ace made Saab also angry and full of helplessness, Luffy said stupidly, Ace is so powerful, can he win the battle against the general now, no, he's going to die, huh, that Ace is in danger, let's go and save him, before Luffy could finish speaking, he saw that Saab had already rushed up and immediately followed, Ivanko felt his head grow a little bigger, are all three of them crazy, Ace, after stopping the volcano bomb and seeing Ace running back again, Marco ran to fend off the red dog and angrily said, give me back, Marco, he actually scolded daddy, I, if you don't go back, I'll kill your two younger brothers, scram, dot good, Ace gritted his teeth and glared at the red dog angrily, turning away again, Saab grabbed Luffy in one hand and watched Ace come back, but he was also helpless, there is really no time for you to truss back and forth, you don't have to be stupid again, run, that's when it happened, Red Dog once again sneered, you run, I tell you, Whitebeard will never be as good as Roger, and even if he goes to Yellow Springs, he will be suppressed by Roger, me, want, you, die, running away, Ace stopped again, turned around and entered a state of extreme anger, erupting in flames that threw both Luffy and Saab out, and Ace, full of murderous intent, rushed towards the Red Dog to kill him, Ace, you idiot, Marco wanted to cry angrily, because he was stopped by several lieutenant generals, and the red dog had already crossed him and rushed towards Ace, at the moment, a hundred meters apart, he's dead, Bayou shook his head slightly, Carp was stared at by the warring states, and Whitebeard was besieged by the two generals with all their might, and they were all very far away, even if the two wanted to shoot, it was too late, accidents, however, in Bayou's foreseeable future, there were no surprises, die, one hundred meters, for the red dog in an instant, decisive and very strong shot, boom, Ace's fire fist was destroyed by the red dog's magma, and it punched him through, an instant, the battlefield freezes, Saab and Luffy, who had just stood up, were sluggish, and the white bearded man who had been hurt by the pheasant and the yellow ape was sluggish again, and everyone looked at them, poof, red dog's expression was cold, the magma fist completely pierced Ace, the heart was destroyed, and Ace coughed up blood and looked in the direction of white beard, opened his mouth, and his hands fell weakly, Ace, Luffy screamed in pain, and the overlord color broke out again, Saab was also in pain, but he was more sensible, and he punched Luffy with an armed punch, resisting him and immediately fleeing, don't think about it, seeing the white beard saw, the yellow ape and the pheasant shouted loudly, the warring states stared deadly, and the two of them did not dare to paddle again, you deserve to stop Lao Tzu too, seeing Ace dead, white beard, who was in a state of extreme anger, erupted with an extremely terrifying shock force, the force of the concussion seemed to cut through the space, instantly shaking the pheasant and the yellow ape, sweeping away the entire Marin Fando. Click, thundered. In an instant, everyone felt the island shake, twisting from side to side, and a huge roar sounded. The whole of Marin Fando split in half in an instant. Marco, you all listen, the last captain ordered. Whitebeard suppressed his grief, and one of them stood on the other half of the island, shouting, leave here immediately, I am the remnants of the old era, and there is no ship that can carry me in this era. Daddy, Marco, on the other peninsula, endured grief and led the crowd to retreat. Sengoku sighed coldly. Green pheasant yellow ape, you continue to besiege Whitebeard, the others, give me a chase, don't let go of any of them, Golem, warring states, have you forgotten who Lao Tzu is, Lao Tzu is a white bearded man, Whitebeard stood like a mountain at the end of the island, the overlord was fully open, holding Kong Yun to cut and drink, your opponent is Lao Tzu alone, Sengoku shook his head, waved his hand slightly, and signaled the crowd to rush up, he could see that the terminally ill Whitebeard was already at the end of the crossbow, so let's die here, how can the final battle of the legends of the old era lack the testimony of the legends of the new era, a figure appeared on the battlefield out of thin air, and the words swept in all directions, once again shocking everyone, the battlefield was silent again, the demon king, white feather, countless people around the world who watch live broadcasts look at people who suddenly appear with various emotions, but in the emotions, more is curiosity, after all, Bayou is still a newcomer pirate, however, it has caused a sensation in the world again and again, and it has reached the top of the four emperors in just over two months, full of legends. Whoosh, see the white feather appear, the yellow ape shouted terrible, showing what a true speed of God, instantly pulled away and ran to the other edge of the island, the pheasants were confused, Sengoku's face was black, I'm seeing you again, seeing the white feather appear, Smog's face turned black and his heart was weak, he thought of Dusky, who had been snatched away by Bayayu, and he didn't know what happened to the stupid woman, Tina beside her was surprised, have you seen him yet? Oh, yes, Tina heard that your female soldier was snatched away by him, and she didn't dare to say a word, it wasn't like you, I said it, Smog replied stubbornly, he said it but to no avail, Tina looked at Bayou and muttered, he's only 18, and you're in your 30s, and Tina thinks you won't want to catch up with him for the rest of your life, you're not younger than me, Smog yelled inwardly, 
but didn't dare to say it, or he would be beaten. Ah! How did he come? Ghost Island Yamato exclaimed. Since Kaido let Gudo allow Yamato to be free of one of his two demands, Yamato remembered all of Shirawa's information clearly and recognized it at a glance. Quinn was also surprised, it seems that he is the only one, without a crew, not afraid of being besieged by the generals. If he learns boss Kaido, he will die a miserable death. Jack took over and affirmed. Ember said in a deep voice, the spatial teleportation ability allows him to leave at any time, but there is no guarantee that the navy has no limits on his abilities. In short, he did have some impulse to go to Marin Fando alone. Yamata retorted, however, what I see in him is self-confidence that transcends everything. But there is no trace of arrogance, and he will not be in trouble. You know Ahana, the embers didn't think Yamato, who had never been out of the sea, had any insight. Demon King. The Red Inu ignored the dead ace and stared at where Kaba was, his eyes glazed over not knowing what he was thinking. And when there was a lot of discussion around the world, Marin Fando was still Whitebeard who took the lead in speaking. Golem, the Demon King of the New Age, you are entitled to be on a par with me. Sensing the hidden breath of the White Feather, Whitebeard gave him the highest evaluation he thought. Bayayu's eyes lifted slightly and his voice was extremely flat, is it? Let me be juxtaposed with you, who can't even hold a knife, what is there to be proud of? Damn it, it's arrogant. The retreating jaws, Beast and the others glared at each other and cursed far away. Scold me? Looking at Marco and the others, Bayayu said coldly, except for a few people, all of them are incomprehensible. Yes, this. The warring states who had originally seen Bayayu want to say two sentences suddenly shut up, because Whitebeard was furious, little devil. You actually humiliated Lao Tzu's sons in front of Lao Tzu? Do you want to die here? Oh, sorry, Bayayu was immediately sorry, and just as Whitebeard's anger eased, he then said coldly, I didn't finish my previous words, they are all waste. The waste that nibbles on the old. The waste that sucks your blood. The waste that doesn't know how to work hard. The waste that lives all day in the strongest glory of the world in the past. And now, after leaving you, it is a bunch of lingering waste. Hiss. There was an uproar. A series of words in Bayayu's mouth made people's brains buzz and only the two words of waste remained. Everyone was dumbfounded. This young man. It's wild. The girls on the spaceship are also stunned. What is this operation? Did the White Feather mean it? You you. Many members of the Whitebeard Pirates opened their mouths, and many suddenly found that they could not refute Bayayu. Because, in the era when Whitebeard was called the strongest in the world, there were really few people who worked hard to cultivate, and they ate, drank, and played all day to collect protection fees. Marco, Jaws, Bista, and others who could make White Feather look at him more were also silent. Big truth, too hurtful. Tina exclaimed, wow, Tina was handsome to him. Smog, Tina, you're not right. Golem la 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 la. Whitebeard smiled angrily, and his face burst into green tendons. He didn't care if Bayayu was telling the truth, but he would never allow his sons to be humiliated. Lao Tzu has never seen such an arrogant person when he is so old. If you want to anger Lao Tzu, then you have succeeded. Feel Lao Tzu's anger. Chapter 103 Chapter 103 Siege of the Emperor The Demon King shook the world. Yamato awakens to the truth. The whole audience is dead silent. Hundreds of meters apart. When Bayayu's indifferent words fell, and Whitebeard's fearful cloth anger erupted, the two of them instantly cleared the scene. There is only one comment for Whitebeard himself. White Feather, an adventurer who longs for his family. Born in the New World. Whitebeard's country could not afford to pay the heavenly gold and fell into an outlaw island where pirates and traffickers ran rampant, and the country was destroyed and orphaned. Young to see to be a pirate, but has always missed his hometown. He has been sending all kinds of supplies anonymously, and he sent all his treasures to the island, for the rest of his life. And his sons, Bayayu thought that what he had said before was not wrong. The so-called white group is a great old further plus a group of spoiled waste sons. Newgate is so angry. Looking at the white beard of the green tendons, the warring states did not know what to say. Bayayu was not aimed at him, it was really arrogant to everyone. As soon as the Demon King opened his mouth, the warring states also found that there seemed to be no navy. Golem la 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 la. Lao Tzu's sons will not allow anyone to humiliate. Whitebeard laughed angrily and picked up the supreme great rapid knife Kong Yun cut, which was wrapped around the concussive force and the overlord color, and slashed at the white feather. Boom. Hegemonic and seismic, a combination of the two moves, as soon as they appear, will completely shatter a large range of atmosphere. An incomparably exaggerated concussion slashed and destroyed everything, straight to where Bayayu was. This knife is not bad, was it tied by a bunch of waste suns before? Even so, Bayayu still commented indifferently, in Yuyasha Red Lotus. At the same moment, hundreds of meters behind the white feather, the red dog's hand turned into a vicious dog's head, rapidly extending and stretching towards the white feather. Since he was sure that Bayayu had arrived alone, there was no reason for him to let it go. Moreover, the timing of the red dog's choice was just right, Whitebeard's attack range was too large, he thought that Whitefeather teleportation was not easy to dodge, and his attack angle was even more tricky. 
Things are starting to get interesting, it's not in vain. Joining hands with the Emperor, Bayayu was a little interested, and it was worth his shot! Exclamation mark. At this moment, the eyes of many people around the world are wide-eyed. Whitebeard's angry attack on his sons was reasonable, but no one expected that the General Red Dog, who had just killed Ace, would actually target the Four Emperors White Feather. Whitebeard plus Red Dog versus Demon King. The General and the Four Emperors joined forces to besiege and attack one person, which was an unprecedented live broadcast screen, which made countless people hold their breath. Wow, they're bullying people, Perona shouted. The women held their breath, since they had known Bayayu. No matter who the enemy was, they seemed to be at ease. This time, it was the all-out attack of the general and the four emperors. Although they could see Bayayu's unfazed expression, the women subconsciously instructed Athena to store energy. Can he dodge? Sengoku and Karp stared. Whitebeard's blow range was too large, and the red dog was even more angled to sneak behind. Back and forth, at least, they have nowhere to hide, only to choose to resist hard. The demon king is a real monster, otherwise why would I run? The yellow ape in the distance was really awake in the world, and even ran a little farther. He, it's him. Fleeing to the distant ship, Luffy, who had been immersed in the grief of Ace's death, was also awakened by the attack and stared wide-eyed. Color, this abominable demon king is still so arrogant. Thinking of what Bayayu had said to Kira from afar in Chambord, Saab felt angry. From that day on, Saab found that Color was full of interest in White Feather, and all the relevant information newspapers were piled up in the room. Saab cried bitterly late at night. King my bamboo horse is not as good as the handsome man from heaven. Ye aha, see the captain's power to shake the world. On Bayan Island, Anilu and others watched the live broadcast and were also not impressed, and even full of expectations. Why will be the emperor? Practice for a few hundred more years. Bayaksyoji, Hakuba Yamato of Anishim shook hands. In Yamato's memory, Mita's diary is very clear. The angry Bayaksyoji is unstoppable. Moreover, there are many powerful descriptions of Bayaksyoji in Mita's diary, much more than the description of Roger which is enough to show Mita's respect for Whitebeard. Hope Bayayu is okay. Let the angry Bayaksyoji personally prove the truth of the diary. If the diaries were all true, Yamato would be able to face her father Kai, who was getting better and better for her. It is the glory of the sea thief to die in battle. Then, Edward Newgate, if you can die at my hands, be proud. In the midst of countless people's breathless breath, Bayayu moved, raised his left hand, and then shook his fist and exploded. Punch hard, boom. The grid-breaking grade armed color burst out from Bayayu's left hand and wrapped around the top overlord color, instantly turning into a domineering torrent, forming an indestructible wall like a tsunami, and forming a shockwave that penetrated the sky. S-H-H-H. At the same time, Bayayu's right hand grasped the handle of the sword around his waist, and he instantly drew his sword against the attacking red dog. This law of cause and effect will be 100% taken by an empty hand. Kneel down for me, thundered. The domineering torrent will destroy Whitebeard's hegemonic blow with one blow, and run to Whitebeard without diminished. This scene. Countless people held their breath. Is this armed color? The Whitebeard, who usually did not change his look in the face of the collapse of the earth, had a shocked look on his face at this moment. The overlord color on it is indeed stronger than his. But it is also within cognition, but the attacking armed color is too amazing, beyond all the cognition of Whitebeard. At the moment when the attack was destroyed by White Feather's domineering spirit, Whitebeard felt a fatal danger. Drink. The range of the domineering torrent was too large, and Whitebeard did not want to release all the domineering and concussive forces, and his fists came out in unison. Shake the earth. Whitebeard's strongest blow. In an instant, the atmosphere in front of them was completely shattered, and even the space rippled, catching up with the domineering torrent that struck. The other side. What? The red dog was even more difficult to hide the color of the string. At the moment when the white feather drew his sword, he found himself uncontrollably slamming the move back, and irresistibly, he ran towards Bayayu. Can't struggle, domineering, capable, all out of control, running empty-handed towards Bayayu, as if he were deliberately going to die. Not good. On the other side, he threw out his strongest double fists, and just after touching the white beard of the white feather's domineering torrent, he once again sensed the fatal crisis. This domineering torrent, he couldn't break it. Boom. Countless people were shocked. After the powerful torrent of white beard it blows out of white feather's punch, it destroys white beard's attack from a distance and then breaks Whitebeard's powerful blow in a short distance, drowning it. After the domineering torrent overwhelmed Whitebeard, it presented a devastating blow towards the rear. The peninsula that had been split by Whitebeard instantly disintegrated into pieces. Boom boom. The aftermath swept by, and the waves of air that were set off flew over Marco and the others. The domineering torrent rushes to the sea. Boom. The terrifying roar exploded all the way making too many people in the headquarters hiss their eardrums. More than ten seconds later, the roar gradually became muffled, and the whole Marin Fando, countless people around the world watching the live broadcast, 
Everywhere is dead silent, hiss, aerial view of the spaceship at a high altitude, with a seemingly serious punch from Bay Ayana. The peninsula that had been split before completely disappeared. It also pushes the sea ahead into a vast abyss that has not been closed for a long time, growing to the point of no end in sight, as if running through the entire ocean. One punch. Peninsula crushed. The sea opens the abyss. Daddy, stabilizing his body, Marco, who flew up, cried out in pain, and many people also returned to God. That's right. What about Whitebeard? The whole peninsula was shattered with the sea. But what about the white-bearded man who was drowned by the domineering torrent? Looking at the narrow abyss of the sea that is still difficult to close in front of them, countless people inhaled cool air. Whether or not Whitebeard is okay, the least certainty is that Whitebeard is not on the island. Sure, it's falling into the sea. And the biggest possibility is that when the sea is thrown into the abyss, Whitebeard also falls into the deep sea. What happens if a seriously injured person with the ability is thrown into the deep sea? At the thought of this possibility, even the warring states fell silent. They expended their forces to take down Whitebeard, and as for Ace, it was just a small role. But in the end, the Navy killed a small character Ace, and then was robbed of his head by Whitefeather. But, Sengoku now who has the heart to care whether Whitebeard is dead or not, he looks at where the Red Dog is, and completely loses his voice. How can that be? What happened? Hey, I didn't read that right. What a terrible demon king. With a shift of the overhead picture of the spaceship, when they came to the location of the Red Dog, countless people were stunned. Saw, so, Bayou's left hand which released a domineering torrent, slowly lowered, while the knife in his right hand was followed by the red dog on his knees. Red dog, Sarkarski. At this moment, he was kneeling on the ground with his legs, holding Bayou's knife with his bare hands. Just like the big mother photo of the other day, she also knelt down with a shocked face and raised her hand to take the knife. No bleeding, no death. However, such a seemingly simple and harmless knife made the naval elite collectively shocked and numb. Recall that before. Bay are you counterattacked under the siege of the four emperors and the general? It seems just. Raise your left hand slightly, draw your knife with your right hand, and it's over. Raise your hand and draw your knife. Bring the emperor to his knees. Golem, usually a terrible yellow ape. At this moment, he was eager to give birth to two more legs and immediately leave Marin Fando. It was horrible. It seemed to be the same every day. Every time he encountered Bay are you, the yellow ape found that Bay are you was more and more incomprehensible to him. The pheasant exclaimed impossible. How could his breath be? Although the scene where Bayou just drew his sword made the red dog powerless to kneel was very shocking to the pheasant, Bayou's breath shocked the pheasant even more. Think back to a little over a month ago. When he first encountered Bayou, King Yan clearly remembered that Bayou's breath was only at the rank of Lieutenant General, that is, his ability was too terrifying. And now, the breath of white feathers alone made his scalp tingle. What an amazing physique, incomprehensible armed color carp is also dignified. In carp's perception, the white feather at this moment is like a sun, burning the furnace of the world. Without having to try, Carp knew that White Feather's physique was far superior to everyone else's. What made Carp most unbelievable was the armed color that appeared when White Feather suppressed White Beard with one punch. The Overlord color is still in the range of understanding, but there is no trace of dispersion in such a massive amount of armed color. Even two attacks of White Beard can be easily destroyed at once, and no matter how much you resist you can't resist it. Is that really armed? Carp felt that his worldview had collapsed, and he practiced armed colors for decades, looking at armed color records all over the world. He had thought that his armed color was already the apex of the apex, but today he knew that there was a person like Bayou who was braver than him. My mum, on the island of ghosts, Quinn's eyes glazed over, and his fat flesh began to furrow. He's not a human. He is definitely not a human, and anyone who suppresses white beard with just one punch scares me to death. Also, why did that great general Red Dog, kneel down to take the knife. The previous aunt is also, what is this special ability? Ember and Jack were silent. The thoughts of their brains are also blank, and they can't return to God. Baik Syoji, he was suppressed by a single punch, is he so weak? The diary clearly states, the furious Baik Syoji is unstoppable. Yamato muttered, I meet her. No, are Mitsuki Mita's diaries all fake? Is it fake that I have been deceived for so many years? If Baiyu is here, he must sigh. Yai was a little silly before. But now he is stupid and simple. If Kaido was here, he must have cried with joy. Because for the first time in many years, Yamato did not call himself Mita. I see it again. Watching the live broadcast, Hawkeye's voice contained infinite emotion. That knife is desirable. Don't look at 100% will be taken by the white blade with empty hands. There is no attack, but in the eyes of the swordsman. It's like a pilgrimage. A knife will kneel the emperor, and the enemy will kneel down and take the sword with both hands. Just like seeing the swordsman on pilgrimage which is enough to make countless swordsmen's hearts boil and look forward to it. Ah, uh, that's handsome. The girls on the spaceship were excited and turned into fanatical fans. Before, I only watched the picture of Bayou's knife aunt kneeling live, but now I saw the general kneeling, which was a feeling that was simply too exciting. This little devil, Marin Fando, 
Inside the ancient city of Pan, the five old stars watched the broadcast of the spaceship and were also shocked and angry. Send Michael and them over at once, and this time we must not let him go. Michael, one of CP Zero's strongest shields, is also the deputy chief of CP Zero. Fruit ability, extremely powerful. This knife is interesting. The bull-headed five old stars gently wiped the knife, and the essence in their eyes shone, feeling a wave of war intent brewing. The curly-haired five old stars suddenly spoke. You won't want to go to, will you? It's better not to do it, it doesn't make sense. No, it's just an instinctive reaction as a swordsman the bald five old stars converged on their will to fight. He escaped the attack. Chapter 104 Chapter 104 3 7 Marshall sees in an instant. How did Titch kneel so skillfully? Exclamation mark. The demon king struck. The whole battlefield was silent. Until, the shocked and shocked voice of the great general Akatsuki rang out. Why do I kneel down to pick up your knife? My ability and domineering spirit are out of control. What have you done? In such a scene, the red dog would rather be hacked to death by a knife from the white feather, which can only prove that he is just like this. But this uncontrollable kneeling down to take the knife, he felt only a deep shame. Sneak up on me, looking at the red dog kneeling on the ground. Bayou stepped on his head and said plainly, How does this foot feel? Abominable. This kind of stepping on the demon king like a dog. The eyes of the red dog are scarlet. What do you have to be angry about? Bayou was very puzzled by the resentment of the red dog. I just insulted your dignity. Aren't you used to it? After all, the dignity of your navy has long been fed to the dogs by the Draco, and the Draco are always trampling on your personality, tarnishing your justice, and staining your soul and the dogs can't stand it. The general was so humiliated that Sengoku was trying to summon Kapu to rush over with him. But Bayou's words made him freeze in place. The Akatsuki's roar of resentment suddenly stopped, and he looked at Hakuba in a trance. Many navies were even more confused, and they suddenly felt that Bayou was right. Tina's eyes widened. Oops, Tina was handsome again. Smog. Tina, you're really wrong. Bayou withdrew his feet and calmly spoke. Got it? A sentence once again awakened Akatsuki, and finally gritted his teeth. As a person, you must strengthen your position. No matter how much you say, you can't deny that you are a thief. Are you afraid of me? So prepare to run away, right? Bayou did not pay any more attention to the red dog, but instead looked into the distance. There, where the three new seven martial seas are located. Ever since Bayou struck, the three of them had been stunned in the same place, all frightened and stupid, and their hearts were full of fear. Bad. Escape. Charles, the bone king who slaughtered a country, saw Bayou look over and ran away in fear. Blood Shadow Flash. Eric. The vampire of the two vampire islands, also changed his face greatly, directly turned into a blood shadow, and fled from here in a flash. The gaze of the white feathers, they could not be clearer, it was the gaze of the dead man. Too slow, Bayou raised his shallow blow and quickly slashed two knives into the distance. Whoosh, the red dog, feeling that he had recovered, hurriedly retreated hundreds of meters, pulled away from the distance, and looked cloudy and uncertain. A silver lining. The two slashes were compressed into two silk lines by the white feathers, and the slash of the sword condensed into silk increased several times in speed, instantly crossing the void. Poof! Countless people were shocked again. Bayou just raised his knife and swung it twice. Too many people didn't even see the slash, only to feel a flash of cold light, and the Bone King Charles and the Vampire Eric were cut off their legs. Uh, Charles the Bone King and Eric the Vampire fell to the ground, wailing in pain and fear in their eyes. Good swordsmanship, Hawkeye, watching the live broadcast, suddenly shouted which startled sand crocodiles, Cavendish and others. Riley was also amazed. The two slashes of the white feather, just watching the live broadcast cannot see at all. This shows that he has completely condensed the slash into a line, and the line breaks the surface, which can increase the speed and cutting force of the slash by several times or even tens of times. Aniru asked in amazement, so can you two do that? Can't. Hawkeye was succinct and excited, and he found a new way forward and it was the nearest way forward. Velocity. Cutting force. If he could also condense the sword into silk, the steel balloon would be cut in two. Condensing slashing is a compulsory course for all great swordsmen, and it is too difficult to condense the slash into a silk thread. Riley shook his head, the memory existing only in the legend. And in Marin Fando, it's a quick run. In the dead silence of the whole audience again, Bayou did not stop and looked up at a glimmer of light in the distance. At this moment, the yellow ape held his breath, because, the Aurora sword how Scott, as a bear iron aurora fruit ability, his way of moving is not much different from his, it is all in the light. Now only a little shimmer remains. This shows that the aurora sword how Scott has run a long way, so can you kill the other party remotely? You must escape from the hands of the demon king, aurora sword how. The yellow ape prayed inwardly. If the aurora sword how could run away, then the yellow ape would definitely be able to run away, and he would be able to face you much calmer in the future. If you can't run away, thinking of this. The yellow ape felt very nervous. Pray constantly. S-H-H-H. Bayou calmly closed the knife, and then drew the sword in an instant, 
and its sonorous sound made countless people stare at the past. Come back and kneel down and confess. Only know the chowder that kills women, question mark. Hearing these words, the red dog who looked uncertain in the distance also held his breath. Usually like a mad dog. He was very calm at the moment, and he wanted to see clearly what Bayou's ability to make people kneel was, and whether there were any other restrictions. Whoosh, under the surprise of countless people. When Bayou drew his sword, a brilliant light flew in from a distance. How could it be? Stop, don't kill me. The brilliant Aurora landed on the ground, converging into the figure of the Aurora sword house Scott, and then ran to the white feather with shock and fear. A meter or two away from the white feather, kneel on the ground and take the knife with both hands. Bayou's knife at this moment was not just for people to pick up the knife, but also attached to its own attack. Housegut, the Aurora sword who knelt down to receive the knife, was directly smashed by Bayou's knife and shattered half of his body, and he was on the verge of death in an instant. Sizzle. The red dog also felt a tingling in his scalp and subconsciously pulled away again. And this scene once again made the world lose its voice, and countless people were stunned. Buzz. A dark space vortex appeared, directly engulfing the three ruined seven martial seas. Blood fruit. Bone bone fruit. Aurora fruit. Hands on. Once again, the whole of Marin Fando fell into dead silence. Or rather, from the moment Bayou appeared, the shocked expressions of the navy elite soldiers did not stop. Suppress the four emperors with one punch. A knife to the knees of the general. Three swords in an instant. Three seven martial seas. If this is not a big wave, some people have found one of the most shocking things. Tina exclaimed. Oh my god. Tina was so shocked. He hadn't left the same place until now. What? Tina's exclamation caused a series of exclamations, which once again triggered the inner vibrations of countless people. The demon king didn't even go into place. It can only be said that Bayou does not need it or that the direction and position of the station are too clever, and there is no need to move around too much. Smog subconsciously said, I see, his ability should need to stand still. Words just came out. Many navies looked at the idiot, making Smog's face full of embarrassment and irritation. Tina was also disgusted. You have a problem with your thinking? No, Tina thinks there is a problem with your IQ. At the moment, Smog was depressed. He said no problem. Why did everyone question him? The more impossible it is, the more likely it is to be the truth isn't it? There are flaws. Sengoku and Lieutenant General Jiru glanced at each other and found the flaw in the white feather. The other flaws did not say, let's say that Bayou stabbed the Emperor to kneel, and they saw some flaws. But this flaw is not big, not small, maybe Bayou has not noticed. But sometimes, even a little flaw will be infinitely magnified. There's no rush, CP0 will be here soon, let them try. After seeing part of Bayou's strength, the warring states did not want the navy to make fearless sacrifices. Except for the generals and the three generals, everyone immediately retreated. The warring states directly waved their hands, signaling the generals to retreat with a naval elite. Whether Bayou stopped or not, they must retreat. The whole of Marin Fando had become a ruin, and the peninsula where Whitebeard had split was destroyed by White Feather, and after a while CP0 would have to fight here, and if he did not retreat, the elite soldiers would definitely die. On Marco's side, he roared and told Joyce and the others to leave as soon as possible, while he continued to look for Daddy himself. And Bayou, who really did not intercept any of the parties, once again looked into a corner. The third time we met, I still like your gift, Tiki. Titch? Which Titch? He was wandering the surface of the sea and flying to investigate where Whitebeard was located. Thief ha ha ha. There was silence in the corner for a moment, and just as White Feather was trying to force out, Blackbeard Titch finally laughed and walked out. Lafayette, Badgers, and Van Orca followed suit. Poison Q was killed by Bayou before, and the advancing city was emptied by Bayou. So far, there are only four Blackbeard pirates, and they are miserable and miserable. Titch. Marco roared in anger. It was because of this guy that Sachi was dead, Ace was dead, and now even Daddy was probably dead. Thief ha ha ha, Captain Marco hasn't been seen for a long time, though. Let me meet Lord Demon King first. After saying that, Blackbeard Titch ignored Marco, suppressed his anger and fear in his heart, and then laughed. Thief ha ha ha. The third time to meet, Lord Demon King. Since you like it, I'll give you a few more bumps. Boom boom. In the consternation of everyone, the black bearded ditch was tens of meters away from the white feather, and without hesitation, he knelt down directly to the white feather and prostrated his head continuously. The same is true of Lafayette et al. But many people wonder, how can it look so skilled? Titch and others, damn, we've been kneeling three times in a row today, of course we're skilled. Winter this guy. Seeing this scene, Marco wanted to laugh and feel even more uncomfortable. The thick and well-behaved sons who once only knelt as fathers are now traitors who kneel when they meet others, and they are really blind at first. Seeing that Bayou did not intercept the retreat of the navy elite soldiers, Sengoku was relieved at the same time, but also looked at Tiki in surprise. This guy has been hiding in the corner, is there a conspiracy? But Magellan's side only informed Titch to go in a circle at the entrance of the city, and did not make any mistakes. Tiki, looking at the kneeling black beard, 
Bei Ayu suddenly said, I want to see a performance, can you show it to me, Lord Demon King, please say. Blackbeard Titch was worried. The first time I encountered White Feather, I was in the windless belt, and because I didn't want to overturn the boat, I directly knelt down. The second time I pushed into the entrance of the city, I didn't want to waste time, and I directly knelt down to avoid trouble, and this time Neil. Blackbeard Titch was really a little frightened, and he trembled when he knelt down, afraid that the White Feather would cut it. What is his ability? Damn it, it's mine, it's all mine. Blackbeard was filled with jealousy. He had just seen the scene, how shocking and terrifying it was to punch in four knives, even if he got the shock fruit and the double fruit was in his body, he absolutely could not resist Bei Ayu, how willing he was. Let me think, Bei Ayu thought about it for a moment, and the whole Marin Fando atmosphere is extremely strange, and the people watching the live broadcast are very confused. Right now, on top of both sides of the war participating in the war, pirate side, only Marco is still flying to find Whitebeard. Everyone else has been driven away, and only a little shadow has been left with a boat. Navy side, under the tough attitude of the warring states. The Red Dog also took over, commanding the navies to pack up their things and board the ship, evacuating Marin Fando, who was only half of the ruins left. The two sides gave up because of the white feathers, but many people still felt that the atmosphere was becoming more and more depressed. It was as if it were the rhythm before some kind of grand storm. It was there, Sengoku glanced up into the sky. The loss of the white feathers sight shielding and covering. The invisible spaceship, was also perceived by Sengoku and others. Red Inu said in a deep voice, there are a lot of crew members on the ship, this is the only chance, don't, be sure not to do this. The yellow ape repeatedly refused. He did not want to anger Bei Ayu. The pheasant scratched his hair. Don't argue, he can hear it. Our purpose has been achieved, and enough people have died today. Stop. The warring states did not open their mouths after the elite naval soldiers withdrew. He was much more relaxed. Right now, just wait for CP0 to arrive. But what the warring states did not know was that his choice and action made the five old stars watching the live broadcast scold the mother one after another. Damn the warring states, hurry up and beat up the demon king together, you percent times times percent yen times at. But the telephone worm cannot get through, after the warring states received the news that CP0 was coming, it directly destroyed the telephone worm, that is, did not want to listen to the blind command of the five old stars, otherwise the pit was the navy. Anyway, the warring states are ready to step down with how the five old stars scold. I think so. In Tiki's bunch on form, Bei Ayu raised his hand slightly. White Feather transferred a random prisoner of the propellant city ability who had previously been transferred to the gravity space, and once again transferred it out and passed out and landed in front of Blackbeard. This, it turns out that the prisoners have all been put into some special alien space. Looking at the prisoner costumes pushing into the city, Blackbeard scolded inwardly, but still did not understand what Bei Ayu was going to do. What did the prisoner ask him to do? Did he do the exercise live? Chapter 105 Chapter 105 The Navy's top brass is on fire, and the red-haired pirates come to die? Exclamation mark. Just when Tiki was thinking about it, Bei Ayu pointed to the prisoners who had advanced into the city. He's a capable person, and I don't know what abilities. As Bei Ayu spoke, he saw Blackbeard's expression freeze and casually said, So, let's get started. Show me how to become a double fruit ability. Otherwise, Die. Wow, Sengoku and the others were shocked and looked at the ugly-faced Blackbeard. Can he become a double fruit power person? However, as soon as he thought of Bei Ayu's various abilities, as well as the previous pirate female emperor's control of cold ice, the warring states frowned. What do you say? Blackbeard was instantly furious. Black smoke rose all over his body, and his eyes were blood red as he looked at Bei Ayu. Can you read your mind when you see and smell? You already knew my plan didn't you? That's why you're teasing me three times in a row. Think what you will. Bei Ayu didn't bother to care about what Blackbeard's brain supplement was. He's still here for a reason. 1. Wait for CP0 when waiting for the previous Sengoku call. 2. See if the red-haired Shank's face is big enough. As for Blackbeard, just a tool to pass the time while waiting for the process and getting bored. Blackbeard's third option, just the right CP0 or redhead to arrive. White Feather doesn't bother to take care of him and secretly escapes. It depends on his luck, Captain. The three of them were extremely depressed, expecting Blackbeard to amplify the move. Three times in the row of humiliation to Neil, did not even dare to refute a voice, is a man cannot stand it. Shut me up. Blackbeard roared. If he could kill Bei Ayu, he would have already shot it. But as soon as he thought of the scene where Bei Ayu had suppressed the Emperor with one punch and one knife before, Blackbeard felt full of fear. Inadequate. His strength is not enough. Facing Bei Ayu, even if he added the shock fruit was not strong enough. He Blackbeard Titch must find a stronger one. In Blackbeard's breath, Bei Ayu said plainly, die, or gamble, thief ha ha ha, since Lord Demon Kings don't know what this ability is, then I'll gamble. People's dreams don't end, thief ha ha ha. Unwilling to die here, Blackbeard laughed and made a decision, 
so his hands began to fill with black smoke, full of ominousness. Secretly calculating the distance and strength of Bayu, Blackbeard still suppressed the desire to shoot, and then looked at the comatose prisoner Demon King who was in a coma and said that he did not know what the prisoner's ability was, and Blackbeard could only believe that he had not deceived him. Whether it is brilliant or silent, it depends on this time, hoping that it is not a garbage ability. Lao Tzu plugged everything, hand over your abilities. Black smoke killed prisoners, a black cloth shrouded Blackbeard and prisoners, and countless people did not know why. Sengoku and the others were also uncertain, can he really do it? Then again, why can badgers also take the fruit? Because of this, Bayu asked Titch to perform. In the original book, in the battle for burned fruit, badgers carries a burden and a knife, and he is very confident to take the fruit of Luffy and Sub. Is it just because of the knife and the things in the bag? Just let me see. The white feathers decontent level saw and smelled the color, directly through the black cloth and black smoke, and sensed the movement inside. Moments later, Bayu couldn't help but shake his head. That's the way it is, this method. That's fabulous. Blackbeard's reason for being used by Whitefeather as a tool man not to kill for the time being added another one. One is interested, two, attracts firepower, and three, helps Bayu collect fruit abilities. I don't really know what his abilities are. Maybe there are surprises. White Feather is looking forward to Blackbeard's performance. For now. He didn't want Titch's second ability to be too weak, otherwise he wouldn't be worthy of being a tool man, and how to collect fruit for him in the future. Huh? Bayou glanced into the distance, is it finally here? It's too slow. In the distant sea, the shadow of a ship appeared, attracting the attention of everyone. The bow resembles a red dragon, and the pirate flag is a one-eyed skull flag with two knives crossed. It was them. On the spaceship, Hancock was surprised for a moment and then said proudly, blame them for coming at the wrong time, they are dead, the concubine said. Kia flashed his eyes, brother Bayu wants to destroy another fourth emperor? No, it doesn't do us any good to destroy them, Robin glanced at the other's profile. There are not many people, not many territory. Assets are almost non-existent, that is, there are good contacts. Killing them, for Bayu, cannot get anything but a little prestige, pure waste of time. With a puzzled look, Cornis asked in a rare way. Then why did they die? Oh Navy. Nami pointed to the location of Sengoku and the others. You see, there are some high-level people left in the Navy, and they must have held a stomach fire and have nowhere to go. As Han Cook put it, the timing of the other party's arrival was too bad. But anyone who came before the White Feather appeared would not be targeted by the Warring States and others. Red Forth, the red-haired ship of the Four Emperors. Warring States squinted his eyes slightly, and it was really where there was a big thing with this guy. Red-haired pirates. Because it belongs to the rare full-time elite mode. The balance of strength is also known as the Iron Wall Pirate Regiment. Captain Shanks, red-haired, like Bucky, became an intern for Roger Pirates at the age of nine. After the era of the Sea Thief began, while looking for the crew, he wandered around the world, gambled his left arm on the new era, and entered the new world in six years to ascend to the top of the four emperors. Bounty, 448.9 million berry. Stop, stop me, don't fight anymore. Give me a face, I, oh. What's the situation? As if he had just woken up and heard Beckman say that Marin Fando had arrived, the red-haired Shanks immediately came to the bow of the ship and shouted. Beckman's face darkened, and his voice was low, there is nothing to stop and stop fighting, don't you just give me a face, give me a domineering point, you forgot it? Cough, don't care about these details. The red-haired Shanks scratched his head, then looked at the half-empty Marin Fando with a slight shock, Oh, it's over? So what did I rush here without even sleeping? Beckman was also surprised, we have been rushing did not watch the live broadcast, should have been terminated by him. Moreover, there is something wrong with the atmosphere. Beckman suddenly felt very depressed, so he looked at the whole battlefield and analyzed the situation. It's him. The red-haired Shanks saw the white feather and couldn't help but get serious. Demon King White Feather. From the beginning of appreciation, to recognition, and then to the current disapproval. Shanks's mental journey changes quickly, because White Feather's growth is also too fast, and it has turned the world upside down. Nika has not yet awakened. This world, at present, still needs to be balanced. But there can be no new locks pirates. The redhead whispered inside, and then he found another problem. That is, Bayu ignored him. It was as if his red hair was a dispensable guy, which made him feel very embarrassed. Bayu, on the other hand, kept looking at a large piece of black cloth, as if something big was going to happen there. Can, can tell me. Still unable to find the father, Marco finally couldn't resist asking. He had driven all the crew away before, and he was looking for it alone, afraid that if he died, no one would look for his father, so he did not ask Bayu. But now, he really couldn't find it, and he couldn't go to the sea, even if he died, he would have to die to understand. Old times completely disappeared into this world. Without waiting for Marco to finish, Bayu said something casually. Disappeared completely. Was it beaten to ashes? Not in this world. Is it time to go to Yellow Springs? Thinking back to Bayu's terrible punch, Marco opened his mouth and burst into tears, but his father was still dead 
and he couldn't even be buried. Nothing more was said. Marco looked deeply at the white feathers in grief, turned and flew away. The crowd did not stop it, and they felt that another legend had been ended, especially the contemporaries Carp and the Warring States. It suddenly felt that these older generations should really retire. A few seconds later, Sengoku shouted coldly, Red-haired Shanks, what are you doing here? Do you want to be left here? When all the elite soldiers were evacuated, only the top brass of the navy was left, and if they were looking for trouble, they would be looking for death. Because White Feather changed the trajectory. The battlefield of the original trajectory was extremely fierce, with heavy casualties, and many prisoners in the advancing city and the remnants of the White Regiment rebelled, and the warring states allowed the Red Hair to pretend. But now, after the prisoners of the city did not advance into rebellion, the remnants of the White Regiment all left, and the elite naval troops withdrew. The warring states did not need to worry about the casualties of soldiers, and the trop level was in full swing. And because of the appearance of Bay Ayu, many generals felt that there was nowhere to vent various reasons for Emperor's Red Red. Come and give the head. The Red Dog, who was full of grievances, once again fiercely proposed, I will stop the Red Heads and you will go round up and kill the others and leave them here. The marshal hopes that you can also shoot, it is best to fight a quick decision. Sengoku plus Karp plus three generals plus many lieutenant generals. If they really had all their strength to strike, the red-haired pirates would have ended here today. Okay, all shots. Sengoku is also a sharp look, the eye you can leave at any time, and there is CP0 to deal with, so he does not want to care. But Red Reds, if even this opportunity had to be given up, the warring states would look down on themselves. Not good. Without finding the other Navy elite soldiers and the people of the White Regiment, Beckman, who had already seen clearly, suddenly jumped in his heart. It should be that the Demon King caused an accident. We are not here. Leave it alone. Evacuate immediately. Boo. Without waiting for the warring states to strike, the first to strike was Gerpu, who stomped on the ground and rushed to the Redhead. The warring states were overjoyed. This old guy finally knows to contribute which saves a lot of trouble. Shanks, you stinky little devil actually tricked Luffy into becoming a pirate, and the old man has put up with you for a long time. Ace's death has always depressed Carp's heart, and at this moment he can vent, you all give the old man to go forward to the city to repent. Fistbone meteorite. Boom. A punch shattered the atmosphere, forming a shockwave that penetrated the sky, and rushed forward with great force. This is trouble. Looking at the rushing Carp, as well as the lieutenant general, the general, the marshal, Shanks was also a little confused. How can this happen? hurry up the ship. It was completely different from what was expected. According to the expectation, when he arrived, it should be the most tragic ending. He believed that at that time the navy was tired, and even if it was not said, the warring states would choose to end the war. But now, naval heroes and marshals are on board, and the navy is on fire. They're here to give heads. S-H-H-H. Shanks drew his sword in an instant, and the top overlord color wrapped around and slashed down. Boom. An incomparably blazing and terrifying slash collided with Kapu's fist and exploded directly in the air setting off a storm-like wave of air. The entire ship was pushed hundreds of meters sideways by the fierce air waves in an instant, rolling up pieces of waves. Ice Age, 8 feet Kyungu Jade, Meteor Volcano, the Buddha's light shines. Under the solemnity of the red-haired shanks and others, the pheasant's plug gas burst from a distance, quickly freezing a sea, and the Red Fourth stopped. The sky was filled with light and volcanic bullets and shock waves, like a rain of bullets. Boom. The little sister on the spaceship broadcast the picture very intimately. When the live broadcast screen was seen, countless people around the world were stunned again, and the navy exploded and besieged the red-haired regiment. How many meanings? The red-haired pirates come to their deaths. When Shanks's ship was frozen and could not break through the endless ice for a short time, everyone seemed to see the demise of the red-haired pirates. If nothing else, the red-haired pirates will be wiped out today. Bayou shook his head slightly and didn't care. He didn't care about himself hanging high and even became a melon eater. Even the White Feathers could not see any hope of the current red-haired pirate group escaping at present. The whole sea was frozen. What did the red-haired pirates take to resist the warring states plus Carp plus the three generals plus the lieutenant generals at the same time, and then continue to escape safely? That's impossible, unless someone stops the navy. Chapter 106 Chapter 106 Stark Natural Disaster My Blackbeard has become a tool of the Demon King. Presently, Carp vs. Redhead, Sengok vs. Beckman. The three generals plus lieutenant generals bombarded the red-haired pirate Redfirth, and Jesus and the others could not effectively protect the frozen ship. But a dozen seconds, the burning naval high command blinded all the members of the red-haired pirate regiment, and they were completely unprepared. Click, bang, just a few minutes, pirate ship smashed, with the red furs being destroyed by the red dog and the yellow ape, when one pirate gate after another fell on the ice, it once again made countless people watching the live broadcast hold their breath. The ship shattered, the sea freezes, there is no escape, unless all the red-haired pirates can fly to the sky. Don't try to escape from this frozen sea. Drink. The red-haired shanks exploded with all the overlord color, 
and with a full blow force forced the cap that was very strong, turned his head and shouted, Beckman. Faced with this desperate situation, Shanks was anxious in his heart, and he urgently needed Beckman's advice at this moment. Otherwise, when the three generals and lieutenant generals have finished solving the crew, he and Beckman will be absolutely powerless to resist. Dot I can't help it. A shockwave of hard resistance, Beckman wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth, and there was some bitterness in his eyes. Although he is known by many as the first wise man of pirates, any conspiracy and trickery is useless in the face of absolute strength. This kind of scene, heaven and sea were all blocked, and Beckman could not find any possibility of escape. Hearing Beckman's words and seeing Cap chasing after him again, Shanks gritted his teeth and burst out. Warring states, enough people have died in this war, give me a face, stop. Oh, who do you think you are? Why does the old man give you face? The warring states gave a cold drink, and the demon king did not say a word when he appeared, and finally chose an armistice. After all, the strength of the demon king was too demonic to be caught. But the red-haired Shanks? How can the battle of the trapped beasts talk about face? Seeing this, Bayayu smiled lightly. Another day you can find a face fruit for Shanks to taste. Bayayu definitely has a face fruit, but the name is different. In a word, others will listen, that belongs to the ability of Ding's mind control class. Just change the name. Leave it all for the old man. The warring states once again turned into a big Buddha, and the golden giant Buddha made Beckman feel harsh and bitter. The other party was almost 80 years old, and he was still so brave. Contemporaneous pirate disease wounds wounded. The warring states Kapu is not injured or sick, the navy is indeed very nourishing. Bayayu also praised it. Warring states implementation. The justice of King's Landing. Trickler domineering plus runner and fruit esper species big Buddha form. It can transform into a huge golden Buddha statue and can emit powerful shock waves. But its real effect is to give people the strength, wisdom and spirit like the Buddha, and to combine the huge body like a great Buddha with a clever mind and perfect skills, so that they can become the ultimate person with both mental and physical skills. Therefore, the warring states have no weakness in strength. Only such a warring state is the old opponent of Whitebeard, and because the warring states like to use their brains and do not like to use their hands, they are affectionately called by Whitebeard, Old Yinbi. Thief ha ha ha, thief ha 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 ha, Lao Tzu is right, witness it. The perfect performance that shakes the world. The black cloth was torn open, and black smoke filled the air. When Blackbeard Titch walked out laughing wildly, the battle on the frozen sea came to an abrupt end. Bai looked slightly sideways, it is actually this ability. It seems that his luck is still good. Boom. The sky. The clouds rolling. The thunder raging, as if the end had come. Boom. Another peninsula that was shattered by Whitebeard was now widely cracked. Whoops. In the distance, large areas of ice shattered, and pieces of waves boiled, forming a grand tsunami. Woohoo. In the distance, a tornado that carried through heaven and earth shattered the ice surface. There are also blizzards, and sandstorms are raging everywhere in the surrounding area. Boom. Rumble. Half of the island in the cracked state suddenly erupted into thick black smoke and began to erupt into hot magma. Sizzle. The spacecraft directly opened the energy shield, and as the broadcast came out of the picture, the world was shocked. The overhead shot, around Marin Fando, is actually presented with apocalyptic scenes, which is really amazing. It's this guy who never sleeps. Looking at the laughing black bearded itch, the red-haired Shanks suddenly felt a faint pain in his left eye. More than twenty years ago, as an intern in Roger Pirates, he met the Whitebeard Pirates and met Blackbeard Titch. For Tiki, who never sleeps, the redhead is curious and unpleasant. Afterward, he also encountered Tiki, who fought with him and injured his left eye. The One Piece flag was also changed to a three-striped symbol, and you can imagine how impressed Tick was on him. The Aya was right. He actually became a double fruit ability, is this ability. Warring states did not pay any more attention to Beckman, looking at the scene of the end of the world around him, as if thinking of something. He did not shrink his pupils, and suddenly looked up. Sensing something. The crowd looked up one after another. Boom. The dark clouds in the sky were suddenly swept away by something, as if some worldly beast was about to rush out. The next moment, the clouds in the sky were completely shaken apart by the air current, and a meteorite with a diameter of hundreds of meters suddenly descended. The sky is dark. Meteorite natural disaster. Thief ha ha ha. See, this is Lao Tzu's current power. The power that can destroy the world even more than the shock fruit. Blackbeard was full of wild laughter, as if he had spurted out all the restraints that had been forced to kneel three times by Bayayu before, and his body was refreshed. The dark fruit's black hole gravity plus touch seal ability plus absorption damage, etc., looks really good. However, these abilities could not satisfy Blackbeard Titch, and he also lacked stronger attack methods, so he listed the shock fruit as the first target. But, after seeing Bayayu's unreasonable ability to suppress the Emperor with one punch and one knife, Blackbeard felt that the shock fruit was not strong enough. What's more, at present, Whitebeard is nowhere to be found. Even if he wants to, there is no chance, Blackbeard is powerless to be angry. Here's your chance. Bayayu was idle and bored, 
let him perform how to become a double fruit ability, did not want to die Titch gambled a bit. For now, seems to have gambled correctly. Thief ha ha ha, I really want to thank you, Lord Demon King. Blackbeard Titch's eyes inexplicably looked at the white feathers that were still light and cloudy. As Whitebeard puts it, Tick's biggest weakness, being too conceited and rash in character. Really? Bayayu glanced at the changing looking Tiki, looked at the meteorite falling in the sky and drew his sword in an instant. Whoops. An incomparably terrifying slash turned into a tornado storm, sweeping into the air in an instant, and Blackbeard Titch only felt a flower in front of him. Boom. The meteorite, which was hundreds of meters in size, suffered a devastating blow, and under Titch's breath, it completely turned into debris. Ignoring the debris, Bayayu looked at Blackbeard calmly, since you want to thank me, don't you want to give a gift? Titch, still kowtowing? It's the fourth time. Blackbeard Titch's mood was almost out of control and he almost ran away on the spot. At this moment, it was his most proud and excited moment, but Bayayu's words undoubtedly poured cold water on him and woke him up. No way. Having just acquired a new ability, and before it has time to develop it, it will certainly not be the opponent of the Demon King. Blackbeard Titch thought to himself, gritting his teeth and laughing again, Thief ha ha ha, get such a powerful ability, how can one be enough? I will give you ten. Boom boom. Blackbeard knelt down and prostrated his head repeatedly. The fourth prostration was made and the prostration became more and more skilled. Captain, Abominable, Lafayette, Badgers and Van Orca almost thought against each other, when will the captain get up and stand up? This guy, because of various natural disasters, the battlefield of the temporary strike, Shanks stared solemnly at Fetch on his knees on the island. Obviously gained such amazing strength, but still prostrated. So stoic, there will be a great plan. As Blackbeard knelt down and prostrated his head, the natural disasters around him began to slowly dissipate. Seeing this, the expression of the yellow ape was exaggerated. Oh yo, I really became a double fruit ability, Blackbeard Marshal Dietrich, you are so terrible. What was the ability just now? The pheasant frowned slightly, as if a lot of abilities were randomly placed, and he didn't see what abilities were for a moment. Thinking back to the volcano erupting on the island before, the red dog was full of murderous intent. The destructive power is so powerful, or double fruit, he is too dangerous. Absolutely cannot let him go. Can't let go. Warring states bowed his head slightly, and then said in a deep voice, the scene just now, 500 years ago. There was a similar case. The places where the mighty one passed were thunderstorms and hailstorms, winds, snowstorms, tsunamis, earthquakes, droughts, volcanic meteorites, and all kinds of disasters. The crowd listened in a trance, what a collection of abilities this is. With a killing intent flashing in his eyes, Sengok let out a deep breath, this fruit first appeared at that time because it can manipulate and create various natural disasters, so it is called, Fruit of Natural Disaster, as the name suggests. The Fruit of Natural Disasters is the terrible ability to bring endless natural disasters to the world, and the destructive power is extremely frightening. The Warring States then added, similar to this kind of fruit that has not appeared for hundreds of years, except for the world government, the external demon fruit Atlas will not be recorded. If it weren't for the fact that more than 30 years ago, I caught someone with the ability to eat the fruit of the natural disaster and throw it into the city of advance, I don't know. Well, all the generals looked at the lightly windy demon king Bayayu for a moment. It was Bayayu who moved the air to advance the city, and then threw the natural disaster ability to Blackbeard to make him a double fruit ability. The Demon King is too good at playing. Everyone looked at Bayayu's expression and did not find any negative emotions, but it was full of bad taste. Look what I do, the red-haired pirates are going to run away, Bayayu said casually. The generals looked back in shock and immediately chased after the red-haired pirate regiment. The fruit of natural disasters, scold. After the alert eyes prostrated their heads, they were still secretly experiencing the ability of the incomparably powerful black beard, and the white feather was speechless. The fruits of natural disasters are indeed destructive and the damage is indeed very powerful. But in Bayayu's view, natural disasters were also used to clean up the creeps, and had no impact on many top strong people. Which shock fruit has a lot of damage on the attached fist and weapon? Teacher Kai, what kind of shit natural disaster? Tickle Lao Tzu. But Blackbeard was a tool man after all, and Bayayu said with encouragement and indifference, your method of seizing the fruit is very good, I like it. Send a fruit every month, if you can't do it, then die. Blackbeard's heart sank. He knew that if Bayayu didn't kill him, he was definitely not teasing him, or wanting him to be a tool man. As a result, he was really used as a tool to collect demon fruits. One a month. It is difficult for the world government to do it, and there are really not many people who are capable. Blackbeard subconsciously said, Is it okay to have one in two months? Good. S. Sloppy. Looking at Bayayu nodded casually. Blackbeard wanted to give himself a slap, just why didn't he say half a year, but at the moment there was no room for bargaining. Blackbeard scolded the mother inwardly, but his face was full of smiles. Thief ha ha ha. Lord Demon King, it is no problem to send you fruit. But the sea is too big, even if I find it, 
it will be difficult to send it to you at the agreed time. Then save it, find someone to send the devil fruit every six months, and one less will not work. Bayayu you said, his hands bloomed with a glimmer, and without waiting for Tiki and the others to react, he crossed them. Space imprint, so I can teleport to your side at any time! Exclamation mark. Titch is furious, but he still endured, and now he is shooting, no doubt looking for death. He could only leave first, and then find a way to remove the space mark, and then increase his strength to form a force, otherwise he would be afraid wherever he went in the future. Let's roll. White Feather waved his hand slightly. Just a tool man, don't add drama to yourself. Thinking of the killing intent of Sengoku and others before him, Blackbeard immediately led the people away and fled at the speed of light. Boom. Taking advantage of the diversion of attention by Sengoku and others, the red-haired pirate regiment that had secretly fled was once again caught up by the navy. They are you looked up, is it finally here? Chapter 107 Chapter 107 The Demon King has worked hard, and the deputy commander of CP0 has led the team to come to the congratulatory gift. It's coming really slowly. A strong person entered the White Feather's perceptual range, and the White Feather suddenly returned to the spaceship. As soon as he got on the boat, they are you casually turned off the live broadcast and entered various gentle towns. After a few moments of when, they are you said, the war is over and the people who come next may have special abilities, so you should leave now with your energy shield. Husband, you must be careful. Han Cook threw himself into the White Feather's arms, and yay, the concubine was hugged again. Nami had a black line, you are enough, don't delay the White Feather time. Little sister, Big Cow, Bay you couldn't help but laugh. Nami this is the lack of words, Big Cow does not seem to be a derogatory word, looking at the women, Bay you whispered again, okay, you go back to Daughter Island first, and when I am done, take you to the New World to train, and if you grow well, you will start again. Great. The women were pleasantly surprised, many of them had not yet been to the new world. Robin was a little surprised. Do you want to go now? What about Daughter Island? Han Cook was confirmed to join Hakaba, and the seven martial seas would definitely be cancelled, and Daughter Island would be in trouble. Concubines are fearless. Han Cook was not afraid of the navy coming to besiege Daughter Island, and in any case, the Demon King's woman could not. Stussy has found some traces of the Golden Lion, and the fluttering fruit is in place and he has moved Daughter Island to the new world. Bayayu was still obsessed with the fluttering fruit, because, he can't fly until now. It can't be said that it can't fly, it can't stand in the sky out of thin air. What moon steps, elementalization, angel wings, island clouds, etc. are not enough. Where there is momentum that stands in the sky out of thin air. Let's leave. After the women left in the spaceship, Bayayu returned to the broken Marin Fando. At the highest point, sit cross-legged. Peach Rabbit didn't show up today. Did Tina leave too? And Ane. You couldn't run away. Bayayu closed his eyes slightly, and the live broadcast also came to an abrupt end with the departure of a spaceship, which made countless people around the world sigh with pity. Is Whitebeard really dead? Red-haired pirate Unity Bureau? Why does Blackbeard double fruit? What exactly is the ability of White Feather? It is to watch a live broadcast, which makes countless people full of depression in their hearts, and they are anxious. By an island, seeing the live broadcast closed, recalling the last scene of the Red-haired pirate regiment being besieged by the Naval High Command. Riley sighed, Shanks, alas, he had thought that Shanks' sudden arrival on the battlefield might clash with White Feather, after all, the redhead wanted to balance, but unexpectedly, Bayayu had not yet taken care of Shanks, and was targeted by the navy, either way, Riley couldn't see the full ending of the redhead pirates, so two consecutive four emperors are going to fall, right, Clockdale's vision of Whitebeard's high probability of death is also complicated, Category said suddenly, redhead Shanks, not necessarily, heck, that's right, He's probably locked up. Do Flamingo smiled. No, I mean, there's a chance that the red haired pirates could get out of there safely. Category's words stunned everyone. Hawkeye said coolly, Reason. Surrounded by the full force of the entire Navy high level, Hawkeye could not see any hope of victory for the redhead. How to leave? Our Charlotte intelligence capabilities are the first on the pirate side. After a slight mention, Category continued, I have received by chance that the redhead has gone to the Holy Land alone, or after he became the fourth emperor but I am not very sure. If you're sure, maybe the redhead has been there more than once, but it's not clear why. What the? Could it be said? The crowd was slightly silent. Marin Fando. Just as there was much discussion around the world, above the frozen sea, when the red-haired pirate group was in a desperate situation, there was a sudden loud cry. Warring states stop. When I heard the sound, I saw five people in white suits and masks flying rapidly with moon steps. You geese stop me too. After the CP0, the leader, looked at the red dog and others who were still shooting and suddenly drank coldly, all the navies, stop me immediately, what the, the generals were motionless, the red-haired shanks and the others immediately took the opportunity to pull away, gasping for breath, everyone was more or less wounded, and the ice was stained red by the blood of many people, half dead, Beckman walked over to shanks with a low look and said the result, I see, looking at the corpses around him, 
Shanks held his hand deadly, and as a result he could only grit his teeth and swallow. If he hadn't insisted on coming here to stop the war, there would have been no casualties, which made him feel very remorseful. The other side. The warring states have not yet spoken. Red Dog looked at the 5CP0S with a look of wanting to eat people, full of anger. Stop. Give us some more time. The red-haired pirate regiment will be wiped out. You let us stop? This is the order of the five old stars. You have the opinion to ask yourself. Led by CP0 Apathy replied. Bullshit commands. The warring states are all full of fire, and the second four emperors are about to be destroyed. What can be more important than this? I need to know the whole content of the order, as well as the formalities. Sengoku asked coldly. See for yourself. Throwing a document to the warring states, CP0, the leader, looked at the white feather on the high ground, and suddenly snorted coldly, sure enough, haven't you left yet, are you waiting for us? It's arrogant. You are. Michael, right? Carp asked with a black face, his red hair was beating vigorously, and suddenly stopped being uncomfortable. Michael? The generals were stunned. CP0 Deputy Commander-in-Chief, also one of the strongest shields, has no less power than that of a naval marshal, and even in terms of administrative rank, it is even higher than the warring state's half rank. What are you trying to say? Michael didn't have a good look on Carp and the others either. CP and the Navy are not dealing with each other, especially CP0, and he does not need to show any kind of emotional intelligence such as friendliness. Carp snapped his nose and said, I want to remind you, find yourself a coffin first and then go find Bay Ayu. Unbridled, the four CP0 captains behind Michael glared at Cap. The yellow ape made an exaggerated expression. Ah, arrogant? You guys are so terrible. The pheasant narrowed his eyes slightly. Is it just the five of you? It's not enough. Four craps that are only raw. The red dog scolded directly, and even wanted to punch the meteor volcano. Three times a day. The first time, before he could take down Whitebeard, he was robbed of his head by White Feather. The second time, Bay Ayu suppressed him with a knife, and the scene was extremely humiliating. The third time, I had to take down the red hair, but I stopped fighting. After three consecutive stings, Akatsuki felt like he was going crazy. What a redhead, your face is so big. After reading the document of the warring states, his face was extremely ugly and he said, let's go. There is only one sentence on the document, stop the siege of the red-haired pirates, let them go, and deal with the aftermath of the war. Go. Seeing this, Shanks did not say anything and directly took people away. The ship was destroyed, and the red-haired people also immediately ran away, ran to the distance, broke through the ice, and fled into the sea. Marshal, seeing the red-haired pirate regiment fleeing, the generals were full of reluctance. You know, the chance of the warring states plus Kapu plus the three generals plus the generals shooting together, and the opportunity to strike together is very small. Next, there is no next time. Next time there must be a general named Yellow Ape or Pheasant or even a lieutenant general called a naval hero paddling happily. It's a command. After the warring states finished speaking, he turned around and was about to leave. Michael then said, you need to cooperate with me to take down the white feather. Is there a warrant? Scram. The warring states resisted the urge to beat people and left with the generals. Malayan Fando is currently an empty island, and when Lieutenant General Jeru evacuated, he even took various things with him, including the corpses of the navy. Only white feathers remain on the island. Bayayu was still planning the day when he would recover and awaken, restore the island, build a branch here, hold a banquet, and so on. Deputy Chief, they. It doesn't matter. A CP0 captain tried to force two sentences but was directly interrupted by Michael disdainfully. So many strong people, even a little devil can't take it, let the navy waste, see our strength. Dot. The warring states and others who have not gone far are not deaf, and they are suddenly angry, but the crowd got used to it. Sometimes even the CP0 captain dares to yell at the warring states, not to mention the CP0 deputy chief. The pheasant scratched his hair, Allah, let's stay away, in case they die, what if the above blames us for not helping? Kizan is right. Let's go and buy them a few coffins. The yellow ape hurriedly answered the call. The rest of the generals were also not optimistic about Michael's 5 CP0S. If Bay Ayu had been taken down so easily, they would have been on board together long ago. But if Bay Ayu's teleportation is not limited, it is doomed to do useless work. Bay Ayu wants to go. They run over to make jokes. Oh, let's go. Michael ignored the taunts of the navy and walked towards White Feather with four CP0 captains. Not hurried, not slow. It seems that he is not afraid of White Feather's running at all. However, Michael was also making gestures in secret, as if he wanted to prepare something, not in a hurry. Is the gift giver coming? White Feather sat on the high ground of the ruined Marin Fando and opened his eyes and didn't do it in the first place. The only thing that could make Bay Ayu pay attention now was a strong person who was at the same level as him and had the ability to near concept. Are they strong? As long as the domineering is not as good as Bay Ayu, no matter how strong the ability is, it is not enough to see. In front of the Michael Five, Bay Ayu seemed to be too domineering, even if he had the conceptual ability. He was not worthy of Bayayu's jealousy, and even surprised a few points. 
five capable people, that is, five fruits were placed in front of Bei Ayu, and he was left to choose. Five old stars, Lord Demon King has worked hard, we specially sent a congratulatory gift. Shot, as he walked through the ice and ascended to the half remaining Marin Fando, Michael shouted, ban the boundary. At this moment, one of the CP0 hands pressed on the ground, and the next moment a brilliant light enveloped the entire island. Bei Ayu glanced slightly sideways. The boundary that prevents the enemy from fleeing. Dead virus. A CP0 body burst out a stream of dark red poisonous mist, sweeping towards the entire enclave. Aura of weakness. A CP0's body was purified with an aura that illuminated the entire Marin Fando. Oh, you can't run away. Another CP0 was full of sneers. The fruit of the enchantment awakens and can bring an island. Completely banned. Even those with space abilities cannot escape for a short time. The fruit of the virus awakens. The deadly death virus is commonly touched to death. Even if it is as strong as the Emperor, it will fall into a state of physical paralysis. If too much contact, at least it will be unconscious, and leave a permanent and incurable serious disease. It's just a pity that Ren's weak fruit didn't awaken. Otherwise, under the aura of weakness, not only is your strength and will, but also your domineering spirit will fall into decline. That's it. The ability combination is okay, but it is not a very powerful fruit, and Bei Ayu is a little disappointed. What he wanted to see was the top Superman lineage. Esper species and so on. Bei Ayu chose to ignore it and looked at Michael, who seemed to be in a position to win, hoping that his ability would be powerful. Michael, who had not yet done anything, felt that everything was under control and sneered, Now do you understand? I've brought the four of them to punish you on purpose, and that's it, Demon King. Bei Ayu was speechless. Is this guy sure he's CP0 Vice President, arrogant as a barking dog, and his face is full of demented villains? Rush, the CP0 that had previously explained the ability disappeared out of thin air and instantly came to the side of the white feather. No need for the deputy chief. I'm a flash fruit ability, and when you've been hit by the virus and fallen into a weak state, let me use your most proud teleportation method to solve you. Are they all so arrogant? It didn't look like people who can achieve great things, and Bayaya was very suspicious of the five old stars' blindness before sending them. The boundaries are also worthy of me. Where did you see me poisoned and weak? Rubbish. Under the shock of the flashed CP0 look, Bei Ayu brazenly shot. The flash boosted nerve reaction speed did not react, and Bei Ayu grabbed his neck, playing teleportation in front of me. Who gave you the courage? Archangel Sword. Chapter 108. Chapter 108. Esper species Blazing Angel arrived. Whitebeard. He's really dead. Click. With force in his hand, Hakuba directly broke the neck of CP0, the flash fruit ability. As soon as the black light flashed, the flashed CP0 was thrown into the undead prison. The demon fruit energy did not leave at the moment of death of the capable one, and it would take a few minutes. Therefore, killing CP0 and throwing it in, the energy can only escape from prison. Judgment of the Holy Light, Archangel Sword. At this moment, the whole sky lit up. A brilliant golden light of extreme range condensed into a light saber, and it rushed towards the white feather with great dazzling intent. Boom. The Ayu punched out, directly shattering the incoming shining light saber. A terrifying attack swept through the island crashed into the junction again, and eventually raged everywhere within the enchantment. Bang bang bang, rumble, junction, virus, and weakness of the three CP0 were shocked by the spilled attack, crashed into the junction and smashed into the rubble. Michael, fly in the sky. Ah, CP0 Deputy Chief, it is as terrible as legend. A few kilometers away, the warring states and others left while inspecting the battle situation. When the boundary rose, the roar resounded, and Michael soared into the air, all the generals stared away. Really? It's too remarkable. The yellow ape was even more terrifying, and his expression was exaggerated. This ability is really scaring the old man to death. Red Dog looked cold and fierce. No matter how strong the ability is, it depends on who the user is. Those arrogant CP0s are all waste. Allah. The arrogance in the eyes of all five of them is overflowing. Too arrogant. Defeat is bound to take place. The pheasant also marveled at Michael's abilities, but was very disapproving of the five. Whitebeard has no arrogance in the face of White Feather. Where are the faces of the five CP0s? Sengoku said in a deep voice, Cap, Michael's ability, what do you think? Poof, what can I see? He's going to heaven soon. Cap laughed and burst into tears. Michael's ability reminded him of the mythical paradise, if there really was. I don't know if Ace would be the Marin Fando. Within the boundary, Michael flew and said in a cold voice, I am really amazed. You are not poisoned, let alone weak. Even, killing Bane, who can teleport in a second. Shattered my holy light verdict with one punch. Sigh. Bei Ayu did not pay attention, but looked at Michael flying in the sky with great interest. This is a top Esper species ability that is not recorded in the demon fruit atlas that is not recorded outside. But Bei Ayu recognized it. Because Doflamingo had said this to him, and Bei Ayu was very interested. Animal lineage, human fruit Esper species blazing angel form. Looking at Michael's white wings, white feather spat out the name. Really, 
Great. This top mythical Esper species fruit ability, from the first sight of Bay Ayu, decided to strip it out and give it to the sister. Miss Angel, Yides. But the top Esper species that was so perfect for the girl was actually eaten by this guy, and Bay Ayu looked a little cold. Run. Suddenly, as if he saw something, Carp dragged the warring states and ran away, shouting to the generals, Don't think about it, how fast to run, everyone runs. What the? The generals were astonished. However, everyone still trusted Carp very much, and immediately accelerated to escape and the yellow ape disappeared in a flash. The other side. Michael waved again at the virus CP0 people, flew high in the air, and drank coldly. White feather, don't think you. A thought blossoms. At the moment, there is silence. Only four small, emoticonistic little toy soldiers landed on the ground. Flash, weakness, virus, enchantment, esper species blazing angel, five fruits easy to get. Bayayu stood up and stretched out a lazy waist, and looked at the fleeing warring states and others. What to run? Now I have no interest in you at all. The blazing angel fruit drives. Bayayu's mood was not generally good. Coupled with the fact that the other four fruits have good abilities, and the tool person who strives to collect fruits, Tiki, Bayayu's mood is even better, and he didn't come in vain today. A bunch of idiots. Looking at Michael's 4 cp 0 s turned into toys, Whitefeather disdained it. Even before he knew his ability, he dared to run to him and pretend. It's just a matter of finding death. Flowers plus childlike fun. Since the white feather domineering has reached the top or broken the grid, there has been no one who can resist. The five old stars are very good people. Coupled with the flash fruit ability thrown into the immortal prison, the five are all ability people, and Bayayu praised it. The world government sent five of them for sure for its own reasons, and indeed all of them were targeted. What is this called? This is to send warmth, to send five demon fruits to Bayayu. Warring states. Tasting the sweetness, before the white feather disappeared, the voice spread far away with the sight and smell. Go back and tell the five old stars. I am most afraid of conceptual abilities such as time and space, and it is best to let them send these capable people to arrest me. Believe you ghost. There must be other reasons. The warring states and others who ran with only a little back shadow were full of solemnity. They didn't bother to say anything about Bay Ayu at all. They were still running wildly at the moment. He's gone. A golden light condensed from a distance, and the yellow ape landed on the ground and looked into the distance, with a strange expression. I saw from a distance that he disappeared with four toys. Words. When did Marin Fando have a strange toy soldier like dress Rosa? What toys? The crowd was stunned. Warring states looked back and found that there was indeed no figure of Bay Ayu, and looked at Kapu, who was still dignified. You foresaw the future before? What did you see? Just shouted let's run. Questions in exchange for Carp's silence. As if realizing something serious, the crowd waited for Carp to return to God. A few minutes later, Carp's voice was a little dry. Don't you think about why the red-haired pirates ran away? Sengoku's pupils narrowed, and he was surprised. No, how did we let them go? The generals were shocked. They had no reason to let go of the red-haired pirate regiment. Look at the file in your hand. Carp pointed to Sengoku's hand. Warring states flipped through the documents, and after seeing the order, he felt that his head was about to explode. Who gave me this document? How I don't remember. Listen to the words of the warring states. Look at the confusion of the generals. Kapu inexplicably felt a chill go straight into his soul and said solemnly, You only remember a CP0 in your mind now, right? The crowd nodded. They only remember CP0, a flash fruit ability who was thrown into prison without turning into a toy. But that's not right. Didn't the five old stars only send that one CP0, and many details in the middle did not match the number? Karp said in a deep voice. To be honest, I forgot all about it, only the memory of those few seconds of foreseeing the future remains. In those seconds, I saw a CP0 flying in the sky and shouting. Then they all turned into toys and fell to the ground. As for who they were, when they came, and how they came, I don't remember anything but my first reaction at that time was desperately trying to escape. His memory clearance. Warring states looked back and calculated the distance, and said in a deep voice, that is to say, they sent me an order to release the red-haired pirate regiment turn around and attack Bay Ayu, directly turning into a toy, and we have lost the memory of them, this fruit, fruit of childish fun, the three will open their mouths at the same time, and then feel the scalp tingle, Tong Fun Fruit said that it is not strong, and the powerful domineering spirit can be defended, but it depends on who uses it, if you give the fruit of childlike fun to Carp to eat, with his strength and armed color, who can stand it, equally, the white feather has a childlike fruit, and it is still necessary to kneel when it encounters anyone, Carp nodded, then shook his head again, not all right, in the few seconds I saw, Bay Ayu didn't move, and it was hundreds of meters away from the other CP0S. Fruit awakening? That's all the people can think. However, at this point, Bay Ayu was even more terrifying, plus other abilities. What would they fight? Thinking of this, the yellow ape looked at the side with a strange expression. Brother Sarkarski, the strength of the demon king, what do you think? Don't talk to me. The red dog's face was full of blackening. He was also asked how he looked. How he looked was irresistible 
and he was invincible who was not afraid of being besieged by the strong, at the very least, the current naval headquarters had no way to take Bay Ayu at all, and could only be slaughtered by him, all right, the situation is very clear, and in the future it will be a war between the demon king and the world government, our navy, the warring states didn't say much and the general's hearts were full of heaviness. How long has it been since their navy became a background board? After the warring states and others left, Bayou appeared out of thin air and muttered, it was actually remembered by Kapu for those few seconds, is this a weakness of the childlike fruit? No, it can only be said that it is the particularity of foreseeing the future, and domineering is always the ability to restrain fruits. By an island, after checking on the spaceship to make sure that the girls had not encountered any situation, and then directly teleporting to here in the space jump, Bayou found that the crew members were discussing in the main hall. Captain, you're back. When the crowd saw Bayou, they immediately gathered round, and they had many questions. The reason why I was in no hurry to leave was because I knew it is possible for the White Feather to teleport back directly. So wait, Whitebeard is dead, the red haired pirates have been let go by the five old stars, and Blackbeard Titch has double fruits because of his special physique. He will become the fourth emperor, and he is also my tool man. After saying it in one breath, Many people were stunned. Bayayu walked on a high place and sat down, looking at the crowd. Is there any problem? Anira knew how to raise his hand and speak. What is a tool man? Whoops. Simply put, white work does not pay, and unimportant people who are disposed of at any time after work are like tools. Do Flamingo was well versed in this, explaining. Many people suddenly realized the reason why the cook captain didn't kill Blackbeard was because he wanted him to do some dirty work and then dispose of it. Tiki. How pathetic you are. Listening to the red-haired pirates being released by the five old stars, Riley was silent for a moment, and then heard that Whitebeard was dead, and he was extremely surprised. I thought you would. I didn't expect it. Hawkeye also said coolly, I also thought you threw him into prison after falling into the sea, ready to fool him into joining. But unexpectedly, you killed him directly, which was really unexpected. A lot of people are nodding, as we all know. The captain cares a lot about the little sister, but he also likes to take the little brother, after all. Conquering and dominating the world cannot rely on the little sister alone. Hear this, Bayou opened his mouth very seriously, how many times have I said it, I will not be fooled, I have always attracted people with sincerity and personality charm. The captain is right. Many people drank in unison, ignoring the twitching Riley and Hawkeye eyes that twitched out of the corners of their eyes, Bayou recalled a moment and sighed, at that time, the white beard was seriously injured and dying, and it was the weakest time, after all, it was the legend of the old times, a little respect a full punch, then died, now that I think about it, I should have restored him to his peak state and throwed a few more punches, but alas, many people's eyes widened, is this the truth, it's just too cruel to be right, Hawkeye's cold expression couldn't hold back, you don't need to explain, it will hit young people, the corners of everyone's eyes twitched, it always feels like you've been hit too, the world's number one swordsman, no bones left, Clockdale's heart is complicated, no, Whitebeard is in the prison of immortality, but he is dead, Bayou is telling the truth, as a capable person, Whitebeard was seriously injured and dying, and various dark injuries recurred, and he was seriously punched by Bayou and fell into the deep sea. If only it didn't die, the white feather was amazed. When Bayou saw and sensed where Whitebeard was, his body had been swept hundreds of miles away by the whirlpool of the seabed, and it was not noticed. Therefore, Bayou transferred his body into the undead prison. Will he be resurrected? It's not possible to recover from death now, I'll talk about it later. I don't know who asked, Bayou replied casually. Later, let's say, now, let Whitebeard sleep. Resurrection coins? There were only 99. Bayou will only be used on his own sister, or the resurrection coin will be used on the plot beauty who can make him win the lottery, and others will not be necessary. After the death recovery matures, Bayou will resurrect several powerful workers. What Bayou was concerned about now was how many capable people were found among the hundreds of thousands of prisoners in Advance City. Hope there are surprises. Chapter 109 Chapter 109 The fourth emperor Bucky cried out for help. Demon King Brother Ability Update What happened to the four criminals? Bayou asked. Rain Noha Ara immediately replied, Captain, those who have the ability to advance the city have all been selected, exactly 160. Hundreds of thousands of prisoners only to find more than a hundred capable people, Bayou felt that the difference in this number was also too great. Moreover, the world cannot simply be counted by percentage, because there are too many ordinary people, and these prisoners are not ordinary people, and those who can go to sea and be caught have more or less some skills. Her or explained seriously, there are actually very few demon fruit abilities, but too many people have focused their attention on those with abilities. There are more than a hundred people who can advance the city, all of which have been accumulated by the navy for decades. As for those who were detained very early, they died long ago and spread the word, White Featherhead. The East Sea is so big, but it regards the demon fruit as a legend, because a large part of the capable people run to the Great Root, the capable people attract attention, 
and the attention is focused on them, resulting in a lot of looks. Those transactions that can not move dozens or hundreds of trades, that is called artificial fruit. Let's go, let's go with me, and if you want to and change the ability, just say, Bai Yi led the crowd to the gravity space. As soon as he entered, Bai Yi saw many capable people lying down, except for a few, all of them were mutilated and placed on the ground in a neat manner, with the sign of fruit ability standing on their bodies. Uncle Riley, save me, save me, I don't want to die. Bucky was one of several capable people who had not been maimed, and when he saw Riley coming, he immediately burst into tears. He missed home, missed the home on the basement floor of the city. Think about the talent in the city of Push, the conversation is super good, he likes it there, and here, kill without a word. As far as Bucky saw, there were quite a few guys who were not capable and shouted and resisted, and were beaten to death by her, Aru and Dan Iru and others. It's horrible. As soon as he saw the corpses on the ground in the distance, Bucky trembled and shouted at Riley again, Uncle Riley, save me, I'm Bucky. Roger Pirates in turn, Shanks's best friend, Bucky, the red-haired sworn enemy Bucky. I know it's you. Riley was full of black lines. He had felt some headaches before, so he didn't take care of Bucky. Anyway, he wouldn't be okay with him looking at it, and incidentally sharpened his base. But decades have passed since this guy is still so timid and afraid of things, and he has no strength. Thinking of this, Riley used to start educating Bucky. Before Emperor Bucky, Bayou shook his head and smiled. Don't look at Bucky as a funny character, but Bucky and Titch are real pirates, but the two are not the same nature. Immediately, Bayou glanced at the signs that stood up one by one. Rain no her. Aru said, there are two natural departments, 58 superhuman departments, and the rest are animal systems, but it is surprising that there are two Esper species and four ancient species. That's not bad. Ryder and a few other white feathers could see it and they had been thrown into the undead prison before and were not here. Nature, rain fruit, mercury fruit, esper species, wind sickle fusion form, nine-tailed fox form. The esper species, the nine-tailed fox, is the ability of the five big and three thick women who were joined by the original trajectory of the Blackbeard Pirate Regiment. Bayou glanced at it again and said calmly, I want the rain fruit and the nine-tailed fox fruit, so you can pick the rest. If two people choose the same one, it's up to the winner. I didn't find any near-concept superhuman abilities, and Bayou was not interested in the natural system and Esper species, both for the girls. The remaining Espers, the white feathers were too ugly, and the mercury felt too poisonous. Michael's Esper species Blazing Angel remained, and the rest of the four CP0 captains along with the ability to strip out white feathers. Captain, I want flash fruit after looking around. Cavendish still thought the CP0 captain's flash was good, because the captain's teleportation, fast wine. Fast handsomeness, fast envy. Seeing that no one was fighting with Cavendish, Bayou threw it to him, flash fruit, which can increase the speed of movement, attack speed, nerve response and everything else. If you are awakened, you can teleport at will within a certain range, but the consumption should not be small, and remember to temper your body more in the future. I will work hard to cultivate the captain. Cavendish was a little excited, just to be able to teleport, and the captain was a role model. As long as no one hits me, then no one can beat me. As the saying goes, seeing Cavendish eating the fruit with a bitter face, Bayou said, your second personality, do you need me to transfer it? No, you don't have to. Cavendish laughed, the second personality can still be a tool man. Then tell him not to hurt his own people, or he will die. Bayou didn't care much. Riley and Hawkeye weren't interested in abilities, and the rest were picking. But, Aniru and Sand Crocodile, what do you two do together? And the nature system is not enough for you to wave. The crowd secretly despised a glance and the two of them commented with great interest as if they had not seen it. Yee aha, little leopard, listen to me, don't choose the animal department, just choose the Superman line, that cross-dressing fruit is good, you can wear women to seduce the five old stars. Golem ha ha ha, les Luchi. the glowing fruit is very good, in fact he has another name, everyone fruit esper species like god form, listen to me, it is right. Mentally retarded, Luke scolded darkly and came to an esper species, but saw that Doflamingo was also there. Hey. I just took a look and wasn't interested in this. Doflamingo did take one look and go, a fruit that did not fit his fighting style. Animals train, ferret by fruit, esper species, sickle fusion form. Looking at the standing sign, Luchi muttered, can control storm attacks, can fly freely, and greatly increases speed and slash power. Does anyone want this? Luchi shouted that no one answered, so he led the prisoner to Bayou's side. Kid also arrives with Kira, who is holding a prisoner. In addition to Brook, Kaku. Gabra and several others also arrived with prisoners. Captain, I want Mercury, Juice Jismugi, or choose the nature department. Rose Perot also mentions a capable person, reject the fruit, reject everything. Bone and Bone Fruit. Krypton chose the abilities of Charles, the former Seven Marshal Sea Bone King. Bone Fruit allows him to graft the skills he developed in Cookie Fruit and become more powerful. The great blessing of the steaming fruit also opened his mouth. 
blood and blood fruit. Okay, white feather head. The total of each choice is much better than before. Rain Noha returned around again, shook his head and sighed. It's a pity, there is no fruit I want. Hey hey, I haven't found a better fit. Which one do you want? Moriah asked casually. Transparent fruit. Really fake? Hearing the transparent fruit, Moriah suddenly remembered his dead subordinates, hurriedly threw away his thoughts, and coughed softly. No accident, in the hands of the captain. In the hands of the captain? Rain Noha was suddenly shocked and hurriedly walked over. Without waiting for him to speak, Bayou frowned slightly. Give me a reason why you want to eat the transparent fruit. The crowd watched. I didn't expect Trainee Her, a murderous guy, to be so upset inside. Even play transparent? Rain Noha said very directly. I think it's very useful to raid an opponent when it's transparent, and it's also possible to lurk next to your opponent without being detected. Stupid. It was Hawkeye who opened his mouth sharply looking directly at her. Aru, as a swordsman, you don't choose those auxiliary abilities that enhance your combat strength, but choose some side doors and left paths. Hawkeye is right, transparent fruit, you don't have to think about it in this life. Bayou directly refused the request. The crowd also did not understand that the transparent fruit could not hide the sound and smell, and it was completely useless to the strong. It was an obsession I had when I was a child, after all, I was weak and young thinking that I could knock down those who bullied me without being discovered. Looking at the crowd like idiots, Her-Ara couldn't help but explain. At the end, Her-Ara added, I'm not interested in women. One as per species, for ancient species, plus the gate fruit, the strongest CP9 combination in history. Looking at the choice of Luchi Sixsum, Bayou gave a very high valuation. CP9, which is proficient in physical skills, is combined with ancient species and as per species, and then cultivates hard, that is, violent upgrade. Looking at the two kids, Bayou said, Kira chose the electromagnetic fruit. It's a good match for yours. The electricity is not as good as Annie Road, the magnetism is not as good as Kid, but it is convenient to develop electromagnetic force. Look at my super electromagnetic cannon. The rest of the supernovae did not find a more suitable one, so they did not change. The rest of the people don't find the right one, so go out and find it yourself. After looking around, Bayou looked at the Charlotte family's Kartaburi, Do Flamingo especially if you replace it as soon as possible, what is the ability to break? Kaya and Dover are also helpless, don't look at their strength is good, in fact, the fruit is worse than one. Glutinous? Line line? The moves are gorgeous, but the attack power and destructive power are simply unbearable to look at. They are you thought of some ice cube thrown into the undead prison, who wants the Momo fruit of the world destroyer? Momo fruit, can increase the speed, volume, size, etc. of the objects they touch and can also increase their movement speed. Is that all there is to it? After hearing Bayou's introduction, many people felt very disappointed. At first glance it sounds strong. Listen carefully, but they are basically amplified foreign objects, which do not have much effect on personal combat, but they are very suitable for sabotage. It is absolutely impossible to equate destructive power with combat effectiveness. There are too many partial sections. The world destroyer is a waste, and indeed he is famous for all kinds of destruction, not because of combat effectiveness. Her or came to be interested. Momo fruit, if you touch my knife, you should be able to swing my knife tens or hundreds of times faster. I just don't know if I can increase the size of the slash. Interesting. Hawkeye cool. But as a pure swordsman, he did not like fruits. Aniru was curious. Since you can increase your speed, you should be able to increase your strength, domineering, defense, resilience, physical strength, vitality, and so on. Theoretically, superhuman abilities are best suited for concept development. For Aniru's idea, Bayou agreed. However, it is too hard. Not all abilities can be conceptually developed, otherwise the Superman department would have been invincible, and few people present had read likes bears, which was even more difficult. Unless you let the straw hat eat it, turn the Momo fruit into, everyone fruit as per species god of war form. An hour later, after everyone is elected, Bayou is replaced. Dover and Kaya still haven't found the right one, so let's talk about it later. Bayou left behind some people with the ability to understand current affairs, and many of the remaining abilities were deprived by him. It also selected some talents from all walks of life, about a thousand people, and the fruits were all distributed to the entire pirate regiment's strength and background. Captain, what about the rest of the people? Rainher asked. The eyes of the crowd froze slightly. There are many people left, after all, hundreds of thousands of prisoners. Glancing at it, Bayou said plainly, kill all. It is a pity to eat it tastelessly and discard it. This is how Bayou feels about the hundreds of thousands of prisoners left, one by one, but there are a lot of problems and problems, wasting Bayou's time. Ryder, Barrett and a few others were sent to the undead prison by Bayou, and the remaining infinite help prisoners, Bayou did not bother to look again. For example, San Juan Wolf, aside from being a bulky target that wasted grain, Bayou saw no value in him. In addition to the Zero fan team, which is only allowed to join the Imperial rank, 
it has the right to transfer the members and tasks of each fan team, and if there is disagreement, then vote to decide. All the remaining ones are sorted two years later, 13 times, the main and vice captains and seats. Bayou didn't bother to set it, and directly copied the 13th team of the Guardian Court and it was over. The Zero fan team is the fourth general star of the White Feather, but the standard is higher. Pirate Regiment level, Captain Zero Captain Vice Captain Officer. Six levels, simple and straightforward. Of course, these are the grades of the auxiliary ships and the girls are not included in the main ships. Remember, no one can disobey the orders of their superiors unless they are extremely unreasonable. If you don't agree, you can challenge your superiors, and the strong will rise, and the weak will retreat. Bay are you didn't want any team members, pointing at the captain. Since you can't even be the captain, what are you pretending to force you? Yes, captain. In two years, many young people like Kid are ambitious. First take a captain and then say, then challenge the Zero fan team. And finally, just meet the captain. Unless you are crazy to challenge the captain. White Feather turned his head to look at Riley and Hawkeye. Is there anything that gets into your eyes? Riley had seen too many geniuses, and said casually, to put it bluntly, it is too ordinary, not as interesting as Bucky, and Barrett is extremely good. Barrett is really good, Bucky's words. Well, good luck. They I you can only comment like this. Let Bucky cultivate for a while and let it go to see if he can make some movement. Riley also shook his head. Roger chose people on the ship for a reason. Bucky's talent is not worse than Shanks, but it's a pity. Being too keen on treasure and not liking cultivation is Bucky's biggest drawback. Boring. Not seeing the pure swordsman, Hawkeye was not at all interested. Hearing Hawkeye's words, Hakuba said, I know a pure swordsman with great perseverance. You've seen, Sauron. Real man Sauron, don't explain. Just missing is missing, and Bay Ayu didn't feel regret. I don't remember. Hawkeye's answer made Hakuba shudder. And then he remembered that Hawkeye only wanted to fight with Hakuba, and casually swung a knife at Sauron and left. That's it. Bayayu didn't say much either. Forcing Sauron to stay here is pointless. After dealing with the prisoners, let's all go and cultivate. Yes, Captain. Chapter 110. Chapter 110 Kaido's Happy Life. Tina doesn't want to fall into the clutches of the devil. Finish dealing with the little brother's affairs. White Feather didn't go to the immortal prison to see what Ryder, Barrett and the others were and Whitebeard was also sleeping there. Following the trail of the golden lion given by Stussy, one of them went to look for the golden lion, Shiki, soon. Two days passed, according to the high-definition picture analysis broadcast by the spaceship, as well as Bay Ayu's statement, the younger brother Morgans once again ignored the threat of the world government and published a newspaper. Question mark the demon king evacuates the city, question mark. Question mark shocked, the four emperors white feather killed the legend of the old era with one punch, question mark. Question mark shock. Demon King Bay Ayu suppressed the great general Red Dog with one sword. Question mark. Question mark shock forehead. The Navy rounded up the red-haired pirates and was released by the five old stars. Question mark. Question mark the Demon King of the Female Emperor. Question mark. Question mark Blackbeard double fruit ability. Three more died at the hands of the Demon King. Where did the seven martial seas go? Question mark. Question mark the death of CP0 Deputy Director. Question mark. Sizzle. Even if it is live broadcast. It can only be seen in major forces and a few bustling places. After the newspapers swept the world, people who did not understand the specific circumstances of the war at the top were shocked. Various headline parties have attracted the attention of countless people, and a certain kid who plays with fire is not even qualified to mix a title, and a sentence has been carried in the corner. Something is wrong, the good one is Whitebeard and the Battle of the Navy, how come the title is all Demon King? Fuck off, the old lady likes to watch the news of the Demon King, it's too powerful. Hissing. Whitebeard was actually killed by the Demon King's punch. Fake it. Woo ah. Double fruit. Dark plus natural disaster. Hiss. Will this Blackbeard be the next four emperors? The seven martial seas are still abolished. Either join the Demon King or be killed by the Demon King. It's too humiliating. What is CP0? There is much talk around the world. However, many people found out it should have been the largest war between the Navy and the pirates since the era of the Sea Thieves. So it was called the Top War. But... Now it has become a personal performance show of the Demon King Bay Ayu. So what should it be called? At the same time, there are also many people updated the bounty order. And Bay Ayu was paying attention to two people, him and Han Cook. Demon King White Feather, Bounty, 5.55 billion berry. Just over 10 million less than Rogers, 5.564 million berry. Current era, directly surpass Whitebeard and become the highest bounty. As for Dorag, he wasn't a pirate, and Hakuba didn't bother to compare him. However, after Bay Ayu saw the handsome photo of himself on the reward order, he said, it is more than 10 million worse than Roger, and this little mischievous third of the warring states must have done this on purpose. Warring states, misunderstanding, I proposed 10 billion, but the five old stars scolded me all day, it was too difficult. White Feather looked at Hancock again for the bounty. Since the age of 18, 
when he first went to sea, he offered a reward of 80 million to shock the world, and he joined the seven Marshall Seas, and since then the bounty has stopped updating. Until today, after confirming that Hancock joined the White Feather, it was updated again. One Piece to Boy Hancock, Bounty, 180 million berry, directly increased by a billion, although some are not worthy of her current strength, but it is not bad. Bayou did not dwell on these. Although Hancock's current strength is changing day by day, he has not done much, and he can explode, which is purely the power of the double fruit, sweet plus ice control of the ice heart. It's still the first. Blackbeard was the second. As for Bayou's ability, as the ability is displayed more and more, it is not at all what the double fruit and three fruits can judge, and countless people are curious. I love ghosts. Kaido, who came back, looked at the freshly baked newspaper and cried, Woo 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 woo, it's all that damn redhead, Lao Tzu to intercept white beard, shut up your ass, you shit stirring stick, let you pretend, this son was killed by the navy half of the people, happy, woo woo woo, Kaido continued to cry, missing such a top level walk wank Xiao Kaido was ready to cry for three days in a row, Ember suddenly spoke, boss Kaido, the most important thing now is the strength of Bayou, which is very abnormal, ah, uh, for it, Kaido cried, and the brass bell's eyes were full of doubt, abnormal, Quinn shook his moustache and said, of course, he just smashed the white beard attack with the armed color he released, and even drowned the white beard, and the people were gone, scaring people to death. At that time, white beard was just seriously injured and dying, and Lao Tzu could hammer him to death with a stick. At the mention of strength, Teacher Kai's face was full of disbelief. Ember continued, with a random knife, he made the great general Akatsuki kneel. Lao Tzu will try it another day, and he will definitely be able to do it. White smoke was rising from Kaido's nostrils. Jack muttered, three knives slashed three seven martial seas including one of the natural departments, and none of the feet moved. So what? Lao Tzu can hammer 37 martial seas to death with one stick. Kaido blushed and yelled, Where are the 30? You brag less stubborn old cow. The last shout is Yamato, who is getting freer, making Kaido's face black. Wrong. Kaido came back to taste it. What do you mean? Yamato is just that. Even the three loyal old subordinates think that I am not good at Kaido, right? Kaido glared at the audience. Immediately contact Bei Ayu. Lao Tzu will compare with him, and have the ability to fight with Lao Tzu for half a month. If you lose, Lao Tzu's name will be written backwards. Brave cows and cows, not afraid of difficulties. Hearing this, Yamato said, Dokai, you can't beat the Demon King, you can have a snack. Dokai, big and you're done. Kaido's body was full of smoke, and just when the embers three sensed that they were not good enough to want to run, Kaido suddenly smiled, Oh Cluck, well, since Yamato thinks that Lao Tzu can't beat him, then you come and shout father. By what? Yamato glared in disbelief. Kaido's eyes widened even wider. If even Lao Tzu can't beat him, can you beat him? Don't forget the agreement between the two of us. The agreement is to remember the information of the White Feather, win the battle against the White Feather, and if you lose, you will obediently listen to Lao Tzu's words. Can you win? Can't win the fight or not call daddy? Sloppy. Yamato suddenly felt that Kaido was much more shrewd than she was, and still said with a hard mouth, everything is compatible. You can't do it doesn't mean I can't do it, only if I have beaten it. Oh Cluck, anyway, sooner or later you're going to call Lao Tzu's father. After triumphantly speaking, Kaido suddenly cried again, Woo Woo, Lao Tzu's daughter, she actually needs to be defeated by other men to hear her call out to her father. Lao Tzu is too defeated, don't stop Lao Tzu, Lao Tzu is not alive. Yamato was slightly silent, gritted his teeth and turned to leave the hall. The daughter left like this. Kaido's crying suddenly stopped, and he recalled. Did Yamato stop calling himself me to these two days? He sighed and said, at the moment when Bayou punched away the white beard. Watching the live broadcast, Yamato said, is Mitsuki Mita's diary all fake? Then people change. Giggling, it must have been Mita's diary that blew white beard too far, and as a result, Hakuba shattered Yamato's fantasies with one punch, thus suspecting everything Mita said in writing. Speaking of this, Kaido also had a headache. It turns out that Yamato is still too simple, as long as there is no malice towards her. Others will believe what they say, except for Lao Tzu. Don't bother Lao Tzu next. Lao Tzu is going to cultivate. Embers were stunned. Boss Kaido's thinking was really jumping out. How could he suddenly go to cultivation? Is not want to lose to Hakuba. Not at all. White Feather did find something that had fallen between Chambord and the Magic Triangle, but unfortunately there was no shadow of the Golden Lion. It may be that before Bayou came, he left by coincidence. Anyway, it was definitely not the Golden Lion that the Straw Hat Regiment flew. After all, the White Feathers affected too many things, and the Golden Lion certainly did not start to destroy the East Sea Plan, otherwise it would definitely make a big fuss and would not be without news. You're in luck, Golden Lion Shiki. Bayou is not discouraged, so let's find a few more days. If the Golden Lion still wanted to destroy the East China Sea, it would be about the most recent time period. It's still not enough. Bayou counted the demon fruits prepared for the girls, and suddenly found that there were still not enough points. Nature, rain and rain fruits. Esper species, 
nine-tailed fox, blazing angel. There are nearly ten girls without fruit ability, plus ability, only three are not enough. Now I can go around there. White Feather jumps in the direction of the sacred land at the height of the red clay, land. It is also there that you can find many top fruits. Huh? It's her. When I was at the top of the war, I wanted to take it away, but I accidentally forgot what is perceived. Turning his head to look down at a ship passing by, Bay are you suddenly chuckled, obviously I forgot you but touched you again, you can't escape. On the way to Chambord, a naval warship is sailing at a rapid pace, and its highest official position is, Colonel of the Naval Headquarters. At this moment, a man with short silver hair and a cigar said indignantly, you woman, don't go too far. What's wrong? Can't you clean up? The opening is a beautiful woman with long pink hair, purple sunglasses on her hair, a rose red suit set off a tall figure, holding a lady's cigarette in her hand looking heroic and silver-haired man with a black face, I am now half a level higher than you, not your subordinates. No. Before you arrived at the new headquarters, you were still a little branch colonel, and Tina was three levels above you. Pink-haired beauty calmly retorted, Smog. The original trajectory hunted down Luffy, and the world government, in order to cover up its incompetence, gave the credit for the crusade against Clockdale to Smog and promoted him to brigadier general. But now, although Luffy is still going to hunt down, there is no sand crocodile incident or the branch colonel, after reporting at the headquarters of the new navy, he will be officially promoted to brigadier general. Thinking that Smog would soon overtake in a detour, Tina took advantage of the dullness of the sea and instructed Smog to clean up and pass the time. Be careful, it's not good if you run into the demon king. Really not wanting to clean up, Smog decisively changed the subject. Tina pursed her lips, what about the encounter? He won't be able to take a shot at a few of our little navies. Demon King Bay Ayu is so strong. How could a true dragon care about ants on the ground? Although it was a little sad to think so, but Tina really thought so. No, if you just meet me, you probably won't bother to look at me. As he spoke, Smog looked at the beautiful Tina and said, But you're different. What happened to Tina? Because you're so pretty. Does this fact need you guys to tell Tina? No, I mean, if Bay Ayu saw you, he would probably snatch you away and bully you. Tina fell silent. Well, how did this react? Smog wondered, What's wrong with you? Are you scared? It's not like you. You crow mouth. Tina suddenly shouted. Armed color stepped forward and directly put Smorgery into the cabin. Boo. As the crash sounded. The soldiers on the deck were startled. The soldiers fell into a sluggishness as they looked at Tina. A few meters in front of Tina, a few meters away, a man suddenly appeared, which made all the side-eyed people breathe a sigh of relief. The Demon King. White Feather. The cigarette in Tina's hand fell to the ground, and she smiled bitterly inwardly and looked at the man in front of her with big eyes. Smog's crow mouth was casually mentioned, and he really summoned the Demon King. Face the white feathers. Even if he didn't release any momentum, a series of identities and achievements invisibly gave Tina the greatest pressure. When she was at war, Tina admitted to being handsome by him. Seeing Bay Ayu appear, Tina wanted to cry without tears in her heart. But, Tina doesn't want to fall into the clutches of the devil, who will save Tina. Just that kick of your eye face Morg, very personal. White Feather landed on the deck and looked at the bright Tina girl. Tina. Hinai, the current colonel of the naval headquarters, a contemporary of Smog's navy, is a teacher of Zephyr's Sil fruit ability, he can create fences from anywhere in his body to imprison enemies, and his fences are harder than steel. Stop for Tina, don't come over without Tina's order. Seeing the soldiers who were full of fear but wanted to gather around, Tina suddenly squealed and drank. Seeing this, Bay Ayu was amazed. Beautiful colonel, what a fan. Chapter 111 Chapter 111 The Black Coffin That Died Together White Feather takes Tina and flies to the Holy Land. Demon King White Feather, Smog, who ran out of the cabin, shouted loudly and rushed towards Bay Ayu without thinking, Tina, you run, I'll stop him. Run, is Tina? Bay Ayu said and raised his hand. Stop. Seeing that Bay Ayu raised her hand and seemed to want to shoot, Tina was nervous inside, and once again kicked Reef's mug and shouted, Can you please stop being so impulsive? Tina is disappointed. You will kill the soldiers. No, I raised my hand just to hold onto my sunglasses, nothing else. Bay Ayu lightly supported his sunglasses, today's sun is really big. Tina looked stunned, and subconsciously glanced at Bay Ayu, hateful demon king, Tina is very angry, can be re-energized. Tina didn't dare to take a shot either. White Feather was not one of those little pirates, but any possibility of angering White Feather, Tina did not want to do it. She was not afraid of death. But the soldiers on the giant ship were all her soldiers. Damn. Seeing that Bay Ayu did not pay attention to himself, Smog, who got up again, had a look of pain and anger on his face, and his dead hand was full of weakness. The second time, the second time he encountered Bay Ayu, he was still so weak. Officially inform you that Tina was snatched by me. Bay Ayu looked at Smog and the others. Tina gritted her teeth and said, Your words make Tina even angrier. Fall into the clutches of the devil. God knows what happens. After all, the Demon King is the most terrifying pirate in the new era, and she is a naval beauty, 
What if the Demon King is more excited? A mouthful of self-proclaimed. Psychologically speaking, you are a very confident woman. The Ayu thought it was funny for Tina's self-designation, so he waved to her. Since you are angry, don't hold back, come and shoot, I promise not to hurt others. Tina doesn't believe in pirates. After saying this, Tina thought about it and continued, but a strong person like you, Tina is willing to believe once. Hukaba. Tina rushed to strike. From the arm, a fence-like iron branch stretched out and surrounded a white feather. Restrict my movements first. Good idea. White Feather scanned the cage-like fence around him and looked at Tina again. Black Gun. Tina did not stand still in the slightest, and an iron branch wrapped around the armed color in her hand, suddenly extending straight into the body of the White Feather. Ding. Suddenly, it was as if an ordinary needle touched a diamond and made a crisp sound, making Tina sluggish for a moment. His own piercing attack was all out, and he didn't even pierce the skin of the Demon King, who didn't have any armed color defense. Just this one blow. Tina seemed to see the gap between heaven and earth making her smile bitterly, do whatever you want, as long as you don't hurt Smog and Tina's soldiers. Smog said before that if you see Tina you're likely to snatch it, Tina's willing to go with you. With that, Tina glared at Smog and took a deep breath and walked towards White Feather. Roar. Smog roared in anger. Bay you glanced at the police. What's the roar? If you want to be completely destroyed, just say, I satisfy you. Nothing. Nothing. Smog gritted his teeth in grief, but looking at the soldiers, he could only bow his head bitterly. The other party is a demon king and he absolutely cannot use his hands to anger the other party and kill the soldiers. Walking over to Bay Ayu, Tina took a deep breath and looked up, Tina has a problem, after you snatched Tina, will you bully Tina, will it be good for Tina, will you be angry with Tina casually, will you accept all of Tina's flaws, there are some small problems with people, and can you tolerate Tina's dissatisfaction with you, what's the situation, Smog was stunned, and the soldiers were even more stunned, is Colonel Tina on a blind date, something is wrong, Smog recalled that when he was at the top of the war, Tina's two exclamations were that Tina had been handsome. This woman. Wouldn't it be foolish? Bay Ayu smiled. As long as you don't betray me, everything is easy to say. Tina understands that if you bully Tina, Tina will kill herself, and you won't be able to stop Tina. Tina said, suddenly opened her hand, looked up at Bay Ayu's eyes and said seriously. Tina hasn't been in love, can you let Tina hug you? Dot yes. Bay Ayu narrowed his eyes slightly, and there was a hint of playfulness in his eyes. This scene reminded him of Bonnie. Both girls are so silly and somewhat cute. The next moment, Tina directly hugged Bay Ayu, and hugged her deadly, since this is the case, then let's see Tina's wolfiness. Black coffin, click, click, a series of pitch black fences like dense silk threads continue to emerge from Tina's body, enveloping her in the white feathers layer by layer. In the consternation of Smog and the others, where the two of them appeared, a dark, airtight black ball composed entirely of fences appeared, boom, the black ball rolled and smashed the ship, rushing directly into the sea and falling into it, exclamation mark. All the soldiers watched the splashing waves on the sea, all sluggish. Their Colonel Tina, jumped into the sea with the Demon King, so it is. Smog's expression was full of trance, first confirm Bay Ayu's attitude towards you, and then divert your attention. And in order to avoid mistakes, only after clinging to the Demon King, do you begin to release your strongest imprisoning power and take him into the sea with you. Is this your plan? I misunderstood you. But, muttering here, Smog smiled bitterly again. The same end? You don't understand how terrible the Demon King is. He's not afraid of the sea at all, and it's even more impossible for him to react, so he's just teasing you. But, this is Tina, a woman with a lot of personality who doesn't easily say give up. Hope she's okay. In the deep sea, inside the black ball of black airtight fences, it is not invaded by seawater. Those who have the ability to enter the sea will not seal the ability, but will only be powerless. But at present, it has not been invaded by the sea, so Tina's body is not weak, but her heart is very weak. This beautiful woman, first of all, I am not afraid of the sea. Secondly, is this the show you're putting on for me? Not bad, quite interesting is this sentence. After falling into the sea, Tina heard Bay Ayu's words and felt powerless inside. Can she say that she didn't think of this point recorded in the data at that time, but she didn't want to let Bay Ayu slaughter her, so she decisively took Bay Ayu into the sea. It is impossible to be a flower fool, only to end up together. Anyway, Tina has already done this, if you want to kill, kill it. Tina's voice rang out stubbornly and the two of them had been sentenced before. Growing up under the cultivation of the naval headquarters, Tina was never afraid of death. I don't want to surrender to the pirates. Bay Ayu didn't seem to hear it, but instead opened his mouth with great interest. You are holding me now, and the dead ones who are blocked everywhere want to merge into my body. Tina's face instantly turned red. Only then did I find that in this completely sealed black ball. The two were really stuck together everywhere. Like a conjoined baby, Tina was embarrassed. Very uncomfortable, Tina suddenly struggled for a moment and then listen to Bay Ayu say, if you disarm your ability to attempt suicide or something now, then the sea will surround you, and you will be powerless to choke on the water and pass out, and I pity Xiang Xiang, so I will fish you out, 
first you a few times a fierce pressure, then perform artificial respiration, and finally change clothes to avoid getting cold. Tina suddenly stopped moving. Fierce pressure, artificial respiration, change of clothes, this set of processes down. Tina feels that she will be ashamed to die. Then you just take me out, don't you teleport? Tina felt that her body was full of white feathers at this moment, especially the heat next to her ears, which made her heart full of chaos. Tina I was sloppy. She should wait until the Demon King takes her away before giving her more thought. Alas, the deep sea is too scary, I can't teleport out, let's do this first. Tina narrowed her eyes. Is it that it has been posted like this, what if something happens to the sticker? After all, she is a beautiful woman, and Bay Ayu is a normal man. Tina is not a teenage girl, although she has not experienced it, but it is not ignorant. Lonely men and widows, there will be accidents. Thinking of this, Tina suddenly gritted her teeth and said, Say what you want, as long as you don't insult Tina. Tina has agreed, and Tina will not seek death again. Bay are you said directly, I snatched you back so that you could be my crew. Tina said yes. You're a little stupid. Tina isn't smart, but you're in good shape. Of course, but no, Tina won't let you touch it. White feathers have a black line. He just casually praised. Tina, you don't want to go on the line, after all, my demon king is a serious person, rush, the next moment, Bay Ayu teleported with Tina and left the deep sea and came directly into the sky, click, Bay Ayu directly shattered the surrounding fence, holding Tina, and a small island cloud appeared with it, whoosh, don't wait for Tina to turn back, Bay Ayu looked into the distance and controlled the island cloud to fly rapidly in one direction, when Bay Ayu let go of Tina, Tina subconsciously hugged Bay Ayu, very ashamed, you mean it, Tina is angry, the small Tina of the island cloud has no place to stay, and the fast will fall at any time, and Tina has no choice but to hold the white feather or jump into the sea. This made Tina glare at some excessive demon king. Bay Ayu didn't care about these small questions and said calmly, I'm going to the holy land now, if I don't want to be implicated, you can jump into the sea. St. Shrine? Tina's eyes widened a few points, and she was surprised, are you a Draco? No, Tina was wrong. Suddenly thinking that Bay Ayu was the demon king of the god. Tina was very embarrassed, shocked, Tina moved on Bay Ayu's body, holding Bay Ayu from her back to the front, her legs wrapped around Bay Ayu, and looked up at Bay Ayu's eyes, tell Tina, what are you going to do, you do this, there's nowhere to go, Tina can only do this, you just mean it, ah, forget it, it doesn't matter, what are you going to do, go get something, don't move, are you testing me, Tina doesn't want to move around, you have something in your pocket, take it away, Tina is very uncomfortable, are you going to steal something, that's called take, Give you three seconds to get back behind me, or I promise you'll soon feel a lot of pain. Ah, uh, Tina, who suddenly understood what it was, screamed. Her body stiffened for a moment, her face was full of red, and she quickly circled behind Bay Ayu again. This demon king was absolutely deliberate, and Tina was very ashamed at this moment. How can you be so bad? Quickly make this cloud bigger. Tina is angry. You're so funny. Bay Ayu smiled softly and casually enlarged the island cloud by dozens of times. And Tina immediately let go of the white feather and stood on the island cloud, quickly pulling away, full of shame. You guy is so hateful. Talking doesn't count. Tina is very disappointed. Bay Ayu had a puzzled face. Which of my words deceived you? Tina blushed with anger. You said you wouldn't bully Tina. You were just bullying Tina. It was you who took the initiative to hold me. It's your legs wrapped around me. So, you are hungry for my body. I understand you. But I have tried my best to curb the charm, and your professional resistance is obviously not good. Tina fell into a sluggishness she had never seen such a brazen learning. Is this man specifically here to bully Tina? Tina is not alive, he shouted in shame. Tina turned and ran toward the edge of the island clouds, looking like she wanted to jump into the sea. Seeing this, Bay Ayu said casually, jump into the sea, wait for you to choke on the water coma. The process you said before will come to a set. Tina stomped her feet. Fierce pressure artificial respiration, change of clothes, Tina is too hard, compared with life, Tina still felt that innocence was more important, Tina sat on the island cloud without tears, no longer taking care of the white feather, and kept drawing circles on the island cloud, cursing the demon king, soon, your soul will be truly baptized, Bay Ayu didn't say anything more, looking into the distance, there, above the laterite continent, holy land Mary Joya, where countless magnates dream, where countless pirates covet, where countless navies kneel. Chapter 112 Chapter 112 Mary Joy's male and female, Princess Otto Heim Horaces and Hears, Island Clouds Fly. When Tina saw that she was getting closer and closer to the Holy Land, she quickly forgot about Bayayu's bullying of her. If you insist on going to the Holy Land, you will be arrested, then locked up, and finally publicly executed. After adjusting her mood, Tina came over and opened her mouth seriously. Bayayu said casually, What, don't you look for death? Please be serious with Tina. Do you have to send her to death? Tina was helpless, couldn't fight, said no, couldn't play, and almost got bullied to death. 
just very depressed. Don't shout when you get to the Holy Land for a while, I'll leave the rest to me. Bayayu did not answer, directly reminded a sentence, after calculating the distance of the holy place, he reached out and grabbed Tina and disappeared in an instant. Holy Land Mary Joy, the headquarters of the world government, the kings of the member countries come here every four years to hold world conferences, and the inhabitants of this place are Draco. As a holy place built in the middle of the Great Passage, the Red Clay, Land Summit, it is the center of world power and does not allow anyone to invade. So far, there was only one invasion, and that was Fisher Tiger's emancipation of slaves, becoming the first person in history to make a big fuss about Mary Joya. Ending, hunt to the death. In a corner, a whisper sounded, it's here. Tina was silent. Since it has come, it is useless to say anything, but it makes Tina, who has been a navy for many years, have an inexplicable sense of excitement. After all, Bayayu is here to steal. No, he said he had come to get something, and it must have been something for the Draco. At the thought of harming the Draco, Tina's heart jumped quickly. Little excitement, little excitement. Let me see and listen. The white feathers breaking sense unfolded, shielding the breath of the two while probing the nearest Draco. The sound of scolding, wild laughter, grief, crying, etc. is endless. After filtering, lock the target, rush. The next moment Tina felt the flowers in front of her eyes, and felt the surroundings brighten, and saw a Draco in front of her, whipping several female slaves, and many guards around her watched calmly. Just at a glance, Tina's eyes were full of anger, but also full of bitterness. Space transfer. Directly transfer the guards and slaves, all separated, to the Chambord Islands. At present, the range of white feathers is far more than thousands of miles, and the Chambord is very close and in the perceptual range. Boo. Without waiting for the Draco to react, Bayayu directly fainted, and his hands shone with a glimmer. Memory read. Little Brin's memory fruit. Bayayu directly ignored the messy memories, looking for the treasure house. Phew. Tina took a deep breath to calm the tension and excitement in her heart. It was so exciting, Tina felt that her soul was inexplicably sublimated. Half a minute later, withdrawing his hand, Bayayu smiled lightly, feeling very exciting. Excited? When you're caught, Tina will come out laughing when she sees you. Tina retorted, then carefully observed the surroundings. Is no one really not finding us? I have transferred everyone in this mansion to Chambord and the guards outside the door will not casually see and smell, which is an offense to the privacy of the Draco people. Before we make a fuss, unless there is a special unknown means of scanning, it will be at least a while before someone will come in to investigate. But at that time, we were already gone, but we should be careful. Listening to Bayayu's explanation, Tina's face was full of shock and her eyes were wide open. Tina hissed, from here in an instant to Chambord. Are you still human? Although Chambord is not far away, but it is still separated by a sea and this extremely high laterite continent land. Originally it was a perceptual range transfer, what's the fuss about this, follow me to see the world more in the future, little rookie. After saying that, Bayayu casually took Tina's small hand and walked leisurely towards the treasure house. Tina walked in a trance. Whoosh, Bayayu took a step and shot at the fainting Draco. Poof, under the breath of Tina's room, the white feather's armed color turned into a bullet, directly piercing the head of the Draco. Oh Draco, just dead? Tina suddenly realized how unbearable these so-called descendants of the gods were in front of Bayayu. At the same time, Tina felt that the cells in her body were excited. Don't bother, the next Draco, how about you kill? Not good. Tina shook her head repeatedly. She had just been snatched away by Bayayu, and her mentality had not yet been adjusted, and she was very resistant to offending the Draco. But my heart grew more and more excited. Bayayu's forehead, then don't kill, mutilate and throw it in prison, and hand it over to the interested girls and little brothers to kill. Tina, what a scourge. Bayayu knocked on Tina's forehead, I am doing harm to the people and we are both male and female. Tina lost her voice, worthy of being the demon king, and it was really unlucky for the Draco to meet him. But it's so exciting. Excited and excited, Tina took the initiative to grab Bayayu's hand and followed him to the Draco treasure house. Rush, perception, space jumping. Bayayu didn't care about the gate either, and directly took Tina with him, ignoring the obstacles and teleporting into the treasure house. Golem. The moment she came in, Tina felt like her eyes were going to go blind. Orb gold? That's all dung. Very few Draco people put any treasure or the like in their personal treasure troves, just as ordinary people would not put dung in a safe. Tina's vision. All kinds of strange and rare and distinctive treasures filled the main hall, row after row, enough to make ordinary people look at the eyes. Rush, Bayayu raised his hand slightly, and piece after piece of treasure was all collected into the ring and stored. No matter what kind of treasure it is, in short, take it all away first. Go back and watch it with the girls. Don't be stunned. Next, holding Tina, Bayayu entered the next Draco mansion. Now, Pan Ancient City, inside the deliberative hall. Boo. The curly-bearded five old stars slapped the table and pointed to the newspaper. Tell me why you haven't dealt with Morgans that Birdman. Tell me again. Why didn't the five Michaels you guaranteed take down the White Feather and were killed back? Waste. It's all crap. The CP0 Commander-in-Chief of the three armies, Kronos, 
whose administrative rank is against the commander-in-chief of the three armies, is scolded by the five old stars as a dog at this moment. The warring states on the side are dark in their hearts, but they can be considered to have encountered the CP0 boss and been scolded and you crap. The curly-bearded five old stars looked at the warring states, every year so much military expenditure supports you. But you can't even take a little pirate, what use do you want your navy to do? Rubbish. Waste is a two-word word. There was no wave in our country's heart, and he said that he was used to being scolded. And this time, the curly-bearded five old stars who did not wait for the white face continued to scold. Sengoku said directly, it's all my responsibility, I didn't let the generals attack Bay Ayu, because he can leave at any time, there is no point. If there is a question of responsibility, then there is a need to bear the blame, not to be treated as silently as someone. Glancing at the silent CP0 commander-in-chief, the warring states said forcefully, from today onwards, I will step down as a naval marshal, and the new marshal will be selected from among the three generals. CP0 commander-in-chief suddenly looked at the warring states with surprise and ugly faces, this guy stepped down from office, see what I mean, deliberately. The other four five old stars calmly watched the warring states without opening their mouths. The curly bearded five old stars darkened, what do you mean? Didn't I just say two words to you, and I didn't want to do it? Did I? I'm older and overwhelmed, so it's more appropriate to hand it over to young people. Sengoku spoke very sincerely. Seeing this, the curly bearded five old stars looked much more relaxed. Then who do you think is the most suitable to be a marshal? Kuzin, subconsciously opening his mouth. The warring states saw the color of dissatisfaction on the faces of the two five old stars. Warring states smiled bitterly in his heart, and sure enough, the five old stars did not like the pheasant very much. After all, they were too lazy and not fierce enough. Just set the red dog and if you are not satisfied, let them speak with strength. The long-bearded five old stars are directly conclusive. In addition, the vacancy of the great general. The long-bearded five old stars were about to continue to say something when the bald five old stars suddenly drew their swords. S-H-H-H. A little cold light flashed, and the warring states felt a faint pain in his eyes. The bald five old stars said in a condensed voice, someone has broken into the holy land, right here at the Don Quixote family. Boom. The words just fell. A roar sounded from afar waking up many people in the Holy Land. Double God, it's really good. The Draco people, where the Tajik Uide family is located, Bay Ayu is very happy. A few minutes ago, Bay Ayu dealt with five Draco in succession, and after emptying three treasure houses, came to the mansion where the sixth Draco was located. Coincidentally, it is the residence of a member of the Don Quixote family. The family was not removed. The Doflamingo family was only a branch of the Don Quixote family, and his father was not a patriarch. Branches cause trouble. What is related to my main vein? and even other branches do not fall into the well. After all, there are so many family resources, one less, then others can share more. Your name is Don Quixote Mouscarad, aren't you? Looking at the Tanlong people in front of him, Bai Yu casually asked. The old method was to directly transfer all the guards of the mansion to Chambord, leaving only the Draco. Bai Yu did not kill him directly, but instead came a little interested. One, the other party is also surnamed Don Quixote, and the previous Doflamingo is a family. Two, the other party is an outlier. Winter is Benless. It's me, your one piece, I know you, what are you doing here? Don Quixote Mizgarad recognized the demon king of the gods, and his heart was a little worried, but he was still calm. As soon as he thought of Bayayu raising his hand slightly, all the gods disappeared, which made him frightened. Bayayu looked at Tina, who was not so nervous next to her, but was walking around the hall, so she said, come to you to get something, you won't mind, right? No, don't mind. Don Quixote Mizgarad can say anything. He does not dare. Then let me see your memories again. Bei Ayu directly stunned him because he wanted to verify a problem. When Bei Aixing was six years old, Mazgarad also liked to collect fishman slaves, and in order to retrieve the liberated slaves to go to Fishman Island, he forced the residents to help him after being killed, but the fishman wanted to kill him, and was stopped by Otto Ham in time. Just when he was about to kill Otto Ham, he was frightened by the cry of the White Star, which caused the Neptune to faint, and after recovering from his injuries, he was sent back to the Holy Land by Otto Ham, and was touched by Otto Ham's advice, and his temperament changed greatly. Decided to one day repay the favor of Fishman Island and the original trajectory. Two years after the war on top, during the World Conference, Mazgara teaches Charos, who is preparing to kidnap White Star, to relieve Neptune and White Star. Princess Otto Ham, it's a pity. After withdrawing his hand, Bay Ayu sighed, of course. He regretted that it was not Princess Otoji who was a person, but her ability to see and hear. Otto Ham, born to see and smell. Moreover, it was the most exaggerated of all the people that Bayayu knew so far. A Draco who has fixed his personality since he was a child, and has always been cold-blooded and arrogant and likes slaves, but he was touched by Princess Sotoji's simple words, and his temperament has changed greatly since then. Even if there is a life-saving escort factor, 
It is still not enough to reverse a person's fixed mind. Bayou's murmur made Tina puzzled and affirmed, Of course not, it is undeniable that there are good Draco people. But those who are born evil cannot save his life and become good. He will take it for granted. Tina's statement is very logical, a bad quality Draco was saved, and he would never be grateful. For example, can he become a good man by saving Tiki's life dash? Don Quixote Mizgarad's previous temperament was even worse than Titch's, and he could not be easily changed. So, his values, his thoughts may have all been influenced. But if he doesn't, he will bring destruction to Fisherman Island in anger. White Feather looked at the unconscious Mizgarad saint. 1. He came to retrieve the slaves. 2. The fishermen are going to kill him. 3. The little white star cries and causes the Neptune class to frighten him. Under normal circumstances, Mus will not give up robbing slaves and will also take revenge on destroying Fisherman Island, and when he returns, he is likely to be discovered by someone with a heart to find out the identity of the White Star Sea King. These are three situations must be eliminated. Otto Ham could not accept it. Here and after, the original setting of Otto Ham's sight and smell is, 1. You can feel each other's thoughts and emotions, and convey your own consciousness to others. 2. Influencing the minds and thoughts of others and resonating strongly can even change each other's values and ideologies. Born the perfect writer the strongest mouth owner in the world of pirates. Unfortunately, Otto Heim is too kind to use her ability to influence others, otherwise the fish people will also be greatly affected. Otto Heim is too kind, but I'm not a good person. White Feather, marveled, wanted. Chapter 113 Chapter 113 The Fruit of the Two Gods The five old stars bow down to worship the Demon King. Holy Land Shock Otto G is still too kind, the world of the weak and the strong, with this ability is not used by fish people. On the domineering true solution. I see that there is such an ability as Yij in the analysis of smell and color, but it is too difficult to learn. The special ability of innate sight and smell is something that others cannot cultivate, but the domineering true solution can be learned, but the more special it is, the more difficult it is to learn. It seems that the white star is also born to see and smell, and the genetic athiam. Throwing away Princess Yiji's thoughts, Bayayu ignored this Draco alien of the Don Quixote family and took Tina to the treasure house here. Huh? Somebody? When Hakaba teleports into the treasure house with Tina defying obstacles, Bayayu suddenly found that there was a strong old man sitting in the treasure house. This surprised Bayayu, and Tina covered her mouth in shock. And the old man slowly opened his eyes at the moment when Bayayu came in, and said in a low voice, Intruder, it seems that the defense of the Holy Land is really getting more and more unsightly, and report your name, little devil. When the old man saw the white feather, he was not shocked, full of blandness. Two possibilities. One, I really don't know Bayayu. Two, no fear of white feather strength, or, both, because they are extremely powerful, so they are very calm. I didn't even perceive you, your special ability. Bayayu did not believe that the other party's sight and smell were stronger than his own, so he was a person with special fruit ability. Instantly, the mood soared. As it turns out, it is actually the ability of space-like fruit. Even if he saw himself, Bayayu couldn't feel the other person's breath and he closed his eyes and didn't have anything. Most likely, the other person is not in the current space. Divinity. In an instant, a one-eyed masked man appeared in Bayayu's mind, Yuikai has kaleidoscope ability of the old six belt soil, and the divine power was blurred. The body is in a different space, and then projected, can ignore any conventional attacks, and cannot perceive breath. Rush. Without even thinking about it, Bayayu directly transferred Tina to gravity space. You. The old man suddenly lost his temper. Bayayu's hidden breath was very strong so he still wanted to take down Tina, but the other party disappeared in an instant. Is it a blur? Let's verify it. Space transfer. When the white feather ability was activated, nothing happened, and the old man was still sitting there, and began to stand up, full of indifference. Sure enough, Bayayu couldn't help but squint. So, similar to Yuakaiha's book ability, how to fight. After all, the soil is based on virtualization, and many strong people are dead by playing alive. The old man's name is Francis and he belongs to the strongest shield of the Don Quixote family. The job is simple, one family member to guard every month. This month it is the turn of Don Quixote Mizgarad Saint. He never needs me to guard, only send me to guard his treasure trove. The strongest shield Francis, inexplicably a little bit of nonsense, together explained his identity to Bayayu. The reason why I say so much to you is because I like to strangle the top strong people the most. Let them go to the Yellow Spring to praise my Francis prestige. Speaking of this, Francis's forced breath rushed straight into the sky, and his voice was cold, the old man has been traversing the world for decades, killing all the strong enemies, seeing life and death, and you are too young, if you insult the identity of the old man, cut yourself, retarded, it will be great, this was the strongest enemy that Bayayu had ever seen since he went out to sea, and he almost killed him because of a few words, it was really powerful, but, before the other body came out of the other space, if Bayayu didn't use the ability, 
he really couldn't attack Francis at present. Collect under Francis's glare. Bayayu raised his hand slightly, and directly transferred everything in the treasure house to the Naji. Get the treasure back. Francis roared. Smack dab, dab. Bayayu was surprised to find that the space around him began to distort and form a whirlpool. Try to send him into another space, whereby the space breaks his body. Double god. Not only is it bokeh, but even the remote space warp will be and the other party does not need to come out of the body at present. How to launch it? It will not be launched with the eyes like with soil. Watching Bayayu dodge the space vortex, Francis sneered, hide. Keep hiding. Will I be little by little? But the two gods are also worthy of provoking me. The six belts must die. Dismissively, Bayayu's eyes were cold, and he directly drew his sword. S-H-H-H. Kneel down for me. Causal law magic, 100% will be taken to the white blade empty-handed. Not only that, Bayayu directly exploded the overlord color, wrapped around the knife, and slashed fiercely. What? What is this ability? Francis was shocked, because his body came out of the other space uncontrollably, and completely lost control of the fruit ability and domineering. This kind of thing is horrible. The space class abilities couldn't pull him out of the other space, and Bayayu just drew his sword and did it. What did you do? With a shocked and shocked face, Francis ran towards Bayayu with his empty hands, directly kneeling in front of Bayayu and raising his hand to take the knife. Ah. No, boom, Bay Ayuba wrapped a knife. The entire treasure trove collapsed in an instant, and directly dealt a devastating blow to the mansion of the Saint of Masgarad. A huge roar resounded throughout the Holy Land, waking up many people. The bald five old stars sensed it a few seconds in advance, so they suddenly drew their swords in front of the warring states. Now, deep in the ancient city or pan, a land of flowers and plants is everywhere, and a slender figure is raising its hand to tease the flying butterflies. He even glanced in the direction where Bayayu was located earlier. After Bayayu's knife fell, the figure fell and whispered, This knife, interesting, it's really good. After Bayayu collected the knife, he looked at the blood left by Francis in front of him. A knife shattered the small half of Francis's body, who was kneeling on the ground and unable to resist, and was momentarily in a near-death coma, and then transferred to the undead prison. Waking up in prison, Bayayukai did not believe that the double god power could escape the undead prison. Although the two gods could definitely leave the other space, the immortal prison was completely in the hands of Bayayu, and the space that was also absolutely controlled by him. No one in this world has been able to escape from the prison of immortality alone. I wanted to have a good fight with you, but you had to pretend to be forced. Encountering Francis, who is surrounded by two gods, Bayayu really wants to put aside his ability and have a good fight. After all, he had long admired the great name of the two gods and his hands were itchy. But the other party was too pretentious and almost killed Bayayu. Bayayu looked into the distance again. You are interesting. Your whole family is interesting. Play with your butterflies. As the owner of the breakthrough level, the peep of someone in the depths of the Pan Ancient City was directly discovered by Bayayu. This knife is interesting. You're still stuck there. Again, do the people of the Holy Land like to peep so much? Bayayu said, looking at the corner not far away. Warring states, all come here. What to hide? Oh no. You're too low to speak first. The warring states in the corner are helpless. He really wasn't qualified to speak first, who made him in the holy land. A cold hum came from the side of the warring states, and he was very dissatisfied with Bayayu's attitude. Just as the other person was about to walk out, Bayayu raised an eyebrow and drew his sword again. You usually live in the Pan Ancient City, don't you? I don't like the name. If you have the ability, just block this knife. Slash God. Whoops. A terrifying star-like slash pierced through the void and shot straight into the ancient city of Mary Japan. Unbridled. In the corner, the curly-bearded five old stars suddenly stepped out to drink coldly, and behind them was the CP0 chief. Warring states, as well as quite a few CP0 members. Fuck you. Kneel down for me. Looking at the curly-bearded five old stars, Bayayu's eyes were cold, and he drew his sword again. Not good. The sound of the hammer made the warring states sweat and hair explode. Here it comes, with one knife. The terrifying ability of the Emperor's kneeling is coming. What? The curly-bearded five old stars looked horrified, and it was useless to let any way they struggle, and ran towards Bayayu with their bare hands. This reminded him of the photo of the aunt kneeling, and the live broadcast of the red dog kneeling on the top, which was extremely angry. Five old stars. CP0 immediately went to pull the bearded five old stars, and was directly ejected. Huh? Will someone pull and be bounced off? Seeing this scene, Bayayu was surprised. He really hadn't tried it. But in this way, your boss five old stars will come to kneel and worship the demon king lord. You a little bit of a little bit or roll aside to play. Boo, boom. When the curly bearded five old stars knelt on the ground to receive the sword empty handed, Bayayu's god slash also exploded in the distant pan ancient city, causing a roar in the holy land again. Finished. Warring states, CP0 chief. The arrival of CP0 all fell into a sluggishness. Not only was the pan ancient city in the center of power attacked by the demon king, but even the five old Star Lords, who were the highest ranking of the Draco, 
are also kneeling on the ground like wild dogs. This scene, it's like the sky is falling. The roar attracted many Draco people, guards, and slaves who were not afraid of death, and the Draco people, guards, and slaves who were not afraid of death were shocked in unison. The whole holy place fell into dead silence. Distance outside the ancient city or pan, the collision of two terrible slashes directly exploded, turning into a terrifying chopping wave that turned the periphery of the pan ancient city into a ruin. The remaining four or five old stars looked ugly, and they didn't expect that the invaders would dare to attack here. How arrogant they were! The bald five old stars collected their knives and looked solemn and whispered, At such an age, such a slash, we all underestimate him. Tick tock, tick tock, a drop of blood fell from the hands of the bald five old stars which made the three long-bearded five old stars stunned. Injured, the blonde five old stars condensed. Is his sword play? Nothing. The bald five old stars shook their heads slightly. He definitely did not surpass the top great sword master, and he took half a step at most. The eyes of the other three people froze slightly. The other party is only 18 years old. Give him a few more years. Is not going to go to heaven? Wrong. Is it time to consider these questions? The demon king has already arrogantly hit the door. If they don't do something, what face do they have to see the adult? The blonde five old stars instantly burst into rage and wanted to rush over to punish the demon king. The long beard that sensed the distance suddenly changed his look. No, it is the knife that makes the four emperors of the general kneel. Rush. The blonde five old stars suddenly stopped their steps, and the curly hair five old stars also silently withdrew their feet, and the eyelids of the bald five old stars twitched. A knife came out and the emperor knelt down. They I use a strange ability, after they specifically understood it in the past two days. They regarded it as a rule class concept ability. This ability, before finding some limitations, no matter how strong the strength, must be cautious and cautious. What kind of identity they are, if they accidentally kneel on the ground, the word that goes out may mean that many dog legs are secretly laughing. The little pirate is not worth a shot, I believe he, can be with us is enough to say everything. Well said. Agreed. Agree. Time. The four five old stars stayed in the ancient city of Pan, sat down together and drank tea happily, and the result was that the door did not go out curly beard five old stars, you old six, come and save me, distance, warring states, CP0 commander in chief and other fires still look like a dead father and mother, and their expressions continue to be sluggish, and Bayer you couldn't help but smile, the sluggish appearance of this group of people is really ridiculous, your five old star lords have long been used in kneeling, until, the curly bearded five old stars roared with rage, shock, and horror, damn, let go of me, do you know who I am? You, boo, Bay are you stomped on the head of the curly bearded five old star and stomped his head into the ruins. Ah, uh -huh. even so, the curly bearded five old stars were still uncontrollable, trying to raise their hands to pick up Bay are knife. This scene made the warring states and others feel cold in their hearts, that is the five old stars. Sigh, Bay are you learned from the yellow ape to make an exaggerated expression. Are you the legendary five old star lords? It's terrible. But how I look at you like a dog. What do you say? Warring states. Sengoku. Hold on can't laugh. Chapter 114. Chapter 114. The five old stars are dead. They are so happy. The warring states were speechless. Don't ask me. You have scolded me. I have scolded you. Do not scold and do not know each other, just as if you did not see me, in case you are hated by the five old stars with curly beards. You will wear small shoes for me. Come on, let's go together. Seeing that CP0 chief wanted to move, Bay I you smiled lightly. You guys are really terrible. If my hand accidentally shakes, his head will be gone. CP0 total long face ugly. He could see that the current curly bearded five old stars could not even use the armed color, how to defend against the slash of the white feather. Or the warring states said in a deep voice, Bay are you, stop, don't go on wrong anymore. The other Draco and the five old star lords are not a level, if you really die, oh? What will happen? As Bay are you spoke, he found that the time limit for him to be picked up by the white blade with his bare hands had passed. SHHH. Without waiting for the curly bearded five old stars to stand up and resist, Bayayu drew his sword again to suppress it. The humiliation of kneeling on the ground again made the bearded five old stars lose control of their emotions, but this time they didn't say anything, just looked up and stared at Bayayu deadly. Very good, worthy of the five old stars, tough enough. Bay are you praised it? There are flaws. Warring state size froze slightly, making a gesture to the CP0 commander general. The warring states continued to speak in a deep voice, if something happens to the five old stars, all the combat strength of the world government will attack the demon king C together. Then come on. White Feather is not afraid of everything. The voice of the warring states rose high, make a deal, as long as you let go of the five old stars, we are willing to give you ten demon fruits. Bay are you directly pulled the price, five hundred. One less is not negotiable, and it has to be all top-notch. Sengoku almost vomited blood. Your family demon fruit engaged in wholesale R, 
500 top ability, the world government has not accumulated so much in 800 years. May 4, 3, Sengoku did not speak again, silently counting the numbers in his heart, when his heart counted to a moment. Lord Five Old Stars Dodge, the Buddha's light shines. The warring states instantly entered the form of the Great Buddha, and the incomparably dazzling golden light made everyone subconsciously close their eyes, and burst out a terrifying shockwave to attack Bayu. Wind and Thunder Fist CP0 squeezes the atmosphere into a crackling sound between his fists, demonstrating its terrifying power. And there was a fierce storm and thunder all over the body condensed on the fist, a fist towards the white feather. The two men took up an angle and jointly besieged Bei Ayu. Rush. At this moment, Bei Ayu's magic time came, and the curly bearded five old stars instantly pulled away and fled quickly. The two attacks came crashing in, intertwining to produce a big explosion. Boom. The terrifying attack collided instantly blowing out a mushroom cloud where the white feather was located, and the powerful storm destroyed all the surrounding buildings, shaking the holy land again. Inside the ancient city or pan, the four five old stars were still leisurely drinking tea, but if they looked closely, they could still see the anger in the eyes of the four people. Boom! A figure smashed the gate and rushed into the main hall, slightly startling the four people. When he saw that it was the curly-bearded five old stars, the long-bearded five old stars were slightly relieved and smiled. I knew that you would not have an accident. Yeah, yeah, we just waited because we believed in you too much. That's right, you're the pride of our hearts. Agreed. This group of old six. The curly beard twitched his eyelids, and he wanted to scold the mother very much, but he still put up with it. With a cold snort, the curly bearded five old stars sat on the sofa without a word, their faces turned black into charcoal, and their hearts palpitated. The other four looked at each other. They really didn't want to kneel down to Bay Ayu so as not to help. But the curly bearded five old stars are all humiliated kneeling after all. It is understandable that the mood is not good. You don't say, we will act as if nothing happened. Where the ruins are. When the roar begins to subside and the dust begins to dissipate, a whisper sounded. The power of wind and thunder, the power of great power, some kind of Esper species? But, your cooperation is commendable. The chief of the warring states and CP0 looked slightly condensed, and sure enough, he didn't hit the demon king, a figure. The wind and clouds appeared out of thin air, it was Bei Ayu. Sengoku took a deep breath and said, Your ability is very strong, but that kind of flaw will be infinitely magnified here. You're right, I subconsciously ignored it. 100% of the white feathers must be picked up by the white blade empty-handed, and there are three flaws. 1. Silence has a time limit. 2. Every time the time comes, you need to draw the knife again to launch. 3. Only one on one. Just now, the statute of limitations is approaching. The warring states too brazenly attacked, and the curly bearded five old stars took the opportunity to flee. However, Bei Ayu only used this ability as an auxiliary means to control the enemy, and was never included in the main ability. Sengoku, your observation is really good, but you don't know me at all. Speaking of this, Bei Ayu's eyes were cold, and his killing intent rose. The prey I look up to, even if he runs to hell. Don't try to escape. Not good. The warring states were shocked. The curly bearded five old stars did take the opportunity to escape. But the warring states forgot one of the most important points. Space transfer. Under the shock of the warring states and CP0, the curly bearded five old stars who had fled before appeared out of thin air, and they also appeared sitting, and there was no seat underneath, so they accidentally fell down. Die. Before the space shifted, the armed color of the white feather, the overlord color, was wrapped around the light hit. At the moment of the transfer, before the curly-bearded five old stars could return to the divine arm defense, they brazenly slashed down. Boom. The terrifying roar sounded again, and the five old stars of the curly beard that had been transferred exploded in an instant, and the blood mist filled the air. Boom boom. The sluggish warring states and others forgot to resist the aftermath and were all shocked. S-H-H-H. When the sound of the knife is heard, there was dead silence all around. What? In the pan-ancient city. The other four five old stars saw the curly beard five old stars disappearing and their looks changed greatly, but when they sensed it, they found that the breath of their companions plummeted, and then disappeared. In this case, serious injuries and death. In an instant, the four five old stars, no, maybe they will be changed to four old stars in the future, and they looked angry and showed a lot of trepidation. They are not afraid of white feathers, rather, he was afraid of Lord M. What to do? The four of them suddenly broke out in a cold sweat. This is no longer a matter of trampling on authority, but the small lives of the four of them. If this happens, if the adult blames it, they are absolutely finished. Don't think of anything else. That little devil is so bold. You must not let him disturb the adult. The bald five old stars got up and ran towards the depths of the pan ancient city. The other three rushed to keep up, and it was time to guard the adults to show their loyalty. Roll. But when the four people were just about to enter the flower room, a cold drink suddenly came frightening the four people into an excitement. Poof! Four five-year-old stars hurriedly knelt down, very sharp lying on the ground, 
shrinking into a ball, really rolling out like a leather ball. Between the flowers, only a slender figure remained, continuing to raise his hand to tease the butterfly and whisper, This boring world is finally interesting. After a few breaths, whoosh, a figure flashed like a sharp arrow, instantaneously, landed smoothly, looked around the eyes, and was also shocked. What's the situation? The demon king gathered his sword and stood, and the warring states they were all paralyzed in the ruins. Idle, sensing the past, the breath of the warring states and others was not weakened, nor was it injured. You guys, dot five old stars lord he, my lord, he, he's dead, rumble. When they were ready to inquire, the words of the warring states forehead were like thunder exploding in the minds of the comers. The visitors are very strong. A mountain-shaped white hair, full of breathing strong breath, is the previous generation of admirals, the current commander-in-chief of the whole army steel bone air. To know that the warring states are 77 years old this year, you can imagine how old the steel bone is, a top old monster. But this old monster, stunned at the moment, has been completely out of control for many years of expression management, and is equally sluggish. Five old stars, dead? The collapse of the earth is not enough to describe and the steel bone sky seems to have seen the end of the world, and almost collapsed on the ground. But steel bone quickly adjusted his mood, ignored Bay Ayu, turned around and shouted, block the news here, immediately, immediately, you go to. CP0 also returned to God and commanded the same. Then the crowd parted and surrounded the white feathers in the middle. The atmosphere was incredibly depressing. The death of the Draco is a big thing, not to mention the death of the five old stars of the highest rank of the Draco. Steel bone void and others felt that a real storm was coming, if nothing else. Let's say that the various types of protective personnel in the Holy Land do not know how many people will die. You're peeping again, but you rushed out, do you still want me to take the initiative to find you? Dream. The white feathers disappear with the wind. Warring states and others were shocked, angry and puzzled. The anger was that Bayayu killed the five old stars and turned around and threw the mess all over to them. What was incomprehensible was, who is Bayayu talking to? But as soon as Bayayu left, everyone also looked at each other, and the murderer left and then they were in trouble. Abominable. CP0 total length angry hammer ground. Seeing this, the warring states also have a rare lack of tide irony, and everyone will not be better. When the CP0 commander left, the warring states could not help but sigh. I didn't expect. Alas, I can't understand the world anymore. All five old stars were killed. Is there anything in this world that the demon king does not dare to do? But just now the demon king has left so dashingly. The warring states are very weak. Steel Bone Void said in a deep voice, where did this demon king come from, it is even more troublesome than Lux. Anyway, the current navy has nothing to do with him, and there is no ability to limit his ability to leave. In front of the Steel Bone empty space, he did not hide it, and the warring states laughed bitterly. Steel Bone patted the shoulder of the warring states, since you're tired, let's give it to the young people, stay in the headquarters to retire, and teach the new generation. Sengoku muttered, Pension, you're bigger than me, what do you say? Cough. Big brother, I heard Carp nagging two days ago, saying that you don't come out to move your bones and bones, and everyone will be ruined. That stinky boy, when I see him, I have to beat him to death. Agreed. Just when the two were arguing, in the distance came the long-bearded five old stars who shouted angrily, Roll me over. Sengoku and Steel Boner glanced at each other, and their heads were as big as a bucket. Trouble is coming. Within gravity space. After all, this place is as big as the real world and the training area of the little brothers is tens of thousands of miles away from the training area of the girls. Girls training area. There's a lot of talk. Kia was astonished. So, big brother Bayayu you took you to the holy land to steal. Cough. Got something? Yes, there was an old man in the treasure house, and he sent Tina here. Tina secretly looked at the girls. As soon as I was transferred here, I met a lot of girls who were working hard to cultivate, adapted to the gravity of this area, and chatted with them. Oh my god, so many beautiful women. Did Tina come to the daughter country? And what place is this place? The evil devil king has snatched so many women, how can you let other single dogs live? Whoops, is Tina also going to be the demon king's woman? Tina replied calmly on the surface, but inside she was already in a mess. She suddenly noticed a problem. That is, none of these women from all over the world and different forces resented Bay Ayu. Most, full of adoration. The rest, full of respect. There was also some admiration in her eyes. Even Tina, who had never been in love, could not help but envy. What is love in this chaotic world? Either you die tomorrow or I die tonight. However, after complaining about Bayayu in his heart, and found that the girls had not been bullied, Tina couldn't help but sigh. They, so happy. Such a chaotic world. A woman who has such a backer as a demon king and is not bullied by anyone is an enviable luck plus happiness in itself. Since you went to the holy land to get the treasure, why don't you take me with you? Nami spat at Bayayu, and then her eyes were full of excitement. Empty the private treasure houses of several Draco people. I don't know how many good things will be in it. It's all treasures. The women are also looking forward to 7. Chapter 115. Chapter 115 21 Female Gathering. 
all capable ones, Draco Treasure House, all looking forward to it, Bayou hasn't come back yet, seeing this, Tina couldn't help but say, don't you worry about him, Tina advises you not to underestimate the Holy Land, it's so strange that you call yourself one by one, the ghost Perona floated around Tina, circled around her, and then muttered, another big cow, damn, Robin came over and said, he didn't come back with you, but sent you to stay alone, proving that he didn't feel in danger, not feeling it doesn't mean there's no danger, we should be ready to save him, Tina immediately retorted, wow, you're finished, Bonnie cried out suddenly, what is she talking about, Tina frowned slightly, sugar skimmed her lips, Penny is right, you are really miserable, even this little girl understood, why didn't Tina understand, Vivi said bluntly, you are miserable, you have fallen in love, 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 Tina couldn't help but widen her eyes, seeing the girls nodding, and suddenly blushing urgently, what are you talking about, Tina has only known him for less than half a day, Tina is going to be angry, don't be angry, they're joking, just get used to it Marcino's gentleness eased Tina, but Tina was confused, Tina admits that she is really worried about the safety of White Feather, and Tina should thank the Demon King for taking Tina on a trip to the Holy Land, good afternoon, beauties, a figure appeared out of thin air, ah, Sir Hancock, who had not come to join in the rest of the gravity area training a thousand meters away, sensed the appearance of the white feather and rushed over. Halfway through the Overlord color release, several girls who wanted to pounce on them suddenly stopped in a trance. Bayou, because the distance is long, do not want others to snatch away the hug, so the first Overlord color impact is it. Cough, next time pay attention. Okay, let's all sit down. After warming up with the women, Bayou also took Stussy over, leading the girls to the spaceship. Bayou asked about the three girls tuning. Stussy chuckled, that female Draco Xilulia Palace, who is actually very afraid of death and timid, is still very obedient. Obedient. A hint of interest rose in the white feathers. Wait for the day to take Theolulia Palace to Chambord to see if you can kill another five old star. As for little Sadie and Domino, they, alas, Stussy looked strange and helpless. I don't know why, the more I adjust them, the more excited they are, and they seem to like this tune very much. Bayou was also speechless. Sure enough, those who have been in the city for a long time are not normal in their hearts. Little Sati shakes, S. Domino Jitter M. It seems that only the Demon King himself can do it. Let me say first, I emptied the treasure houses of the four Draco people, but they were all personal treasure houses, and they did not find the treasure house of the world government, Bayou said, and saw Nami's eyes glow. Tina couldn't help but say, haven't you encountered any danger? Danger? Bayou looked at Tina calmly until Tina blushed inexplicably and looked away, then casually said, I killed a five-old star and came back. What the? The women were stunned. In particular, Darth Vader, Tina, and Khalifa, who were once subordinate to the world government, were in a trance. Stussy also lost his voice. Five old stars? Did you kill the five old stars? Bayou's forehead, but only killed one. No big deal. This kind of thing, Bayou actually said so lightly. All the women looked at each other. Calm down. Bayou waved his hand slightly. People are dead. It's not worth caring about. Let's take a look at the treasure. All the things in the four treasure houses were released from the ring. An instant. Colorful and colorful. There is no jewelry gold, but it is basically a rare and even unique treasure in the world, which makes the women feel dazzled and forget the five old stars in an instant. Basically every piece is a rare treasure bay, otherwise it would not be deliberately put into the treasure house by the Draco people. If you have something you like, let's pick a few pieces to collect, Bay are you said, waving at Tina. Tina subconsciously got up after returning to God, and then scolded herself for being so obedient, and hummed past. Naji, holy water, angel wings, beauty Dan, fairy bin. Every time Bay are you said a little explanation of the function, he could see that Tina's expression was even more shocked. To the end, Tina was completely sluggish. Oh my God. Tina is here to heaven, so happy. No, Tina can't ask for. Tina forcibly removed her gaze from Naji and Miandan, and immediately waved her hand in refusal. As the saying goes, it's good. Reactive power is not subject to Lu. If she directly took over a few of the most precious treasures given by Bei Ayu, Tina felt that she would not be able to raise her head at all in front of Bei Ayu in the future. Bei Ayu said without hesitation. These things are available to other female crew members, if you feel embarrassed then thank me, thanks, thinking of Bayou's various bullying of her before, Tina blushed slightly, secretly looked at the girls who were picking up treasures, and instantly rippled Bayou's face, holding something and running, hey, you stole kisses on me, who would have thought that a certain demon king would shout, Tina was momentarily sluggish, the women looked over, facing the inexplicable gaze of the women, Tina's footsteps went blank, her reddish face was instantly full of blood, and she turned round and shouted, Ah, you demon bastard. Tina was angry. Half an hour later, Tina calmed down. The women also chose their favorite treasures and collected them. Dasky excitedly took two knives and handed them over. Mr. Bay are you? I found two big fast knives, none of which were damaged. It really surprised Darth Vader. To know that the big fast knife is a rare sight, can find two at a time, 
suddenly led her one step closer to the dream. Put it away. Bayou was not very interested in the famous knife, even the supreme fast knife could look at it twice at most. And, he now had a shallow fight, and he was still counting on the decapitation knife that began a day earlier, and he was even less interested in other knives. By the way, and this one, it's for you too. Bayou took out a black knife Kashui from Naji and handed it to Dusty. Dusty was stunned. Isn't this Mr. White Feather's saber? I have this enough. Bayou patted the shallow punch on his waist. Thank you, Mr. Hakuba. Looking at Bayou's unmistakable and gentle eyes, Dusky did not refuse, very moved. At present, Darth Chi has collected more than four famous knives of the big fast knife, Black Knife Kashui, and Dayoi script, plus two new ones. Ten demon fruits in total. Hankook and Stussy and Robin, each holding three boxes. Vivi was also holding a box. Are there only ten treasure houses in four treasure houses? It is estimated that they wasted a lot. However, since it can be placed in the treasure house, it must be a treasure. With that, Bayou looked forward to opening all ten boxes. Then, in the surprise of the women, Bayou raised his hand and took out four demon fruits from the ring. Fourteen demon fruits in all. These fruits are placed in front of them, making many girls look at the flowers again. Tina exclaimed, Your luck is too good. It's not luck, I took it from the capable one, and I don't need to kill it. Seeing that Tina was shocked, Bayou proposed. Your ability is very average, do you need to change one? Huh? I'll talk about it later. Tina's mood was mixed and messy. I thought I was going to hell, didn't expect to come to heaven. Tina, who had just been snatched up to join, would need at least a few days to adjust her mindset. Worthy of a treasure trove. When Bayou finished reading the ten demon fruits and comparing them with the demon fruit atlas, he couldn't help but nod. Of these ten, two esper species, two natural lineages, two top supermans, the remaining four are ancient species. Treasure trove of treasures, a little bit of calculation. Bayou suddenly wanted to kill a horse gun and empty all the treasure houses, there were too many good things. Two top superhuman lineages, mind fruit and twisted fruit. Bayou thought for a moment, put away the twisted fruit, and looked at Tina and Garrett again, the sill fruit and the butter fruit are too bad to change. Okay, Jill characteristic head. After all, butter or something, she also felt very bad. She worked hard for years to develop a near concept control skill but she could only clean up the creeps. Tina subconsciously wanted to refuse, so she heard Bayou say, it's okay not to change, go to the warm collapse tonight and choose one, question mark. Tina was confused for a moment, and was immediately ashamed, Tina is angry. It's no use getting angry. In the stunned eyes of the women, Bayou turned his hand into a knife and slammed it twice. Tina and Garrett are unconscious. Noticing that many of the girls' A's were not right, Bayou said casually, at present, at least those who are capable can change the fruit if they are powerless and strive to improve in the future. The girl knocked unconscious. The little brother is crippled. Bayou brought the two girls into the gravity space, and after taking out the fruit, he woke up the two women and brought them out. Garrett muttered, I thought I'd wake up on your bed, question mark. Bayou slightly praised, and then secretly praised. Tina looked directly at Bayou. Tina remembers you. Thank you. Bayou smiled lightly and put the fruits in the box. In these nine boxes, the natural system, the Esper species, the top Superman system, each person can take one at will. Bayou put nine boxes on the table, did not open them, and chose them at will. Currently incompetent, Nochio, Marcino, Vivi, Cornish, Little Aisha, Khalifa, Stussy, Tina, Garrett, Little Satie and Domino. Let's do I multi-tune first. Teach for a while, Bayou is not in a hurry. Darth Vader has already eaten. The natural aurora fruit, which moves like a yellow ape, can create illusions, control magnetic fields, and cut out lightning but it is not very prominent in all aspects. Aurora Sword Hordeski. There will be better ones to change later. One of the remaining nine women, Brother Bayou, were the other four selected by you to evacuate the city. Vivi is also the first time she has seen so many demon fruits. There are only two advancing cities, and the other Superman is the strongest shield of the Don Quixote family of the Holy Land. Bayou's forehead, there is also the ability of a CPO deputy chief. Now it depends on which of you has the best luck. Hearing Bayou specifically point out, Robin was curious, what fruit? Blazing Angel of Esper species. Ah. Angel. As soon as Bayou finished speaking, the women's eyes lit up, mythical creatures. Hearing that it was an angel, Nami thought, is there any elf, Medusa or something? Medusa does have. The call was answered by Han Cook, whose daughter Ryland has many records of Medusa. Bayou waved his big hand, after that, when you encounter it, grab it, try to fantasize about the myth of all the staff, if it is not together then directly change the name. The women couldn't help but laugh. If anyone has the ability to change the name of the fruit, can the name be changed at will? Bayou smiled and said nothing, this name can really be changed, the flower and fruit can be changed to, Rinrin fruit esper species thousand hands can inform. Let's eat. Seeing that the nine women of Massino had casually taken a box to open, Bayou glanced at it and said, 
first become stronger and then say, those who are not satisfied in the future may change their abilities, so they have to develop an ability to transfer the taste and turn the fruit into a fruity taste. The women agreed. Only Koya smiled lightly, and her fruit was very sweet. Soon, the results come out. Animal lineage, human fruit esper species, snow girl form, legend of a certain country that makes ice and snow monsters, Vivi. Animal cat cat fruit esper species cat form, Stussy. Animal department human fruit esper species blazing angel form, Corners. Animal line. Inuyasha fruit esper species, nine-tailed fox form, Khalifa, frost fruit, little Elsa, rain fruit, Marcino, oxygen fruit, Nokigao, mindful fruit, Garrett, divine fruit, Tina. In addition, flower robin, ice plus sweet hand cook, childlike sugar, weapons baby five, restored Koya, Yun Yun Nami, snow snow money, ghost Perona, staring violet, Aurora Darth Vader, memory Brin, and Pawnee's ability to change age, except for little Saty, Domino, and Chalulia are still in tune. If you count all the female crew members, there are currently 24, real to 21, present, fully capable, and Bayou was slightly dissatisfied. Many girls are still a little poor in ability, and even a few are still the next fruits of others, but he has time to find better and replace. Chapter 116 Chapter 116 Brother, I'm so cold. The women felt new powers, and Tina was stunned. Shinwai Fruit, this is an extremely rare space ability. Tina was shocked to feel her new ability. Two gods, really drop strong. You're in luck, Bayayashu. Remember that old man in the treasure house of the Don Quixote family? It's his, with the divine power fruit. As long as you are not careless, all the strong people on the surface at present will not be able to touch you. If you accidentally kill some strong person, I am not surprised. Tina's expression was stunned. The look in his eyes became more and more complicated, unconsciously, and he did not expect to owe more and more. After a little calculation, Robin was full of surprise, if you don't count the white feathers, we currently have four esper species and six natural lineages. Not strong enough, Bai looked at Aisha, Monet, Frost and Snow are just the lower natural system of frozen fruits. Bai looked at Majin Yuo and Nuo Kigao again. The rain and rain fruit should be regarded as the lower position of Yun Yun, but it is not right, but it is not strong. Oxygen fruit, then it must be the lower position of the air fruit. After looking at the Garrett girls, Bai continued, the Nian Li fruit is really good but it is still almost something. The stairs, the memories, the flowers, and the pennies aren't strong enough. Therefore, in the future, in addition to the top natural system and the concept Superman system, it is best to choose as per species. The women lost their voices. If in the future, all the top natural departments, top superhuman systems, and top as per species go out for a spin, I don't know how many people will be scared to death. Bayou you poured chicken soup to the girls. The dream still has to be had, in case it is realized. I have confidence. Sugar raised his hand. Me change mine, I want to grow up, be a child for the rest of your life, Bayou directly refused, although the sugar was changed, Bayou's childlike ability would not disappear, however, granulated sugar is a cute thing, you've changed, you used to want me to grow up, and you said it would be more beautiful to stand with my sister when I grew up, sugar's eyes suddenly turned red, and he hugged Monet's thigh again, sister, others want to change, why can't I do it, he bullied me again, don't cry, don't cry, there are a lot of troubles in the long assembly. Monet comforted that she didn't want Sugar to grow up. How happy it is to be a little child, and the same group pet as little Aisha. Sugar continued to cry. Whoops, he's really changed, and even our sister Flowers can't look at him. Bayou, women. Monet glanced at Bayou, and his face was suddenly flushed, and he was overwhelmed. Cough, how are you capable? Bayou looked at several less per species. The natural department of the Marcina girls. The superhuman department, listen to the name to understand. However, each esper species, in addition to physical enhancement, has its own additional special abilities. Vivi said sweetly, Brother Bay are you, my snow girl form, my special ability is frozen light, which can be matched with the cold breath of Hancock's sister. Frozen ability, a concubine will take you to familiarize yourself with the ability Hancock saw the hunter's heart happy. Cornish said, blazing angels, can fly, can manipulate the holy light, imprison, burn, heal, and so on. My cat is simpler in form able to manipulate the flames of the burning soul. A wisp of black flame at Stussy's fingertips made people palpitate. Khalifa felt the ability, the nine-tailed fox form can be transformed, and even the clothes and height can become exactly the same, but I can feel that there are other things that need to be developed. Suddenly, Stussy's eyes lit up and he looked at Penny, who was eating a lot of meat. Pony didn't know so, is there something on my face? Stussy smiled elegantly, you can control your age, and Khalifa can transform into other people. If the two of you combine, some people are probably starting to get excited. The women looked at the Demon King. Bayou, come and go for all ages. Can all women be twins? Couldn't resist. Slipped away. In the afternoon, practice. In the evening, the banquet. At night, relax. Late at night, 
Go back to the room. Baiyu was looking forward to it. He's going to keep drawing lotteries. The lottery opportunity for the three daughters of Little Saty, Domino and Tina, Charlotte Palace has not yet joined. However, the lottery can be drawn at any time, but the moment a blue-haired girl used the Esper species today, Baiyu was full of interest. Why do you love Esper species? Because there is a special atmosphere. Frozen light. Back in the room, Vivi, with a glimmer of light on her hands, was playing happily with a small water tank. Vivi, when the sound of the white feather sounded, Vivi's eyes widened a few points, and then she turned around full of surprise and saw the white feather and trotted over. Brother White Feather, Vivi's eyes were so bright, and she smiled into a crescent moon at the moment. How did you come? Just I was experimenting with the ability and it was really interesting. Gently stroking Vivi's hair, Bayou smiled lightly, like this Esper species, it will be more interesting to transform into a situation. Then I'll try. Vivi's body flashed white light. Animal lineage, human fruit Esper species, snow girl form. When Vivi transformed, Bayou's eyes lit up, as a monster that controlled ice and snow in a legend in a certain country, the snow girl form of this fruit did not have any animal characteristics. Just for a moment, Vivi grew taller, her blue hair turned ice white, her eyes turned ice blue, and her overall temperament looked extremely cold. Temperament has changed dramatically, a different style. It was really nice. Bayou praised that this style of Vivi was very attractive. After all, it is an asper species. Vivi's voice after the transformation was a little colder and she looked up at Bayou's eyes and suddenly became gentle, just ate the fruit and some of the frost that is not suitable for it, so, brother Bayou, I'm so cold, come, Vivi was so cold, as a warm big brother, Bayou opened her arms, the snow girl form of Vivi is cool and icy, but with the physical quality of the white feather, it feels very special, exceptionally good, Bayou whispered, Vivi, you've already ordered it, dot I know, at this moment, Vivi, who was a goddess of high cold, suddenly blushed and became a little cute again. 10 p.m. It seems that Brother Bayou is very fond of this time. Vivi's voice was a little smaller. Brother Bayou, I am still a little cold, in the quilt. Isn't it warmer? It's not very right. There is me in the quilt. It will be more expensive. Bayou hadn't finished speaking yet. Vivi directly tiptoed up, looked up, and the snow girl's form grew tall, just right. A few minutes later, Vivi closed her eyes and blushed at her small face and whispered, Brother, I'm cold. Bayou expressed understanding. So, in the moonlight, you stop peeping and close the curtains with your fingers. Please ask Vivi to sing a song for me. Early the next morning, breakfast time. Seeing that Vivi did not come to eat breakfast, Kia subconsciously looked at Bayou and whispered, Big brother Bayou, is Vivi's sister also sick? A certain demon king always brings disease to his sisters. So terrible. Nami skimmed her lips, took a knife and fork, and chopped a sausage. Little Brun was surprised. Infectious disease? Do you want to see a doctor? Stussy smiled elegantly. There is no cure for this disease, but the younger ones are not contagious. Hear this. The eyes of little Brun and little Aisha were red. Lord White Feather is really so pitiful. Ah uh -huh, women. Watching Kia keep looking at him, Bayou coughed lightly. Go and recover. Ten o'clock in the evening. Mm -hmm. Koya obediently left. Robin chuckled. You should change the time. Well, I'm full of hand cook. You take them to practice. I go to my room to meditate. Back to the room. Bayou let out a deep breath and looked forward to it inwardly. System. Smoke it. Ding detected the host robbing little Satie to become a crew, subordinate in the draw begins, ding, congratulations on winning the item, siren, Bayou directly clicked on the message, sirens, signals for issuing forecasts, warnings and alerting, air defense, anti-biological, ding, the optimization mechanism is detected, whether to optimize or not, optimize, ding, the space siren is optimized, optimized for the space siren, function 1, indestructible, size and form controllable outside the host cannot be moved, function 2, Customize the spatial scanning range. The maximum radius is 5,000 miles. Function 2. Any abnormal and fluctuating within the range, directly trigger the alarm. Function 3. Custom add a motion plus creature list. Space scanning range. Any non-list creatures appear, directly trigger the alarm. A bit of a concept. Bay I you read the introduction and understood. For example, if you add a women to the list, put the siren on the ship, and then set the range, then any abnormal fluctuations in any range and the appearance of others will trigger the alarm. Later, there was a fixed territory. It can directly detect 9,999% of the invasion in advance. This time, Bayou went to the Holy Land to get the treasure. If it weren't for some movement, it would be really difficult to be discovered. It also made Bayou wake up. If he really had special abilities such as space classes, it would be difficult for him to find out at the first time. After all, he would not always be open to see and smell. The safety factor has improved a lot. Bayou muttered and continued the lottery. Ding! Detected that the host robbed Domino to become a crew, subordinate, and the universal lottery began. Ding. Congratulations on winning the item. Spirit House. Bayou was surprised. It was just a spirit house, not a time and spirit house. If it is a house of time and spirit, 
it is worth surprising, after all, it has been training for a year inside, and it has only been a day outside, but unfortunately it is not. Spirit house, can make the spirit enter, life and death tempering, no injury after death, ding, trigger the optimization mechanism, whether to optimize or not, optimize, ding, the spirit house has been optimized and optimized into a spiritual space, another space, the IU found that he had to gather the heavenly imperial palace, and the immortal prison and gravity space were his unique special alien space, without his permission, unless the enemy had a strong strength far beyond Bayou's cognition, even if he was proficient in spatial ability, he would not want to enter and exit. Spiritual space. White Feather clicked on the message. Spiritual space. The host has a unique different space, and its inner space is infinitely large. Function 1. Spiritual entry. Function 2. Can customize the scene, creatures and other host fantasy of everything. Unreal and real display. Function 3. Experience. Pass. Effect 1. The battle of life and death hones combat. Experience. Will. Perseverance. Etc. Effect 2. Death within it. Mental return. Rest and recovery. Holographic virtual game? This was Bayou's first reaction. After all, Bayou can create everything in the spiritual space, and it is all illusory, allowing people to break through the level and grind. It's kind of interesting. Bayou looked at the introduction of the spiritual space again, and felt more and more interesting. Not only grinding, but also enjoying. After all, he could completely turn the mental space into the earth before he crossed, eating, drinking and having fun. Play is spiritual enjoyment. However, that was all after cultivation and I would talk about it in my spare time. Well, first create a top war, the fourth ninja war, the millennium blood war and so on, let the girls and little brothers go separately to break in. Angelic demon battle, to see the vastness of the universe, make a dragon ball again, the combat power is too collapsed to explain. The fantasy world comes to a set, and the blue and silver windings come to be funny. Bayou emitted all kinds of thoughts for a moment. Anyway, the spiritual space is infinitely large, and it is all illusory, so it is not how you want to come. Although it is impossible for the girls and brothers to directly gain strength, the broadening of their horizons and the sharpening of their will are also very important. Chapter 117 Chapter 117 Water First Star Island Continue Ding, detected that the host robbed Dina to become a crew, subordinate, and the universal lottery began. Ding, congratulations on winning the creature. The IU came to the spirit, and this was the first time he had drawn the biological class. Creatures, that must include reality all animals and plants of the fantasy class, naturally also include people. Thinking of this, Bayou subconsciously said, don't exaggerate too much. This is the universal lottery. If it is a concept, ability, item, information or the like, it doesn't matter if it is a white feather, it is a dead thing after all. What about the beings of the worlds? Small to ant weeds, large to. Bayou absolutely could not resist. System. Please don't be the old six. Ding. Draw Pokemon. Dot not bad. Bayou was neither sad nor happy. Pokemon. Pokemon, they are both mysterious and incredible creatures, with different kinds and attributes. Ding, draw Gaioka. Gaioka, the Pokemon of the water attribute legend. It is one of the ultra ancient Pokemon, the king of the deep sea. Aquaman, ding, trigger the optimization mechanism. Is it optimized? Can a creature also be optimized? Bayou thought about it for a moment and then determined. Ding, the optimization is complete. Gaioka, master of water. Species, female, elf. Ability 1, perfect control of all forms of water and perfect control. Ability 2, devouring growth, up to 18,000 meters, can freely change size and shape after adulthood. Ability 3, ability sharing. Share 1, the host will have all the powers of Gaioka. Sharing 2, self-empowerment. Gaioka can be endowed with three abilities of its own, including but not limited to natural abilities, special abilities, domineering, etc. Sharing 3, life sharing. If the host dies, Gaioka dies, and if Gaioka dies, it consumes the host's stamina to revivi. Note, this Gaioka is a female elf with great intelligence who automatically recognizes the host and obeys the host's commands, and can perceive good and evil, and to all female creatures close to their hosts, Gaioka will show kindness. It seems to have optimized the size. Is it because Ofoka is too small? Aha! Uh -huh. A one-meter-sized juvenile Gaioka appeared in White Feather's room. So small, how long will it take to grow to 18,000 meters? White Feather walked over and gently stroked the female Gaioka who was whimpering and cheering. This Gaioka is ice blue in whole, like a whale, and has two fins spread out, like two small hands, and because it is a female, the overall line is soft and beautiful. White feather evaluation, much more beautiful than in the anime. What is the master of water? Water has more than 20 forms such as solid, liquid, gaseous, glassy, plasma and so on. Clouds and rain, sea, ice, frost and fog, snow and hail due steam, etc. are all water. The controller, on the other hand, will be able to perfectly control any form and type. Your ability is very powerful, and in the future, you will be different from the White Stars Neptune, 
She controls the Neptune class, and you will be the king who controls the sea in the future. Aha, uh -huh. as your master, I give you trickler domineering, resilience, and teleportation. Aha, uh -huh. Gaioka was full of crisp screams of joy. What Baiyu chose to give was the ability he usually used the most. The most convenient and the safest. Airplanes. A white light enveloped Gaioka, and the resilience and teleportation reached the current level of white feather development. Only the trickler domineering is primary and needs to be improved step by step by Gaioka. Aha. Uh -huh. Gaioka cried out in delight when she received the ability, and then turned over. Wow Tilda. Hungry? Hikabu understood Gaioka's meaning, and then took it to the deck and introduced it to the girls first. Wow. It's so loving. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. It sounds so crisp. Like a little girl. Wow wow. Oh. Is it hungry? Wow wow wow. Watching Gaioka keep turning his belly, Hikabu chuckled softly. Okay, I'll take you to the island coast. You use your teleportation ability to leave a spatial imprint on the coast and make it easier to come back. If you want to grow up as soon as possible, there is food in the deep sea. So go and turn the sea upside down. White Feather took Gaioka to the shore, and after watching it leave a spatial imprint, he whimpered and jumped into the sea with joy. Before entering the sea, he also raised his hand like Finn at the White Feather and waved it, turned around and disappeared. Can you become an adult before you can take shape? Who knows how many years it will take. After all, Gaioka is an optimized elf, maybe it will take hundreds of years to become an adult, and Bayayu doesn't want her to be lonely in the deep sea all the time. Hurry up and grow up. I'll find you a suitable human fruit as per species. White feather can eliminate the side effects of a demon fruit in the future, so even if Gaioka eats it, he can enter the sea. And eating some special as per species, it is likely that Gaioka will speak, and even transform. For example, Vivi's snow girl form, Cornus's blazing angel form, etc. are all humanoids. So special esper species such as elves may also be humanoid. Lori Gaioka, Bayayu was looking forward to it. Both sea kings are Lori, and they directly kill the enemy, Sue. Two days later, an invisibility ship sped across the sky, just crossed the red earth, continent and directly entered the new world. After all the members became capable, Bayayu let the girls adapt for two days, and then rushed to the new world. Don't you go to Fishman Island? Holding a chart of the new world demon king sea in her hand. Nami asked, want to go to a new world? There are currently only four methods. First, a request to the world government to cross from the holy land of Mary Joya, so that the ship can only be abandoned, although it costs a lot of money to buy the ship, and the application is time consuming, but it is safe. Second, chamboard coating, diving 10,000 meters, through the red clay, land bottom giant hole, arriving at Fishman Island to replenish supplies, into the new world. Third, cross the windless zone from both sides of the new world that is, from the West Sea in the North Sea, and enter directly. Fourth, fly over. The White Feather flew over before, leaving spatial coordinates to jump in and out of space at will. And most people, it is the second method, any accident, will be dead and injured. Fishman Island can be visited at any time, but I'll take you to the New World to build a sky city. Nami, you also have to learn new knowledge of meteorology, and everyone else needs all kinds of learning and cultivation. Bayayu decided to let everyone settle down for two years, and he believed that two years was enough time to refresh the women. The women nodded involuntarily. Bayayu's growth rate is too fast, and they also need to grow and adapt to this big era that is about to start. Brew, brew. Suddenly the phone bug rang, and White Feather heard Stussy's voice when he answered. The golden lion has appeared. White Feather's eyes lit up. Good fellow, after looking for you for so long, I finally caught this lion. This time Han Cook did not follow. She also needs to guard the daughter island and Bayayu must also pay attention to the situation of the Daughter Island at any time to avoid accidents. It is because Daughter Island is too far away from the New World, even if the White Feather can teleport, it is very inconvenient. But with a fluttering fruit, it is different, and it is convenient to do anything. Even across the phone worm, Stussy on the other side could feel the happiness of Bayayu, and he also chuckled, just at 8 o'clock this morning. Above Mary Joya, a large number of islands flew majestically into the New World, and there was an extremely arrogant laugh which shocked countless people in the chamboard not far below. Worthy of you, Golden Lion. Unfortunately, even if the Golden Lion is arrogant, it only flies over the sky, instead of smashing the island with it. Bayayu calculated the time. 8 o'clock this morning? It's only 10 o'clock now, which means, nice, see you in the evening. After hanging up the phone bug, Bayayu looked to the side. Athena, turn on the radar scan. Violet, open your clairvoyance. The radar scanning range of the spacecraft and the observation range of Violet are both within a radius of 4,000 kilometers. With the joint efforts of the two sides, the Golden Lion's Island group could not escape scanning. It's only been two hours. Bayayu did not believe that the Golden Lion could fly 4,000 kilometers with the archipelago, and even if he tried hard, he would not be so fast. Well, the tea is good. Bayayu waited for the result and tasted a mouthful of tea Perona brewed by the little maid Baby Five and said curiously, since the fluttering fruit can move the island, it can also link the islands to form a continent, 
then link the islands in the sea, there is no need to take a boat to rush. Many girls' eyes lit up. Bay you had a black line. Do you think the island is a wooden barrel, floating casually on the sea? Stupid lorry. You say I'm stupid again. In fact, I'm not stupid at all. Most of the time I'm very smart. It's you who influenced me. Perona retorted again. Bay you knocked down her forehead and looked to the side. You explain. Hearing this, Robin put down the book and smiled softly. Islands can form great land. But it can only float in the sky not on the sea. Any fixed island is based on the Earth's crust, which is considered to be a land with a protruding crust movement, but because it is surrounded by the sea on all sides and the area is not large, it is called an island. The islands that have been moved away are placed on the sea, and if there is no crustal support, they will only sink slowly. Many girls suddenly realized, Bayer you couldn't help but hold his forehead, and few people in the pirate world had read the book. Tina suddenly spoke, since this is the case, when you move away from Daughter Island, you can't put it on the sea and keep floating. In the new world, we will find a larger island in our territory, survey it, and put Daughter Island on it. They are you found that Daughter Island is really small, and more taxi land is also the dream of Daughter Island. Nami put down the map of the Demon King's Sea and shook her head. I don't feel that there is a suitable place in our territory to be the main island and build the Sky City before Bayan Island. It is also only a temporary base. If you don't have it, grab it, Bay you said pointing to an island in the last half of the new world, I have arranged for Hawkeye to take them down here. This is Lufdru. Nami was surprised. All the women came to see. Athena conveniently projected some of the maps that had been entered earlier. On the projection screen, the women could see that Bayaya was pointing to the last island on the new world map before, and it seemed that there was no way behind it. Monet whispered, Rafdru, not on an ordinary map. White feather forehead, Mon is right. This island is the island that ends up converging on the recorded island with the use of the record pointer to navigate. Name, Water Star Island. The island of the Water Star was also the ultimate island recorded on ordinary world maps. There had never been any pirates coming before Roger arrived. After the Roger pirates landed, they found that the Water Pioneer Island was not the real final island, and the record pointer was also confused, and after recognizing the reality, they set sail again in search of the real final island. After kneeling down to Whitebeard and asking Mitsuki Mita to join, he found the real island of finality. Roger's name, Ralph Drew. Since then, Aquastar Island is no longer the ultimate island. Ralph Drew is Roger's name? No wonder it's so hard to hear. Hearing Bayou's complaint, Nami complained a little, a little puzzled, since only Roger pirates have been there. How do Hawkeyes find them? And Riley leads the way. That was before, since Roger and his gang landed. The Water Star Island was no longer a secret and many forces were occupying the territory nearby. In the White Feather's view, Xiangxing Island is a place of contention, and those who have the ability to come here are all strong people who have gone through the big waves and sand. There is no need for Bay Ayu to go out. Every pirate elite will automatically come to the door. Host, found it. Athena blurted out her mouth. A few seconds later, Violet, who is often an observer, then spoke. In the sky 500 kilometers to the southeast, I found a large number of islands floating and flying. It's only 500 kilometers. It was completely within the range of white feathers perception of sight and smell, so it opened the sight and smell color. Perceptual range, direct teleportation. Let's go. See the apex of the old times. The legendary pirates. The saddest thing is the theatrical version of the villain. Bay are you said the suggestion, for a while, I will not shoot first, leave it to you. All of you besieging him together is a test for you, and I don't see a problem. He didn't bother to care what the arrogant golden lion thought. Bay Ayu just wanted to see the combat level of the girls who were all capable, and they also needed to grow. We besieged the legendary pirates, is this blood, good location and nice staff. This proposal surprised the girls, and then many girls' eyes lit up. Bay Ayu also had some expectations, but right, no matter how stupid and sick she is, he is still a golden lion. But as long as the golden lion dared to release the water as in the theater version, no, let the sea go. The girls stood up. Chapter 118. Chapter 118 Pirate Admiral Golden Lion. Legends of the old times besieged by the girls. New world. The first half is high. There is a shocking scene. Dozens of large and small islands floating, flying rapidly ahead. Scenes like this. It is enough to make many pirates who have just gone to sea want to cry and go home at a glance, directly frightened. The center of the archipelago. On the main island, a patchwork of ornate buildings is scattered in parts. In the gorgeous and spacious hall, many pirates set, drank and laughed. Boss Shiki, the pirate of the new era, is not worth a legend like you. That is, just leave it to us, just a little fart who has never seen the world. Demon King, such a big breath, what qualifications does he have to be king? One by one, the pirates who had drunk too much wine shouted with red faces and thick necks. Just as the so-called wine is bold and brags, who wouldn't? Shut up Lao Tzu, the old man roared. He had long blonde hair like a lion's mane, wore a kimono, his head was inserted into the rudder, and his feet were replaced by a knife. He looked old and sick, 
but his body was full of domineering like a wild lion, and as soon as he opened his mouth, everyone held their breath. Golden Lion, Ski, Captain of the Flying Pirates. He was the first pirate in the history of Advanced City to escape. Moi is not a pirate, and the time is not right. It is one of the three legends that are on a par with Roger and Whitebeard. Fluttering Fruit Ability, Top Overlord, Top Great Sword Hero. The good man doesn't mention the courage of the year. Today's Golden Lion Shiji has long ceased to be brilliant, whether it is strength or power, it is like the gap between heaven and earth in the past. This little devil is so young. That's also a top bully worthy of recognition, not someone you crap can casually scold. The Golden Lion Shiki casually threw out the newspaper about the white feather, and after the reprimand, he laughed arrogantly, ha 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 ha. But you're right, he doesn't deserve to let Lao Tzu care too much, who is Lao Tzu? Lao Tzu is a golden lion, arrogant as a golden lion, even if he recognizes the strength of Bayu, he still will not take it in his eyes, and his personality will be so. Demon King White Feather. Even if the Golden Lion does not care about the new era and is only bent on making fierce beasts, it is still like thunder. From the time Bayu first appeared in the newspaper, news such as the Golden Lion's disciples had a great impact on the trajectory of the Golden Lion. Original trajectory. It should float in the first half of the Great Passage and the East China Sea, and finally lose to the protagonist of the times. Now, the rise of the Demon King makes Shij unable to sit still and he comes to the new world to see the color of the demon king. Really? How ridiculous you are now. Who? The voice suddenly sounded, and the golden lion Shiji looked sharp, just ready to strike, with a surprised expression. Look at your current ugliness, golden lion Shiki. As the words of the white feather fell, a mirror made entirely of ice appeared out of thin air, holding Skeelan in place. This, this is. The golden lion Ski got up and walked toward the ice mirror, his double knife stepping on the ground and sending out. The sound of Ding Ding came to the ice mirror. When he saw the things in the mirror, the golden lion looked at the len and suddenly exclaimed, How can there be a big rooster here? Who brought it? The crowd, looking at it twice, the golden lion twisted and danced in the same place, and then suddenly realized that he laughed and said, Ha 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 ha, this big rooster that will dance is so interesting. It turned out to be Lao Tzu himself. The crowd, Bayu, features, loves to kill, loves to be funny, loves to dance. Poof, like a farting sound, the man dressed like a clown walked strangely and quickly. Boss Shiji, don't dance funny, the Demon King is coming. Dr. Indigo, the ship doctor and combatant of the Flying Pirate Regiment has been working with Shiji on Q for 20 years, developing various drugs to make the island's rare beasts evolve. Phew, you can talk. Seeing that Dr. Indigo today did not express his thoughts by performing a mime, Shiji subconsciously opened his mouth. Then came the reaction. The Demon King is coming. The Golden Lion Shiji, who had just returned to God, instinctively fell to crisis, and without thinking about it, he grabbed Dr. Indigo and flew straight up. Ten thousand thunders, boom. Dense thunder fell from the sky, directly smashing the entire palace, and many pirates who did not react turned into black charcoal. Indigo, stay away. A golden figure rose from the ruins, and when Ski dropped Dr. Indigo and flew up, he saw that the sky was covered with thunderclouds. Above, an orange-haired girl floated in midair, fist to fist at him. Ha 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 ha. Lao Tzu thought who was attacking, but he didn't expect it to be just a little girl. Glancing at Lian again, and looking at Nami, who had no fear of him at all, the golden lion couldn't help but open his mouth casually, it seems that you don't know who Lao Tzu is, Lian put it away, otherwise as soon as Lao Tzu strikes, you are gone. Department of Nature, the golden lion came to the spirit, such a young girl, the potential can be much stronger than the recently recruited waste. Isn't it the legendary pirates, wait until you defeat us? With Bei you watching, Nami was not afraid at all and raised her hand again to condense the thundercloud. We, Shiki the golden lion stared round, looking high in the distance. There was a spaceship hundreds of meters in size, slowly retreating into invisibility and revealing itself. The next moment, whoosh, a series of cracking sounds sounded. In the stunned eyes of the golden lion Silu, a beautiful woman with white wings spread behind her, dressed in white battle suits, flew rapidly. In the blink of an eye, all swirled far into the air, encircling the golden lion Shiki. Click, the white feather on the spaceship, holding a camera phone worm to take a photo. It's a great scene. Hancock and Stussy didn't come and were still tuning. Little Satie and Domino and Chalulia in the church are also absent. The remaining 19 sisters, all of them spread their angel wings, dressed in uniform white battle suits, and hovered slowly in the air, all surrounded like angels with a legendary sea thief. You guys, Siege of Lao Tzu, the Golden Lions all looked at Len, traversing the sea for decades. He never thought that one day, he would be besieged by a group of women. Ha 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 ha. The police went to the side of the spaceship to watch the drama and take pictures of Bayu, and the golden lion Shiji laughed angrily, the strongest demon king in a new era, how arrogant, do you think Lao Tzu is not worthy of letting you shoot? Did you let them take a shot to humiliate Lao Tzu? Whoosh. The next moment, the golden lion Shiki rushed into the air and actually touched the thunderclouds, surprising Nami. Robin sighed softly, be careful, 
Except for living beings, he can control anything tangible that touches. However, I am a person with the ability of cloud fruit. Nami said for a moment, because she found that her thundercloud was completely out of control. Bayayu still watched quietly when he saw this, when the difference in strength between the two was too large, control would naturally be given to the stronger side. Ha ha, are you just looking at it, the demon king of the new age? Noticing that Bayayu was still watching the drama and taking pictures, the golden lion was extremely angry, then take a good look at it. Give Lao Tzu death. Lion why my her cloud roll? The touched thunderclouds were completely in the hands of the golden lion, and in an instant, dozens of huge thundercloud giant lions of hundreds of meters were formed in the sky. A large number of cloud lions roared fiercely and pounced on the women. Ability to recover. Kora flew past with the help of angel wings and unleashed the power of recovery. Same moment. Cloud gun. 36 rounds of blossoming. Ghost bomb. Blizzard. Laser cannon. Kamui. Nami throws a dense cloud gun above. Robin blossoms and wins. Corona and Monet are also amplifying moves. Baby 5 releases the newly learned laser cannon, and Tina directly distorts the space where Shiki is located. Straight ahead, six girls who spread their angel wings and rushed into the air. Tears of hot iron wail. Mindfulness shock. Frost array. Aurora cuts the rain. Frozen light. Vacuum world. Violets steal whale tears. Garrett's mind power. Frost fruit little Aisha's frost cold. Aurora fruit Darth Vader's slash. Esper species snow girl form Vivi's light. Oxygen fruit Nogi high pumping oxygen. Directly behind Shiji, the six girls who spread their angel wings and rushed into the air. Rainstorm pear blossom needle. Nine-tailed Arashi. Judgment of the holy light. Feather of the gods times three. The dense rain needles of the rain fruit Marcino. The phoenix feet of the Esper species nine-tailed fox Khalifa. The Esper species blazing angel cornices holy light. The three god feathers a little brin and sugar and the three daughters of Penny. Attacking with angel wing feathers. These are the six girls directly below Shiki spreading their angel wings and flying, exclamation mark. After Koya used his ability to recover, the golden lion was shocked, because he lost control of the cloud lion. The gap between Koya and the golden lion was extremely large, not a matter of one or two levels, and it was enough to make his ability lose control for a second or two. Because in this trance, the attack of the remaining 18 girls was issued. The first to arrive was Robin's ability to blossom directly on Shiki, trying to twist him, completely twisted. Instead, he pulled the golden lion back from his shock and saw all kinds of attacks in all directions. Space warp, sensing the crisis, Shiji found that the space around him formed a whirlpool, and suddenly pulled away. Boom. After the golden lion dodged away, it raised its foot to smash the baby five laser cannon, while Cornus's holy light and Vivi's frozen light arrived from both the rear and below. Die for Lao Tzu. The golden lion's eyes widened, directly ignoring the dozen or so attacks in the rear and below. He raised his feet and slashed forward. Chopper. A golden light flickered in the void. The golden lion kicked out a huge slash wave with its foot, and instantly rushed to the front of Nami 6. Halfway through, all the attacks coming from the front were shattered. Boom. The next moment, the attacks from the rear and below exploded directly like fireworks in the golden lion's place. Rush. Robin. Monet. Nami. Perona. Baby 5. Five girls who attacked from the front were transferred to the ship by White Feather. Only Tino was still there, because the entity is in a different space. The two gods are very safe. Whoops. Rumble. With a sudden roar. The women looked into the distance and held their breath. The golden lion's condensed slashing wave instantly cut open a small island, straight for tens of miles, rushing towards the sea. This slash. Dasky glanced at him in amazement and lost his voice. Flying so long? You have failed, and if you don't transfer, you will be chopped up. Bayayu's words made Nami's five daughters afraid. Bayayu also looked down on the slash just now and had to say that this was the slash with the longest attack range of the enemy that he had seen with his own eyes at present. Golden Lion Shiji's sword skills were all condensed and condensed, and this slash was enough to cut through hundreds of miles of sea. Keep attacking. Watching Vivi and the other women finish the big move and wait for the result, Bayayu shouted loudly, the enemy is not sure of defeat or you are not defeated, don't stop, Lion Mighty Snow Roll. At the moment when Bayayu's words fell, Mone found that the snowstorm he had sent out earlier was out of control. Ha 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 ha. It's amazing that all the people have the ability to do it. There are also several natural, esper species, and control classes, space classes. After the serial explosion of fireworks disappeared, the golden lion Shiji appeared unharmed, surprising the women. Armed color defense? The women could only think so. Although their strength is not strong, each ability attack has its own characteristics. The collection explosion, if not any defense, it is impossible to be unharmed. Huh? Sensing that the breathing problem was very uncomfortable as if there was no oxygen, the golden lion frowned and raised his hand to attack. Noki exclaimed. Did I find out that I sucked out oxygen? Roar. The blizzard turned into a huge lion, covering the past with all the women. Ability to recover. Koya spread her angel wings and spun around, once again causing Shiji's ability to lose control for a second or two. Tina sighed, spread out and attack from all directions, 
and if you don't attack enough, use the God Feather, Kamui, taking advantage of the moment when Koa made Shiji's ability get out of control, as well as the distortion of space. The remaining 13 girls who had not yet failed scattered, flying up and down where Shiji was, attacking in all directions. Chapter 119 Chapter 119 Roger Scum, and you're licking the dog. Feather of the Gods Due to the effect of the feather attack of the angel wings, Many girls flew back rapidly while firing feathers. State restoration. Vacuum world. The holy light imprisons. Frozen light. Koya tries again to interrupt the golden lion's control over the snow lion, and Noki Gao amplifies the oxygen extraction range. Cornice's blazing angel light contains the effect of biological action confinement, and Vivi's frozen light is extremely fast. What? The golden lion's key was shocked again, and the previous ability was out of control for a second or two. And now, Shiki found that all his attacks, defenses, etc., all solidified, causing him to freeze his reaction. It is so. Bayou also found at this moment that Shiji's state did not regress like a time reversal, but only stagnated for a second or two. This shows that if the difference in strength is too large, the role of resilience is not large, and Bayou has not experienced it. After all, his first real battle was four stars against five stars, only one level behind, so Hawkeye could not resist. Or can only make the Golden Lion slow down, but will not fully recover. However, Enough is enough, boom. Even if it is delayed for a second or two, the attack of the women fell on Shiji, and the explosion that had previously appeared like fireworks reappeared. Click, click, click. Vivi's frozen light swept through the golden lion and turned into a powerful cold, freezing it high in the air. Aurora chop, rainstorm pear blossom needle, nine-tailed arashi, feather of the gods. This time, the girls did not stop, and the ranged attack was released again. Mighty, kill. When Tina's spatial force twisted past, it directly turned the space where the Golden Lion was located into a whirlpool. Ha! Huh. Tina took a deep breath. The Shinwa long-range attack consumed too much. This also led to a large range of spatial vortexes that could only turn into small ones, with Tina concentrating on twisting the head of the Golden Lion. Boom! At this moment, a terrifying momentum suddenly exploded. Top Overlord colors. The momentum was as fast as thunder, and it instantly swept in all directions, making the women shocked and their brains go blank. Whoops. Under the slightly raised eyebrows of the white feather, Correa, Vivi, Elsa Jr., Marcino, Nochio, Violet, Cornish, Garrett, Bryn Jr., Sugar, Khalifa, Pauni. Twelve girls. The brain went blank, and the angel wings lost control so the girls fell like dumplings. Still only Tina remains. The body was in a different space, and the Overlord color did not affect her. Overlord, much stronger than Han Cook's. Only Darth Vader is also brain hissing, dangling in the air and falling at any time. Lion Mighty Roll. A few small islands floating not far below were directly shattered. All of them turned into huge lions of hundreds of meters, covering the sky like a tsunami. The next moment, whoosh, the twelve girls who had fallen before flew up again, and the fall just now was only a blank moment in the brain and did not make the girls directly unconscious, because the first lesson of the girls' daily training is to withstand the impact of Han Cook's Overlord color. Bayou also often used the Overlord color to train the will of the women. More than a month has passed, passing out once or twice a day, and now, even little Aisha and Sugar and little Bryn will not be directly stunned by the Overlord color. However, it is still impossible to avoid the short circuit of the brain. Be careful, Tina exclaimed. Because of the blank brain moment, the girls just flew up and ushered in a violent tsunami of lions, and it was too late to react effectively. Brush brush brush, Bayou raised his hand, and the women who were too late to react were transferred back. Only Tina's body remained in a different space, and the projected figure was drowned out by the lions. Plus Robin, Baby Five, Nami, Perona, Monet's five daughters who were transferred back before. Remove Tina. Eighteen sisters. Total defeat. The white feathers were calm. This result, Bayou said that he accepted it calmly. After all, this is the real world, and it is impossible to let the golden lion Shiki release water, release the sea and then kill the various plots in the theatrical version. Come back to Tina, the battle is over and you've won. Bayou's words stunned Tina and Robin and other women. That's not right. Where did they win? Ha 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 ha. Lao Tzu actually lost. Lao Tzu actually lost to a dozen nameless little girls. The golden lion, Shiki, reappeared, laughing at himself. Hearing this, Nami couldn't help but mutter. I'm very famous I remember. Look at it from a distance. The golden lion did not look like there were too many scars on his body and he was not seriously injured at all. But, when Robin looked at the head of the golden lion, they suddenly saw a blood hole that kept bleeding, making his blonde hair red in large pieces. The rudder was broken. Watching the rudder above the golden lion Shiki's head shatter, Bayou shook his head slightly. So you suddenly exploded into a tyrannical color, as if in an instant you had changed back to the former overlord pirate admiral, and now it seems you did lose. Golden lion Shiki was silent. At this moment, the mind seems to be pulled back to decades ago. Roger reigned two or three years ago. The three legends dominate the new world, 
and the most powerful and prestigious at that time was the Flying Pirate Regiment. The dense archipelago and ships that floated up made countless sea thieves lose their voices and their scalps tingle. In a sea, the ambitious Shiji finally found an opportunity to surround Roger's pirates. Roger's ship versus hundreds of fleets in the large archipelago of Streak. The crowd rushed up, the Golden Jackson had to overturn the ship, and the crew who fell into the sea could only usher in the siege and destruction. This is the case. Roger had no hope of victory, because at sea, there are too many ways for so many people in Shiji to destroy Roger pirate ships. The results can be reversed. The Roger pirate regiment, which was originally at the end of the road, was saved by a sudden storm, and most of the large fleet of the flying pirate regiment was thrown to the bottom of the sea. Roger took the opportunity to flee. The worst consequence, a rudder accidentally inserted into Ski's head, and if it is removed, it will undoubtedly die. Battle of Eight Wall The Golden Lion ended dismally because the great fleet was destroyed by the storm, and because of the rudder problem. He was silent for two or three years. Waking up the unconscious girls, Bayou told the women, but it has only been two or three years, and the news of Roger's claim to the throne has instantly caused a sensation in the world. The Golden Lion went crazy looking for Roger, but finally received the news that Roger was arrested and about to be executed in the weakest sea, the East Sea and he was extremely angry and went to the naval headquarters alone. Fight to the death. In the end, under the joint siege of Sengoku and Karp, Marin Fando was destroyed in half and arrested and imprisoned. The women lost their voices. One is to marvel at the blood-colored old man in front of him is actually the most powerful legend in the past, the second is to lament that the other party's luck is too bad, and the third is to shock the other party to dare to break into the naval headquarters alone. Perona wondered, why did he and you both fail? Stupid lorry, knocking on Perona's forehead, Bayou explained. Didn't you say before that the rudder on his head cannot be dismantled, and once he is removed, he will die? You coincidentally broke his rudder, and he's not far from death. The end result, he dies, you live, that is victory. I see. The women were not in the slightest excited. If it weren't for the rudder problems and disabilities of the other side, coupled with the care of the white feathers, then they would have a very miserable result, and there was nothing to be proud of. Vivi also wondered, if the fluttering fruit wants to leave. It is difficult to be caught. Why can't you retreat from the battle? You'll lose his mind for Roger. Bayou answered casually. Hearing this, Shiji shouted angrily. Lao Tzu does not believe that Roger will be arrested. Even more unable to accept that he was sent to the weakest sea for execution, which is an insult to a man approved by Lao Tzu. Phew. Bayou snorted disdainfully, which immediately made Shiji's anger boil. Send a guy to death for a good luck beating you. Lick the dog. Looking at Shiji's scolded expression, Bayou continued. In addition, Roger was already suffering from an incurable disease before he became king, and he turned himself in to open the era of the sea thief. Speaking of this, Bayou was angry. Roger knew he was 49 years old when he was suffering from an incurable disease. Barrett was confused and disembarked. Setting sail again, Roger invited Kurokas to serve as the ship's doctor while passing through the lighthouse of the Upside Down Mountain, ensuring that he would be able to complete the journey smoothly. 52 years old, king. In the same year, the pirate regiment was disbanded. The point. Three or four years ago, Roger knew he was going to die of illness, not after he disbanded. But, Roger, who knew that he would die of illness, still married Luju. One side, a bad old man in his fifties who is about to die of illness. One side, Luju is very good. At this point, the nearby residents also praised the two people for being very affectionate. White Feathers said her. If the residents knew that Roger was dying of illness in his fifties and would plague the little girl, perhaps all the men and women on the island would spit on Roger shameless slut knowing that he was going to die of illness he still went to play gluju and even the mother and son could not take good care of it and threw it to kapuguan proper scum shit one piece turning yourself in the golden lion shiji muttered sluggishly and finally laughed ha 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 was it originally turned in lao tzu knows that he will not be easily arrested but the man who defeated lao tzu using death to open the era of sea thieves lao tzu served Bayou also took it roger abused the lion a thousand times and the lion treated Roger like a first love. Can he obviously only lose to the era protagonist Tora, and just lost that time? Shiji obeyed. The original trajectory, successively lost to two protagonists of the era who came out of the East China Sea. Shiji's also sad enough, a scumbag, a licking dog. You really make me admire. Bayou sighed and was slightly surprised. How long has the rudder on your head been broken? Why haven't you died? At this moment, the blood on Shiji's head had dyed his blonde hair red and turned into a red lion's head. Ha 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 ha. Shiji laughed inexplicably. In the end, the Convergence smile ignored the white feather, and the golden lion looked at the cute Miss Koya. Before the ability was out of control, the state was slow. You did it, right? It's just that the difference in strength is not reflected more, but Lao Tzu seems to understand what ability it is. The golden lion Shiji was very sure, and then clenched his right fist full of expectation. Come, cure Lao Tzu's disability, 
Become Lao Tzu's right arm. You have no future if you follow this flower-hearted demon king LSP. The women laughed. White feathers are blackened. Knowing that he was a disabled person and still dragging him so much. He also scolded him for LSP, which was really a girl who could bear it, and the demon king could not bear it. Rush, Bayayu instantly came to the golden lion Shijia and directly raised his feet, an old, weak, sick and disabled old era, who also deserves to rob me. Ha 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 ha, you finally can't help but shoot. Bayayu suddenly appeared in front of him out of thin air, and the golden lion was not surprised, but instead boiled with war. The rudder shattered, the golden lion already felt that life was passing rapidly, and at the end of his life, he could meet Bayayu, a top overlord who had proved himself many times, which was enough to make him die in the sea with glory. Oh demon king of the new age, fight with Lao Tzu, take Lao Tzu's head, and turn the world upside down, ha 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 ha. The afterglow of life. The domineering golden lion like a wild lion, is full of heroic laughter. Raise your feet and slash violently. Sigur at ten, dead wood. Two famous knives instead of legs, instantly kicked a few times. Lion thousand cut valley. Chopper upgrade, several slashes that are enough to shred the sea are incomparable. Unfortunately, the golden lion's kicks and slashes were so strong and his hands were absolutely top-notch sword masters. Bayayu directly ignored the incoming slash, kicked the armed color out, and after kicking it out, it turned into a shockwave that penetrated the sky. Too much nonsense, get me out of here. Boom. Shiki's pupils constricted. His slash was shattered by the armed shock in an instant, and the undiminished moment of power overwhelmed him. So, all the women saw was a firework exploding, and then a golden figure was blasted away by the shockwave. Bang bang bang. Rumble. The upside-down Shiji crashed into the island like a golden light smashing into large blocks of buildings and trees and stones along the way, smashing into the ruins. Chapter 120 Chapter 120 Pretending to force the golden lion to shock to death No one believes it. Rush White Feather came to the island and calmly waited for the golden lion to climb out. If you lose to Roger, you're too unlucky, but if you lose to the straw hat boy, that can only be said. Forget it, don't mention it. Bayayu you thought inwardly. The villain who lives in the theatrical version, no matter how cattle you are, even if you can break new ground you will still lose to the freedom of the protagonist. Poof, ha 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 ha, the strongest pirate in the new era, the demon king Bayayu, Lao Tzu Golden Lion recognizes you. Out of the dust, the Golden Lion Shiji was dressed in rags, and he vomited a few mouthfuls of blood as he walked, but he did not lose his arrogance and laughter. It's a really tough kick. Golden Lion Shiji sighed inwardly, and the armor color quality of Bayayu's foot completely broke the norm. After seeing Bayayu, he understood that the current new era was really catching up with or even surpassing the old era. You old legends are really interesting, and you can't stop saying that Lao Tzu recognizes you. Thinking of what Whitebeard said when he saw himself, Bayayu instantly drew his sword. I don't need your approval. Kneel down for me. What the? The next moment, the golden lion looked shocked, and its body flew uncontrollably towards the white feather, falling directly. Kneel on the ground. Pick up the knife empty-handed. Yu Yu, flying to his knees to take the knife with his bare hands. The golden lion Shiji felt an unprecedented shock and anger. This kneeling. What a humiliation. Bayayu looked down at the old legend of kneeling, and said indifferently, Just pull out a knife at random. You will be scared to run to your knees and wipe the knife. Roger will spit on you. Damn, obviously you little devil controlled me. Does it matter? Dot. The golden lion fell silent. Yes, it doesn't matter one, three or seven. The world of the strong never looks at the result, never looks at the process. The winner has everything. How arrogant Shiji was. He never made excuses for failure, and failure was defeat. So, when Roger luckily knocked him down from the top, he was not ashamed of his luck, but instead admired Roger to defeat him. S-H-H-H. After breaking the pride, Bayayu sheathed the knife and said plainly, A hundred more times, you will still kneel, don't want to be humiliated again, just be honest. Of course, you can try again, you're going to die anyway. The rudder was shattered, it's going to die. The golden lion Shiji opened his mouth but did not say anything and sat on the ground sideways and fell into various memories, and Bayayu seemed to see the twilight of the lion. One of the most painful things is to wait for death. Last time I used too much force, I accidentally killed Whitebeard. This time, Bayayu thought, moments later, feeling that life was passing faster, and at most a few minutes before facing death, the golden lion suddenly opened his mouth in a low voice, little devil king of the new era, what is your dream? Become the master of the world. Bayayu replied simply with six words. This. The golden lion ski looked slightly stunned, his eyes flashed with memories, and he murmured, that's really, untouchable dreams. He and Whitebeard, Big Mama, Kaido, and others, once the old captain of Locks, have the same ambitions. But in the end, he didn't even see what the holy land looked like, and he was defeated. Not to mention being the master. Bayayu sat down on the island cloud seat, gently wiped the shallow hit, and said casually, 
Then what conditions do you think I need to meet to complete this small goal? Small goals? The golden lion wanted to scold the mother, and the young people of the new era now were simply 10,000 times madder than they were in the old times. The golden lion who was about to die didn't bother to say anything else, and suddenly laughed proudly, ha 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 ha, as long as you gather 20 subordinates who are not weaker than Lao Tzu's heyday, then Lao Tzu is willing to call you the king of the world, Bei Ayu said plainly, you're only 20 in your heyday. It's amazing, I can kill them all by myself, boom, the sillies burst out, and Bei Ayu continued to wipe the shallow blow in his hand lightly, and did not pay attention to him at all, you look down on Lao Tzu, the golden lion she just stared at the calm, white feathers deadly, and after a moment, he cried out in a domineering manner, No, you're trying to be real. Lying in front of my shrive? No way, Bei Ayu said bluntly. Beyond the top trickler domineering spirit, beyond the physique of all the generals, beyond the sword play of the great sword hero? Question mark. The miracle of flowers and flowers plus childlike fun, the combination of immortality plus teleportation, dozens of special abilities are gathered in one of me! Exclamation mark. Isn't it hard to kill twenty of you in your heyday? Answer me, golden lion sluggish. He could understand every word Bei Ayu said, but when combined, it directly shattered his worldview. Is he still human? How can there be such a being? You, get it? Well, Bei Ayu admitted that he had indeed oversplown his head a little, because the sword play has not completely surpassed the great sword master. The overlord color is still at the top level, and it has not surpassed everyone yet. In the white feather's view, the breakthrough of sword play depends on the accumulation of feelings and grinds which takes a lot of time, and the freedom of the mind is not enough to make the overlord break through, and even the biggest goal is not enough, what must be done, such as the complete occupation of the new world. But, killing twenty golden lions in their heyday is still no problem. Poof, the golden lion was silent for half a minute and suddenly fell to the ground. Bei Ayu's action of wiping the knife was delayed, and his expression became strange. Golden lion, he's dead? Question mark. Watching the golden lion fall to the ground without breath, Bei Ayu hurriedly checked and couldn't help but be full of black lines. Hey, don't die, really dead. Just looking at the dress, I even forgot that he was dying, and the result was that the pretending was too much, and I was directly shocked to death. In other words, the golden lion whose rudder was broken was on the verge of death, and he was seriously injured by Bei Ayu, and he had a few breaths left, and he was forced to kneel down by a knife, and his heart was indignant. Even if Bei Ayu did not speak, he would die within a few minutes at most. But as soon as Bei Ayu opened his mouth, the golden lion was too excited and became the last grass that overwhelmed the camel. Go with white beard. Bei Ayu turned back and directly threw the golden lion into the prison of immortality. Devil fruit is time sensitive. After Bei Ayu has verified many times, the fruit ability does not leave at the moment of the host's death. At least stay for a few minutes. Take advantage of the golden lion's ability to leave. Throw it into the prison of immortality. Careless again. Pretending to force the golden lion to die of shock. No one believed it. Bei Ayu rubbed his brow. These days. He has accidentally killed two of the top legends of the old times, Whitebeard and Golden Lion. Boom, the Sky Archipelago shook. On the spaceship, Nami shouted, White Feather be careful, all the archipelagos are going to fall. Space transfer, White Feather instantly senses all the archipelago palaces and transfers all the items within it to gravity space. The Golden Lion is a legendary pirate, and the island's heritage is quite large. After the inheritance is transferred to the gravity space, then take the sister to slowly pick it. Dr. Indigo, ignoring the other pirates. Bei Ayu thought about it a little after seeing Dr. Indigo. Snap, snap your fingers out. Dr. Indigo weakly turned into a toy and was thrown directly into the prison of immortality. When Bei Ayu returned to the spaceship, he was surrounded by the girls. Robin was astonished, seeing what you are saying from a distance. How did he suddenly die? If the ability is out of control, it may be unconscious, Sugar muttered, and she was unconscious and out of control. It's really dead. Bei Ayu didn't say much either. Otherwise, if you say the specific situation, you always feel that the explanation is not clear. Nami couldn't help but remind, remember to recycle the fluttering fruit. I'll take care of it. Bei Ayu thought about the method. Undead prison. It was still so bloody and silent, chilling. Since the first batch of prisoners such as Sand Crocodile and Aniru went out, the second batch of prisoners also officially appeared here, and Bei Ayu still ignored them. Heir of the Devil, Douglas Barrett, Fruit of the Fit, Lonely Red, Barolic Lederfield, currently fruitless. Bat Fruit as per species, found in sleeping ancient town after being released from prison, frozen world destroyer, Bundy Waldo, Momo Fruit, Fishman Island Blue Fat Man, very flat, only four are alive, except for the frozen Waldo, he did not wear handcuffs and leggings, and moved freely in prison, other crew members like San Juan Evil Wolf, Katarina Dupon, Chote, Pizarro and other original trajectories Blackbeard crew, all slaughtered by White Feather, Cowleafers as per species, the Nine-Tailed Fox, was stripped of Dai Beng, and at the moment, there's one more living person in the undead prison, Drive, Indigo, exclamation mark. Waldo was still frozen, 
and the three of them were stunned at the moment. What did they see? The body of a man who looked like a wild lion fell and was automatically locked in a cell. Shiki, Golden Lion, Ryder and Barrett opened their mouths at the same time, and their faces changed slightly. After all, the Red Earl was a man of the same era as the Golden Lion, and the two had fought several times, and they were very familiar. Barrett, of course has also met the Golden Lion and has been a prisoner for a year. Barrett was imprisoned the year after Roger's execution, and at that time, Shiji had been in custody for a year, and the next year Shiji broke his leg and escaped. Golden Lion, before he could recognize who the corpse was, he heard the two men open their mouths, and their pupils suddenly narrowed, the Demon King. What exactly do you want to do? Disobeying the legends of the old times, will they be killed? Riley joined, and the bodies of Whitebeard and Golden Lion are still in the cell. This was the result that Ping saw and he couldn't help but wonder if the Demon King wanted to accept the legends of the old times, and those who disobeyed had to be killed. It sent a chill in his heart. Shiji, for many years like yesterday, you also died Redfield came to the prison, looked at the Golden Lion's head with a blood hole, ragged clothes, and couldn't help but sigh. Moreover, the death is so miserable. This is the end of the Sea Thief. Roger is dead, Newgate is dead, and so is Skucky. Is that all I have left? Redfield recalls the top pirates of his contemporaries. He was too lonely to be in the company of others and had no companions. But this did not prevent him from recognizing the three legends of his contemporaries, believing that only strong people like them were worthy to communicate with himself. And now, all Ryder felt at the moment was inner emptiness, true loneliness. Well, that just means he's not strong enough. Barrett snorted coldly, but his face was equally ugly. The existence of the immortal prison surprised him, because there was no need to eat, drink, sleep, etc., and it was too suitable for cultivation. But the prison of immortality also made him uncomfortable, because he absolutely could not go out, more desperate than advancing into the city. Daddy isn't dead. Xi Ping's roar was full of unwillingness, and then his eyes were full of blood and tears. The most painful thing he felt now was not going to the top of the water to see the living white beard for the last time. Hearing this, Barrett was immediately angry, and he kicked Trey over, shout several times a day, Are you an idiot? You crap, look at your eyes wide, your father who has long been dead and can't die anymore. The incense, the incense, flew upside down and hit a cell, and when he looked up, he saw a tall, strong, scarred blood-colored corpse. Edward Newgate, Daddy. Xi Ping burst into tears again. Every time I look at this cell these days, I want to cry. Xi Ping stood up and shouted angrily, Demon King, White Feather, you come out. Daddy died at your hands, but it don't you even give Daddy a chance to be buried? What do you want to do? Treat the corpses of the strong ones you killed as a collectible. Come out. What Xi Ping couldn't stand most was that his father died so tragically, and Bai Yu threw the body into prison, which in his opinion was humiliating. Does the Demon King really want to use the corpses of the strong as a collectible? Redfield and Barrett both frowned slightly. Shadow Fruit. Redfield, who had an extremely broad knowledge, thought of something, and his face was a little ugly. I remember that I can manipulate my own shadow or cut off the shadow of others, and I can also put the shadow that leaves the human body into the corpse to make zombies. You mean? Barrett clenched his fists. Ryder's voice was flat. The strong who die are also valuable. Being a zombie, with a powerful body left to other shadows to control, is a good force for many careerists. Boom. Barrett smashes the ground with one punch, but the ground recovers directly the next second. Kill the strong to make zombie waste. This kind of result, which strong person can accept it? Barrett couldn't accept it. Watching Barrett vent his anger, Ryder said coldly, What's the use of anger? If he wants to kill us, can you stop him now? Don't forget that you and I haven't recovered our strength, and don't forget his childlike fruit. Damn, whoops. Barrett growled unwillingly. A black and red storm erupted throughout the undead prison, and the terrifying overlord color made the distant sheeping to breathe. Snap. Suddenly clapping applause rang out. Sheeping was full of anger, and Barrett and Ryder looked at it coldly. I have to say, you guys are pretty good at brain patching but it's ridiculous. The IU appeared out of thin air and threw down two vicious pirates who had been maimed. Zombies? Litter. What makes the corpse of a strong man into a zombie? As a force, the IU can't see it. Still collecting humiliating corpses? You all have a disease in your brain. The IU said plainly, I don't want to turn it into a toy, so give me honesty. The three of them held their breath. They vividly remembered the feeling of turning into a toy with hundreds of thousands of prisoners in gravity space. Too powerless. Chapter 121. Chapter 121 Flashy. Momo. The three of them held their breath for a moment. It was in the midst of the atmosphere of depression. Xi Ping directly knelt down and lamented, This life is for you. Please Lord Demon King to give old further a chance to bury. Bei Yu said plainly, You think I'm humiliating them, isn't it? Xi Ping could only think so, otherwise what was the use of the corpse with the white beard and the golden lion? Bei Yu glanced at the three of them. It is sad to try to speculate on the thoughts of the true god from a mortal point of view. Three, damn, he's got it. Rush. White Feather came to the frozen Waldo and under the gaze of the three people, White Feather slowly raised his hand, a piece of waste, 
not worth my waste of time, Bayou's words rang out, he really didn't look at the world destroyer himself, and Momo fruit was too wasteful to put on him, the physical skills are too poor, the sword skills are too poor, the domineering is even worse, and the age is old, full of weaknesses, full of destructive desire, there is nothing but throwing bombs to wreak havoc, and if you give the Momo fruit to your subordinates, such as her, Aru, Kaiji, etc., you are far better than Waldo. Capacity transfer, Bayou took out an apple and recycled the Momo fruit, exclamation mark. Ryder frowned slightly, and Barrett was shocked. They actually saw that White Feather had stripped Bondi Waldo of the demon fruit in the ice. Moreover, the other person is not dead, boom. Under the slight tremor in the hearts of the three people, Bayou smashed the ice cube with one punch. Even Waldo, which was frozen inside, turned into detritus. Dead without a corpse, tough enough. This made the three of them feel a little cold inside, but they were not afraid, but death but Bayou was too fierce, the other party was a world destroyer, but before he could say a word, he was deprived of his fruit and killed, dead, without dignity, the next moment, White Feather collected the fruit and turned and walked towards the cell of White Beard and the Golden Lion, you, what Xi Ping wanted to say, suddenly, there was a snap sound, it was the ringing finger of the White Feather, and even Ping turned into a toy and died, huh, Ryder and Barrett looked at the toy that suddenly appeared, and their hearts were slightly shocked, Bayou must have used the childlike fruit, just don't know who this toy is, they must know, but the memory disappears in an instant. This made the two look slightly dull, forgotten by everyone, become a toy that everyone plays with. This kind of thing, as long as it is an individual, it is unacceptable, let alone the top strong. Bayou ignored the two of them, locked them up for a while, and looked at the corpses of Whitebeard and Shiji in the cell. It's time for me to settle down and develop the recovery to the awakening first. When the time comes, there will be no more restrictions on the recovery of life, the recovery of death etc., Bayou attaches great importance to the restoration of fruits, and the ability of other fruits is only to enrich the means, knows Songbrook, after death the soul enters the yellow spring, because of the ability, and then out of the yellow spring, what does this mean, when people in the pirate world die, the soul will enter the yellow springs, to be precise, first of all, out of the soul, if Bayou is the god of death, destroying the master, breaking the face, etc., it will be simple, it also means, you're looking at me, aren't you, Newgate, Ski. White Feather looked at the bodies of White Beard and Golden Lion. This is a prison of immortality. Any energy, non energy, matter, non material, etc., as long as the White Feather is not allowed, absolutely cannot go out. The two died, both transferred into the immortal prison within a minute, and the fruit ability had not left, so the soul naturally did not leave. So, the soul cannot enter the Yellow Spring, can only stay in the prison of immortality, and because of the particularity, the soul will not die. White Beard, Golden Lion, Hell. We're all dead and can this demon king still see? Their souls were indeed imprisoned in the prison of immortality, even in the cell where the corpse was located, and did not dissipate. What to say, what to do, Ryder and others could not find out. Eye of the soul, soul fruit is launched. White Feather instantly developed a skill that was specifically designed to observe and communicate with souls. Seeing the two stupid big ones looking at themselves in a daze, Bayaya was surprised. Interesting. There are even clothes on the soul that cover your soul before you died. White Beard, Golden Lion. This Demon King is really an amazing way of thinking. No one has spoken until now, so the soul cannot get out of the cell and cannot speak. Then watch. Bayou didn't feel that the two didn't want to say a word. White Beard definitely cared about his sons, and the Golden Lion must scold the mother, because his death method was too humiliating. Capacity transfer. The two apples in Bayou's hand turned into demon fruits again. Shock the fruit. Fluttering fruit. White Beard, Golden Lion. Exclamation mark. Ryder and Barrett looked slightly mixed, as if they saw their own future. Either it is turned into a toy and forgotten and played with, or the fruit is stripped and the body is thrown in prison. Even though Ryder hadn't yet found the bat fruit esper species vampire form in Sleeping Town, his heart palpitated. Others kill people with a knife, and Bayou's tricks are too many, and it is difficult for people who are not afraid of death to stand up. Who was he just talking to? Some kind of special fetish? What is he going to do? Ryder and Barrett saw another amazing scene. Bayou took the demon fruit and walked toward the two crippled pirates he had brought with him. You two, become my subordinates, understand? Ah uh -huh. The two crippled pirates nodded their heads with difficulty, their eyes full of desire to serve Vivi. Eat it. Ichi returned one hand, and Bayou handed the fruit to the two of them. Neither of them thought about it, and they raised their hands to grab it and stuffed it into their mouths. Ryder and Barrett frowned slightly. Let these two people eat, as far as these two garbage are concerned, isn't the sea a big catch? Whitebeard, Golden Lion, two souls who could not open their mouths and could not get out of the cell were very uncomfortable inside. They've spent decades spreading the fame of the two fruits around the world, but at the moment, it's no different than cutting flesh from them and feeding them to dogs. System, Capability Fusion, Ding, detected that you're wrong, Yuzuk have become subordinates, and the ability to fuse airplanes. 
for three breaths. Baiyu felt the power of the shock fruit and the fluttering fruit. After all, he only chose to fuse his abilities. He can develop it himself. Boom. Baiyu casually dropped a finger, directly shattering a small piece of atmosphere, and incidentally shattering the two pirates. What? For the first time, Ryder and Barrett showed sluggish expressions, and Whitebeard and the Golden Lion were also in a trance. Just the shock fruit can obviously be eaten by a waste pirate. Why hiss? It was okay. Baiyu experimented a little, and once again peeled off the fruits of the two dead pirates. Shocked, the two fruits fluttered and returned to Baiyu's hands. The abilities possessed by Baiyu can be developed independently, and the person who is fused by him will die, and the strength of his fusion will not disappear. That's it. Baiyu took two demon fruits and looked at the souls of the white beard and the golden lion with complicated looks. Whoosh! The two fruits flew into their cells, surprising them. Instead of giving the fruit to his subordinates, he left it to the two dead. The white bearded and golden lion were puzzled and full of doubts. Baiyu lifted the toy and turned to leave. Ryder's voice suddenly rang out. Instead of giving the fruit to your men to eat, you threw it into the cells of the two dead people, in order to revivive them. Barrett was shocked. How did Ryder think of this possibility? Yes and how? White Feather gave Ryder a glance. Ryder's eyes froze, and his tone was full of amazement. That is really a terrible ability that has never been heard of, so do you still want to subdue them? Whitebeard and Shiki squinted their eyes. Resurrection. Take it? Moment. Whitebeard thought of his sons who had no father. The Golden Lion thought of the abomination. The way he died was too humiliating. Yes and how? Bayayu asked again. Ryder laughed evilly. Ho ha ha, what a whimsical idea, just too naive. What a bully the two of them are, it is impossible. Oh? Is it harder than taking down the whole world? Bayayu directly interrupted and asked, and then looked at where Whitebeard was. You who regard your son as more important than anything else, are you willing to kneel down for your son? Whitebeard's eyes are complex. As an old father who wanted nothing else, he was willing to die for his sons. As for dignity, don't do it. Looking at Shiji again, Bayayu said directly, you forget it. One top overlord is the licking dog of another top bully, it's too humiliating. The golden lion was furious, he wasn't Roger's licking dog. No, how did you think of Roger? My golden lion wasn't anyone's licking dog. Who is he talking to? Ryder, Barrett and Shihai are in a daze, if they heard it correctly. Hiss. Bai looked at Ryder again and said plainly, can't keep up with the old guy of the new era, your nonsense is too much. I was thinking of locking you up for two months, and now, shut it down for two years. Rush, the white feather disappeared. She ping. Ryder, Barrett, two months to two years. When greeted by Barrett's stoic, grumpy, indignant A's, and very plain, confused, helpless, bitter eyes, all of Ryder's words were stuck. Is this the Demon King? It's tough enough. Whitebeard and Golden Lion looked at each other in confusion, and then, bragging Newgate, Lao Tzu was punched into the deep sea by the boy and died. Golden Lion, old, forget it, don't say it, the hero doesn't ask about the past. She just so shed tears. Why he was forced to die of shock by the Demon King, it was too humiliating. Outside the ship, Nami and the other women looked at the white feathers standing in the air and praised them one after another. White Feather also feels good. Fluttering fruit, if nothing else is very good in terms of the ability to stand in the air. The ghost Perona floated around Bayayu's side. Is this the fluttering fruit? I, oops, what are you doing? Watching the white feather detective's hand wrapped around the armed color and grabbing her, Perona was suddenly frightened. Bayayu withdrew his hand and said casually, I want to see. Fluttering fruit, cannot touch the soul that controls the out of body. For now, no. Perona rolled her eyes. In case you do, what else do you want to manipulate Princess Mononoke? White feather, Nami shouted, full of excitement. There is the fluttering fruit, Chandora, let's move Chandora. She never forgot the gold of that city, and the huge golden bell. Bayayu's jaw dropped slightly, today's task is a bit much. Move away Chandora, Daughter Island, Beast Island, and finally, go around in space. Space, the women were slightly shocked. This kind of word is very strange, rarely appears in life, but it is clear that it is outside the world where the moon is located. No Kai Gao, who has the ability of oxygen fruit, can't help but remind, is there oxygen there? It's hard to serve Vivi without. Dot yes, Bayayu answered. It's such an unscientific world, and his heart is powerless to complain. Ironclad proof 1, and I flew to the moon and killed the cosmic pirates in a second. Find the robot army. Title page of the manga. Iron proof 2, four robots built by a doctor flew to the moon with only hot air balloons. Title page of the manga. The fact that Aniru and the cosmic pirates were able to walk, breathe, and live on the surface of the moon proves that there is oxygen there. Hot air balloon landing on the moon, simply outrageous. It is useless to calculate these things, and the quadratic element itself is not scientific. Robin put down the book and reminded, the usual way is not enough for today, the spaceship will take time to go back and forth, and it will take you more time to fly with the island. However, you can send floating islands into gravity space first. White feathers slightly chin up. His teleportation can only carry things within its own load-bearing range, 
and for now, it really shifts and teleports several islands and the spaceship, no problem. A metal spaceship hundreds of meters in size, the white feathers indicate that they can carry it. Send the floating island into the equal gravity area of gravity space, that is, the same gravity area as the outside world, and find a good place to float out again. The beauties are all back on the ship, and we'll go to the empty island first. Rush, Bayou took the spaceship and teleported away in place and in the sea below. The spaceship disappeared an hour later. A naval vessel came at a rapid pace, and the size of the warship was less than the top lieutenant general configuration. On the bow of the ship, the heroic Peach Rabbit looked into the distance and muttered, before a large number of archipelagos fell. Is this it? Chapter 122 Chapter 122 Peach Rabbit Garden Crazy Journey through space and fly to infinity Top war times Peach Rabbit did not enter the war but was assigned to the new world. Look out over the sea. More than an hour passed, and the previously observed fall islands sank into the sea. The tea dolphin on the side changed his frivolity and said solemnly, if there is no accident, it is the legend that the pirate golden lion Shiji has an accident. Peach rabbit jaw head. After the golden lion crossed the red clay continent with the archipelago, they were chasing after it. Far away, see the archipelago fall. The distance was too far, but also saw a small black dot swirling away. Not surprisingly, should be the spaceship. Tea dolphin said again, We've all seen that spaceship from afar before, so, it was done by the Demon King. Peach Rabbit was silent. Oh Demon King, a man who makes the entire naval headquarters feel powerless. Because there is still no strategy to deal with it. Colonel Tino was snatched away by him. Wasn't he? Peach Rabbit suddenly asked a question. More than just being robbed. It seems that he also took Tina to the Holy Land to rob, but it was not confirmed. But Tina is still wanted. Bounty. 300 million berry. What shocked Tao to even more was that one of the five old stars was killed by the demon king, but the news was blocked very dead, and the outside world has not yet spread out. Five old stars? If Bayou was here, he would definitely snatch away the peach rabbit directly, and then be surprised. He also really forgot about the five old stars, after all, subconsciously he felt that killing a five old star was a small matter, so he forgot, did not tell Morgans, and outsiders did not receive news. But, Bayou is willing to do things that can add blockage to the world government, and the briefing should still be reported. How does Peach Rabbit know? Quite simply, the warring states don't want to hide the crane and carp, and the crane doesn't want to hide the Peach Rabbit, and carp can't control his mouth, you see, sooner or later it will explode. Five old stars, a group of old six. The tea dolphin shook his head slightly, and then said angrily, Yes, this guy is so hateful, there are not many beautiful admirals in our navy, he, you say. Is he interested in me? Peach Rabbit's sudden words made the tea dolphin completely sluggish. What does she mean? But this sentence made the tea dolphin feel excited. Because, the peach rabbit is also a beautiful woman, if the demon king sees it, that kind of result, the tea dolphin wants to die. Without waiting for the tea dolphin to react, Peach Rabbit muttered, I think he is more powerful than the pirates of any era, but we know too little about him, and we still haven't even figured out what specific abilities are. How did he subdue those top strongmen? Everything was like a fog. There was no trace of the past. It was as if I had suddenly come into this world, which was too mysterious. The more Tauta thought about it, the more he felt that if the Demon King didn't control it, it would really turn the world upside down. Suddenly, Tautu's eyes lit up, at present. His only weakness is those women. But it's because he likes to rob beautiful women everywhere that it's also a wonderful opportunity. Since we can't do anything about the Demon King, why not take the opportunity to break in? Beauty, I am. Garden is crazy. Alone in a cave? Single into the clutches of the devil. Thinking of a certain Demon King laughing evilly and wantonly insulting Yuan Yuan, the tea dolphin was stunned and hurriedly said, No, no, he is the Demon King, to women. Yes, there are more opportunities. As soon as the tea dolphin opened his mouth, Peach Rabbit's eyes became brighter. He seems to be very good to those female crew members, and he has not found any rumors of bullying so far. Not only that, but he also didn't have any news of bullying civilians, right? This shows that he is not cruel. There is still no news that he has abandoned the beautiful women he snatched, which shows that he is not truthless. The Demon King C did not find those women, and it seemed that they were separated and protected, which showed that he cared about those women very much and was very warm inside. Fragrant, fragrant. A man who is not cruel, not truthless, and who takes good care of beautiful women, this is the most suitable target for undercover. As long as I don't expose myself and obey, I shouldn't have to worry about my safety. The tea dolphin is completely sluggish. Let you analyze the demon king. Did not let you analyze it like this. You don't want this. Break into the cave. Obedient. A beautiful woman suddenly came to the door. Still so well behaved and obedient. The same man. The tea dolphin was very frightened. The demon king would definitely turn the garden into his shape. The tea dolphin cried. Finished. The goddess is crazy. Empty island. Bayou came here with a spaceship. And many girls had never come. Rush. The next moment. Hakuba brought Hancock of Daughter Island, 
Stasi of the New World, with him. All the women gathered on the empty island, Bayayu looked at the girls and said, you go play for a while, I will move the land of gold to the gravity space. Nami didn't follow either. Anyway, you can see it at any time after moving to gravity space. That's my home, I'll take you around Cornus and Elsa Jr. are happy to return to the empty island. Boom. Where the land of gold is located, Bayayu directly lifted a city and floated it up completely. Airplanes. The door of space opens, Bayayu manipulated the land of gold and sent it into the equal gravity area of gravity space, that is the same as the external gravity. Four hours later, the girls returned to the spaceship one by one, and Bayayu disappeared with the spaceship. Boom. Where Daughter Island is located, a roar sounded, and the startled Neptunes ran away, and the women on the island were shocked and amazed. Wow, is that the husband of the female emperor? Raising your hand and floating the island up, it's really too powerful. What a pity. What's wrong? The female emperor is not fierce. How to feed the child in the future? Nay I, the women of Daughter Island have always worshipped power and the strength of the white feather naturally conquers everyone. But the last sentence, white feather's eyelids twitched wildly, almost throwing his daughter island into the sea. 99% of the women on this island really don't know anything about men, or even recognize them. Husband, don't be angry, they have no malice. Han Cook snuggled up next to Bay Ayu, her face slightly red, and she also heard those amazing quotes. Poof, cough, ha ha ha. I don't know who snorted. Immediately, several girls laughed, especially Nami and Perona as well as the three sugar girls laughed the most. You guys are good. Secretly remembering the most joyful girls who laughed, they are you felt the next daughter island. I didn't expect that the fluttering fruit consumed so little physical strength. It's really good. He has not yet developed. He floated up the island at will, and he felt that he could come back dozens more, which should be related to his strength. Boom. The beast island trained by the women was also uprooted by the white feathers. As gravity space opened, both islands were sent in placed in an area equal to the gravity of the outside world. Go, moon, dark space. At this moment, a spaceship hundreds of meters in size broke through the atmosphere and came here, and flew rapidly toward the moon. Look at the world, it's a ball. The IU came to the ship and motioned for the women to look at it. When the women looked back, everyone couldn't help but hold their breath. A blue planet floating in the distance in space, beautiful as a picture. The thick red line divides the world in half, called Latrite continent, thinner double row lines split the world in half from the other side, no wind belt, and in the middle is the great passage, the four seas, east, west, south and north, are separated by the Latrite continent and the great sea route, you can see the islands scattered throughout the world, but looking at the dead space around you, it makes people feel how lonely the world is, little Bryn exclaimed, we live on a water balloon, no, it's scary, Sugar said as the grape fell from his hand, Robin recalls opening, in a harestry of all knowing, there was a huge planetarium, but it was far from spectacular. White Featherhead A Hara's tree of omniscience is indeed full of roots, and the giant planet White Feather has seen in the anime. In addition to the pirate world, there are many planets around it. It's completely different from the solar system. As for how Ohara's planetarium came about, it may be related to the moon people. After all, there are ancient cities inside the moon. The Analu moon trip on the title page of the comic is only a corner of the book and the White Feather is not very clear. You're going to keep sailing to the moon with your spacecraft. White Feathers flew into space, because he saw that there were too many huge rubble surrounding the world, these large and small stones could be manipulated by the White Feathers. The Vine Tiger can pull down meteorites, proving that there are ring meteorite belts outside the world. At this moment, the White Feathers flew into space, touching all kinds of boulders, and when they fell, they were a group of extinct meteorites. Usually don't care, as long as it is touched, it is in the hands of Bay Ayu and it wants to be summoned at any time. Rush, rush, Bayayu was constantly teleporting within the perceptual range, touching the huge rubble when he encountered it, and one by one he was controlled by him. Ten days, white feathers developed the fluttering fruit, and have also been controlled by the ring meteorite belt touching the meteorite. Fluttering meteorites, Momo amplification, annihilation. When the meteorite is floated down, and then use the Momo fruit to increase by a hundred times the size and speed, the power will be geometrically multiplied. Under the increase of Momo, a 100 meter meteorite may cause a devastating blow to a sea area. Dot it's just a pity that no one is currently qualified for me to use this trick. Bay are you teleported back to the spaceship, and these 10 days were naturally rested, and the time for sleeping and eating came back. The spacecraft sailed rapidly for 10 days and landed firmly on the moon. After the women came down, many girls looked at each other. Is this the moon? It's so desolate. Nami was disappointed. It's eye-catching. The land is full of potholes and barrenness, flowers, trees and nothing. But after careful observation, you can still find many signs of biological activity. Whoever is there, get the concubine out. Han Cook, who was snuggled up next to Bay Ayu, suddenly looked up and gave a cold drink. Click. A terrible chill burst from Han Cook's fingertips, 
freezing directly in front of him into a frozen world. Whoosh, Stussy also turned around, raised his hand, and a flying gun shot out. Boom. As a piece of ice exploded, four figures less than half a meter in size were blown out of it. Robot. The women looked astonished. It turned out to be four and a half meters tall robots with knives and guns on their backs, fully armed and hat ridden, and they were on guard. Are they? Bayayu raised an eyebrow slightly. These four robots. It was Dr. Tsukami of the nautical world who created it and seems to have come to avenge it. The original trajectory was also one step earlier than Anilu to the moon, and was saved by Anilu as a younger brother. Listening to the four robots chattering about something, after understanding a few words, Vivi said curiously, Then how did you come to the moon? Can you tell us about it? Hear the inquiry. The four robots glanced at each other and opened their mouths. A robot with a knife said, the four of us flew to the moon in a homemade hot air balloon, women. A robot with a horn helmet said, we were made by Dr. Tsukami, who was eating dumplings and was choked to death by the explosion on the moon when he saw the explosion on the moon, women. A robot with a black hat said, because someone blew up the moon that caused the tragedy, so we have to fly up to avenge the doctor, women. Finally, the robot with the spear said, we can't defeat the cosmic pirates who are digging up ruins on the moon, we are about to be blown up, women. Oh. My god, the amount of information is so big. Without saying anything about Dr. Tsukami's frightened choking, let's talk about the way they came to the moon, which made the women lose their voices. White feathers are also eyelids twitching. Homemade hot air balloons flying to the moon? It's so unscientific. Originally, there was oxygen in space and the moon, which was enough for the white feathers to complain, and at the moment it was even more powerless to complain. Or a flash to eyes. You say cosmic pirates? Robin was overjoyed. They're digging up the remnants of the moon? The women were also pleasantly surprised. Cosmic pirates and ancient ruins, did not expect that this barren moon also had adventures. Unfolding the sight and smell, Bayayu sensed and then said, it's not far ahead. Go and take down the cosmic pirates, their strongest strength should be at the level of Major General Song. Major General, totally overrated. It's just a commodity that was killed by Aniru. On the title page of the comic, Aniru directly destroyed a thunderbolt with his hand and Bayayu estimated that those cosmic pirates could not even defeat the evil dragon pirate regiment. But since it is a cosmic pirate, there will always be some value. Chapter 123 Chapter 123 Cosmic Pirates Ancient cities within the moon, legions of robots, treasure pirate, take them down. Nami, Perona and the other women came to be interested, they believed in the judgment of the white feather, and they all spread their angel wings and flew over. Watching the little sisters fly, the four robots were stunned. Are they angels? Great. Dr. Tsukami's vendetta can be repaid. The four robots who made their own hot air balloons to the moon were overjoyed. The white feather also walked over, sensing the ancient ruins of the moon and passing. Ten minutes later, the women saw the so-called cosmic pirates. The first thing they saw was a ship, and then some buildings. And those cosmic pirates, all wearing black suits with clock-like logos on them. As for looks, what a ghost. Some have dog heads, some have leopard heads, some have duck heads and Neptune-like creatures. The hands of all cosmic pirates are like human beings with fists, and there are no obvious fingers. There was only one old man who looked very much like a human, but his hands were also fist-like, and he was listening to what the man in the dog-headed top hat said, and his hands were constantly writing and drawing. These cosmic pirates look so weird. Fur tribes? Not all of their hand forms are uniform. It seems that they have been here for a long time, and they have built so many buildings. Are they digging holes? Take them down first. The women spread their angel wings and flew over to talk about a few words, and they all opened up. Blizzard. Buddha on top. Ghost bomb. Frozen. Light. Judgment of the holy light. Stop. When Monet, Robin, Perona, Vivi, and Cornus had just released a big move, and without waiting for the other girls to shoot, Han Cook immediately stopped. Boom. An explosion appeared within the range of the cosmic pirates, directly blinding them to instant death. Even the man with the top hat who looked like the captain was directly injured. Is it so weak? Hancock had to call a halt. Otherwise, the girl's wave of attacks was completely destroyed. How to ask them where they came from? Baby Five's hand turned into a laser cannon to carry. Very speechless, the leaders were almost killed. They are too weak. I didn't shoot it. Hancock said, except for the leading dog-headed man, the rest is up to you. Don't use the ability. Just train as the Battle 710 fight. The women were separated, each picking an opponent. And there were still a lot of people on the other side. Times percent question mark hash at times times. The leading dog-headed man crawled out of the pit and shouted something angrily. Bayayu flashed forward and said plainly, You are the captain, right? Is there a patron or a god to believe in? It's okay to call him out. The dog-headed man looked at the white feather in front of him in shock. The breath on Bayayu's body was stronger than any creature he had ever seen. Was the other party a god? Memory read. Too lazy to talk nonsense. Bayayu directly fainted and pressed on his head. Identity, origin, purpose, etc. Bayayu was a little curious. After all, this was the only creature that Whitefeather had encountered outside the nautical world, 
and they might have been to many planets. That's the way it is, Bayu checked the dog-headed man's memory and was slightly surprised. Even this kind of cargo has been to many planets, but the people of the seafaring world are still at the bottom of the well. Husband, did you find out anything? Han Cook was also curious. There's a lot of information that's valuable, so give it to Brun and Robin. One read, one record, and avoid missing information. I'll look for ancient ruins. Hakuba senses that below the location of the cosmic pirate explosion is the site of the relic found by Aniru on the title page of the manga. There. Aniri harvested thousands of younger brothers. A few minutes later, the women finished solving their opponents and followed Bayu to a pit. When standing in front of the pit and looking inward, you can faintly see the outline of a huge city. Robin exclaimed, Is there really an ancient city inside the moon? There are cities, which prove that there are intelligent creatures here that have so vivid, and people can't help but want to explore. Crackle. The lightning of lightning directly illuminated the mouth of the cave and rushed towards it. Nourishing. It was covered with lightning flashes, and there were all kinds of machine friction sounds, and soon, it was brighter inside. When White Feather closed his hand, Nami's eyes widened. Good. What a big city. It's so bright. There are so many electric lights. Vivian and other women were also amazed. Look ahead. It is a wide street, flanked by various building divisions, and electric lights are lit on both sides of the street, and at the top of the street there is a huge light bulb like a small sun, illuminating the whole city. Stus I suddenly realized, you just gave this city charge. A city in need of electricity is rare even in the seafaring world, where the products of electricity are rarely used on islands. Well, let's go in. Sensing that there was no danger, Bayou entered with his sisters, and what came to his face was a thick sense of history. Bayou and the women walked down the street, looking at the surrounding buildings, and then looked somewhere. Hancock and others who have seen and heard also looked at it. Click, click. It was as if some machine was turning, and there were countless machines turning, filling the whole city. Tread, biddle. The next moment, it was as if there were more than 10,000 footsteps. In the consternation of the women, all the places around the building came out of the hordes of troops. Robot, the density is endless. But all of them are only half a meter high. Khalifa flicked the decorative glasses. They are very similar to the four robots made by Dr. Tsukumi that you just met. Same height, same body type. Except for the equipment, weapons and clothes are not the same. Even the appearance is exactly the same. What does this mean? Either Dr. Fsimite is a descendant of the Lunar people, or the other party has obtained lunar robotic technology. This is Zaniru's robot core. Recalling the scene on the title page of the manga, Bayu said, they fell asleep due to lack of electricity, and after I charged, they all woke up. Rest assured, they are not in danger, but will swear allegiance, because they cannot do without electricity. Bayu was not very interested in them and gave it to Aniru to play with another day, or gather some scientists and see if you can strengthen it. Nourishing. When the white feather's fingertips bloom with lightning, all the robots jumped up in excitement, twittering and wah. Bayou's head was big for a while. It's like seeing a bunch of minions bouncing around, finally finding the boss who can afford to raise them. Space transfer. Bayou directly transferred the four robots outside and asked them to lead them. After the processing, Bayou heard Robin's surprise sound. Ancient frescoes. Everyone looked at it and there were murals on several walls in the distance. When you walk over to see the mural, Cornice and little Aishire's eyes widened, empty islander, on the mural, nothing else can be seen, but the figures on it all have small wings behind them. Same with the people of Empty Island. After looking around, Bayayu nodded, the infinite land that your Empty Island yearns for is here, and the original inhabitants of the Empty Island should be one of the moon immigrants. Robin, can you see anything in the murals? Wait a minute. Robin was pleasantly surprised to check out the mural. Because of this, she feels that history is very thick and it is likely to exist for a longer time than the world government. Lots of murals. After more than half an hour of inspection, Robin slowly spoke. This moonlight city should be called Pyruka. To sum up, there was a very powerful civilization living on the moon, but it had to leave because of the depletion of resources. And the immigration destination they choose is Blue Ocean. Blue Ocean, King High. All refer to the seafaring world. Hearing this, Tina suddenly said, it is certain that not only the primitive people of the empty island are moon immigrants, but other moon immigrants must have brought major changes to the blue ocean. Tina suspects that there is a relationship with the Draco, and even if it doesn't matter, they must know. The women nodded. Four robots can make their own hot air balloons to the moon, and the world government must have been here for 800 years. Let's go to the ruins and look around to see if there's anything worth taking away. There was no danger here, and Bayaya was very relieved. Each person is divided into a group of robots to lead the way. They know that this relic here is still quite good, but the moon's resources are exhausted, and it is difficult to even be a tourist attraction. After a moment, Nami flew over and said, If there is nothing left in the ruins, those cosmic pirates are poor and dying, not even local specialties. It's all some building excavation tools, just change the name to Cosmic Engineering Team. Yes, then except for the dog-headed man, Kirit Middle.Bayu was not interested in the other cosmic pirates, they were too wasteful, 
leaving the leader to continue to read the memory. A day or two passed. The women walked around the ruins, but still found nothing of value. Bei Ayu didn't care either, sending all the dense robots into the gravity space, letting Aniru take it with him. Let's go, let's go to the new world. New world. The last half. A huge island sits here. For hundreds of years, since the Roger Pirates first arrived at the final island. After that, the veil was unveiled, attracting countless powerful people to come and occupy the surrounding seas. It wasn't until Roger found the real ultimate island and named it Love Drew that the island was stripped of its title. Water First Star Island, the final island where the regular record pointers of all routes can guide the arrival, is also the current terminus of the rest of the pirates except Roger Pirates. Ahead, there seems to be no way forward. Is that the island of the Water Star? It looks so big. The women looked out over the huge islands in the sea below. Empty though. But there are already many people building on it, and various palaces are being built. After all, it was once the ultimate island, and the area is not small, so I will establish my headquarters here. Overlooking the whole picture of Shuixian Star Island, Bayayu was also satisfied. He didn't like that there were other island forces in the rear, and it was awkward to be surrounded by other forces. And Shuixian Xing Island is the terminal station on the surface, and there is no one behind waiting for the arrival of the strong. I will make the white sea in the sky, form the continent of clouds, and build the city of the sky, and we will live in the sky from now on. Water first Star Island, leave it to Hawkeye to live with them. The women were looking forward to it. The white sea of the empty island is extremely stable, and there is no need to worry about accidental falls. After studying the clouds the, Pickle and Nami were more stable than the fluttering fruit, making them suitable for building the sky city. Hankook. Take Nami and them to the nearby Big Island to survey the location and environment. After determining the location, I settled Daughter Island. After the arrangement, the white feather flew into the sky behind the Water Star Island. Brush 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 brush. At this moment, many people came out of the main hall and looked up to see white feathers standing in the sky. It's the captain. Sand Crocodile and others were also relieved to see Bayou. After all, they had not heard from them for half a month after they left. Good thing to be back, on the moon in space. The phone worm doesn't work at all, Bayayu hadn't teleported back to tell his little brothers where he had gone. After all, if you leave for half a month and there is an accident on the ground, the little brothers are too wasteful. White sea, out. White feathers waved wine white clouds. White clouds swept across the sky like a tsunami, and soon formed an island that continued to expand. Erky, who had been smiling, was surprised. This is, empty island's white sea. It's amazing. Shout out what, isn't the white sea a cloud? Never seen the world, the arrogance of Van Iris inertia. But the heart is also amazed. You must know that the White Sea is at an altitude of 10,000 meters. Most of the empty islands have difficulties in communicating with King Hai, so they are short of various resources. The White Sea made by the White Feathers can be seen when you look up, just a kilometer above the sea behind the Water Pioneer Island. Look at it from a distance. You can see a thick cloud floating steadily in the sky. Heron, build a city in the sky, overlooking the new world. Chapter 124. Chapter 124 Utah, Teacher Kai is also too hard to fight. Original Tribal Daughter Island, city in the sky. At present, there is nothing on it, and it is necessary for Bay Ayu to put some small islands with a good environment on it, and then build new home with the girls. Genting ladder or something. Non-women are not allowed to land in the Sky City. Bayayu doesn't want others to disturb the lives of the girls. Let Smuggy form a women's team to guard the Sky City. As for Riley, they should guard the Water Star Island and the Demon King Sea. Rush, Bayayu came to the bottom, glanced at the construction sites everywhere, and looked at the crowd. The main hall is built. Let's go inside and talk. With the crowd inside, Bayayu also called out the other little brothers who are still training in the gravity space, and the elite crew and potential were gathered in the Great Hall. In the last half a month, I went to space and the moon for a trip. Bay Ayu just finished speaking. I was excited to see Aniru and Durki. After all, the people of the empty island yearn for the infinite earth. These are pictures, you can see them, and if you're interested, let Aniru take you there another day in his little spaceship. When the photos of the space and moon parts were sent down, many people frowned. Aniru was even more disappointed. Is it so desolate? Just an ancient ruin and a bunch of robots. Riley looked at the photo and smiled. The moon can go. It doesn't matter if it's desolate, you can go around another day. Punch in, take a souvenir. Later, when he went to Yellow Springs, Riley could also blow two more words to Roger. The moon passed, and Bayayu asked the crowd, what's going on lately? Or the question. Hawkeye said coolly. The tool you chose performed well. There is no reward for working in vain. Poor man who has to be disposed of after the work. After thinking about it, Bayayu raised an eyebrow slightly. What you said is, which one? Everyone's eyelids twitched. The co-captain found a lot of tool people, they were too hard. Oh Buddha, Blackbeard Titch, has recently subdued a lot of sea thieves. It has even seized the territory of some of the original white-bearded pirate regiments, and many people have called Blackbeard the new fourth emperor, Dover explained, and his heart was also emotional. After everything is sorted out, 
The crowd found out. The unsightly guy who knelt down at the sight of the captain was so stoic. The Whitebeard Pirate Regiment endured for many years, only for the dark fruit. He even went to push into the city to try to find the little brother, but was preempted by Bay Ayu. He went to the top of the war again, trying to take the fruit of Whitebeard, but was interrupted by White Feather, but also gave him another one, the fruit of natural disaster. Blackbeard's plans were one after another, which amazed the people who had recently sorted out talent. Bay Ayu frowned slightly. It's been almost a month and you haven't become the fourth emperor? What waste. The crowd. Blackbeard basically started from scratch, and it was not easy to use tools. Category handed Bay Ayu the latest newspaper, and Bay Ayu looked at it. Clockdial coughed softly. Captain, Pheasant and Red Dog compete for the position of Grand Admiral. The two fought for ten days and ten nights, the Red Dog won and became the Marshal, and the Pheasant was defeated, withdrew from the Navy. The Naval Headquarters was also moved to the New World. He thought that Bay Ayu was interested in this, after all. The pheasant, no, Cusin, was now the wild's top strongman. With the captain's mouth plus strength, wouldn't a retired general be able to catch it? Pheasant, thinking of the pheasant, Bay Ayu didn't know what he was thinking now. After all, Bay Ayu had made a prophecy, within a few months, you would definitely quit the navy. It is estimated that the pheasant recalled what Bay Ayu said, and said a few minutes less bitterly. As for the original trajectory, whether the pheasant only cooperated with Blackbeard, or whether it might have joined Blackbeard, these white feathers did not care because he came. A lot of them will change. Seven Marshal sees. It hasn't even been revoked. Bay Ayu turned over the newspaper again, somewhat speechless. Such a head of iron. The five old stars are on a bar with him, right? He kills a batch. There is a batch of supplements, that is, the hard bar. Hearing this, Doflamingo laughed and said, Hey, Captain, the center of gravity of the seven Marshal sees has shifted to the revolutionary army, so I am anxious to make up for it again. And I've heard that because a certain guy became the seven Marshal sees. A former admiral quit the navy in anger and seemed to be forming some new navy. The new navy? Hikaba thought of one of the three great teachers of the pirate world, Zephyr. Teacher Kai ranked first. Riley? He only deserves enlightenment. Zephyr is the most conscientious and responsible teacher with the most experience in teaching, but compared with the teaching level of teacher Kai, there is still a dimensional gap. True naval heroes, but the saddest heroes. Defending justice for a lifetime was not respected by the above, and Bayaya was definitely more desperate than he did, but it ended in loneliness. I see, do you still have a problem? Bay Ayu didn't see in the newspaper any more interested, Category said smoothly, Captain. The water pioneer island is a little far from the Demon King's Sea, and all the elites have moved to this, if there is an accident, the support is very inconvenient, Bay Ayu said directly, then open up. You should also be active, from here to the Demon King's Sea, whose territory is it? Category immediately said, all the four emperor forces and the major pirates of the second line have occupied territory nearby, after all. This is the terminal of major routes, and the geographical location is very important, but at present, no one unifies this area. Let them all roll. Bay Ayu didn't even think about it, he came, everyone else should roll. As soon as the words fell, many people lit up, and the war spirit boiled over, especially Kid and a few other supernovae, who are not afraid of things at all. When it's fully open, I will build space gates on important islands to allow the elite to pass through gravity space. But this is a bit troublesome, Bay Ayu looked at the bill in the corner. Every island is arranged with mirrors, the elite enter the space gate, and the troops will use the mirror world. Yes, Captain. Bree replied immediately. Seeing that nothing was going on, Bay Ayu was ready to go and establish a sky city with his sisters, and stood up and said, Contact Morgans, let him send a report to the new world, and if you don't choose to evacuate the sea within three days, you will give them a death notice. Is the same as the four emperors? If you don't leave the sea area I value, the fourth emperor Kaida will also die. Yes. Captain. Time is rushing. The day passed quickly. The New World shook. Morgan's newspaper has been distributed, only in the New World, so start counting the time today. Question mark between Shuixi and Xing Island and the Demon King Sea. All the islands belong to the Demon King. All forces will be evacuated within three days. Those who do not withdraw, die. Here we go again. Seeing this newspaper, Shanks was silent for a moment and said in a deep voice, he will only completely break the balance in this way. That's it. Shanks shook his head and sighed. That's it. Evacuate. Originally, Shanks was still thinking of stopping the crazy white feather, after all, before a certain time came, he really didn't want the world to be chaotic enough. But the thought of taking heavy losses at the naval headquarters made Shanks in no mood. The direct loss of half of the pirates made Shanks realize that he could not be more nosy, at least for a few years. Utah, how's it going? Shanks whispered. It's still like that. Beckman shook his head slightly, and his tone froze slightly. She still thinks it is you who abandoned her and still want to bring happiness to the world with your songs, and now your fame is getting bigger and bigger. Alas, Shanks sighed. Yuta, his adopted daughter, was found in a treasure chest. On Elegy Island many years ago, the redhead left little Yuta and left, 
leaving little Yuta crying and shouting why, as long as there is my singing voice, everyone can live happily, muttering Yuta's dream, Shanks looked into the distance, Yuta's dream is beautiful, but unrealistic, white remnants, their territory had long been torn apart, and every day someone came to beat them up, and who had the energy to take care of the islands that had been occupied at will, boo, I love ghosts, Kaido smashed the wine jug directly on the ground, just when Ember and the others wanted to say something to the boss to stop his anger, ah, uh, Kaido suddenly burst out laughing, worthy of being Lao Tzu's good son-in-law, really fucking domineering. Lao Tzu loves it, Ember and the others, woohoo. The next second, Kaido cried bitterly, but he doesn't take Lao Tzu in his eyes too much, doesn't Lao Tzu retreat, he even wants to kill Lao Tzu, can he do it? Lao Tzu was very angry, and Lao Tzu decided, Ember, remove the gifts prepared for him. Lao Tzu does not send it, but I'm not ready. Since this is the case, it is also a matter of convenience. These days have been to Bay Ayu to find a congratulatory gift to ascend to the top of the four emperors. Ember is also a headache, it is really not suitable. Ember said in a deep voice, the islands we occupy in that sea, just a few broken islands, give him to him, it doesn't matter. Kaido's rather bold and atmospheric opening. Ember frowned and didn't say anything, Kaido must have had his own ideas. Boom, Kaido stomped on the ground with one foot, and the dragon flew out, leaving a word. Lao Tzu has gone to cultivate. The crowd looked at each other. The boss is also too hard to fight. Quinn was even more stunned. Boss Kaido has been working harder and harder lately, which makes us very embarrassed. If you don't want to be a burden, just cultivate hard. Ember's sternly opened. Also at the end, Ember muttered, the boss doesn't want to lose to Bei Ayu. The pressure of the Demon King. Unconsciously, it has quietly spread all over the world. Three days. The Sky City and the Water Star Island began together and Bei led his sisters to build a large-scale construction in the Sky City. The women were in high spirits. After all, after the construction of this place, there will be a better headquarters in the future, and Bei can directly move over. Just put it here. Hakuba moved Daughter Island and Beast Island out and inquired about Han Cook. Bei was surprised. Before, Bei's plan has always been to place Daughter Island on a larger island in the Windless Belt near his territory. And today, Han Cook said that instead of putting it in the Windless Zone, it was placed near the Water Star Island. Han Cook said very seriously, the women of Daughter Island are born to be trained as warriors, shouldering all the family and labor, and even after pregnancy, they only give birth to girls. But for too many years, the various resources of Daughter Island have been needed to be maintained by plundering at sea. As husband June said, the real new era has arrived, and Daughter Island should also change. We are born warriors, not born thieves. Speaking of this, Han Cook snuggled up to Bay Ayu. Let Daughter Island and nearby islands trade. Daughter Island will no longer need to go to sea to plunder, and the women of the whole island, now and in the future, are the most loyal warriors of the husband. Bayou agreed, has been in the windless zone. Daughter Island can only be self-contained. The development of civilization will fall into a stagnation, and Han Cook's determination to change, under the care of White Feather, will not be unexpected. The benefits far outweigh the disadvantages. Seeing Bayou nodding, Han Cook hesitated and said, Concubine Concubine has a small request, say it, except for your husband, other male creatures are not allowed to land on Daughter Island, whether it is now or in the future, this must not be changed, is this a request? Looking at Han Cook with some cautious anticipation, Bayou cried and laughed, and directly patted Han Cook, look at your hesitant look, what do I think, the result is this, rest assured, I promise, now, in the future, that no male creature can land on Daughter Island, not even if I kiss my son, well, I don't like my son. Han Cook blushed, because Bayou patted her pee, pee They were all seen by Nami, which was too shameful. Boom. Daughter Island, located on a large island near the Water Star Island. This island is far larger than Daughter Island, and Daughter Island has formed a more unique scenery when it is put up with this island as the foundation. Daughter Island will be fine, and more taxi land will have more resources. Bayou understood very well that Daughter Island was really small, and it was a little difficult for people to support themselves with that little bit of land. And now, at least Han Cook and other girls on Daughter Island were pleasantly surprised. Such a huge island, even if you only cultivate the land, you don't have to worry about eating and drinking. Primitive Tribal Daughter Island? Seemingly understanding the thoughts of the many female warriors, Bayou said helplessly, Robin, Khalifa, Monet, Stussy, my secretaries, let's plan for resource development and other issues for the new Daughter Island. Don't let them just think about how to farm, the idea is too primitive first change the complete clothes as soon as possible. In the eyes of Bay Ayu, the civilization of Daughter Island is also stronger than that of the primitive tribes. Extreme scarcity of resources. Information is also scarce. But the background is very good, and Daughter Island's research on domineering is also very deep. Han Cook and other women can't help but blush. Their Daughter Island is really a bit backward, so it must be reformed. Chapter 125. Chapter 125. Dorag comes uninvited. 
the Demon King is too realistic. Restore the bear. Boom. After dealing with Daughter Island, the beast island where the girls usually cultivated was placed by Bay Ayu in the Sky City above the sea behind the water Pioneer Island. At present, there are many scenic islands placed here, which are combined to form a land. Each girl can choose a place to be her own territory. You can design and build your own home in your favorite place. Anyway, it is not for outsiders to see, and the girls like it. White feathers have only two small requirements beautiful and atmospheric. When Bay Ayu saw the architectural drawing designed by relying on Perona's idea of finding someone, he said, what is this ghost? Perona cried directly, how is my dark castle not beautiful, where is it not atmospheric? Don't think I didn't hear you whisper that Nami's golden house is a bit dirty, aren't we usually a little lively, you are bullying people. Bay Ayu, Nami, don't talk nonsense. Bay Ayu was surprised when he said it. Nami's face darkened, the golden house, very earthy. Yes, Perona ignored the threat in Bay Ayu's eyes and shouted. Sisters and sisters are coming, I want to sue. White Feather said that my castle is ugly, Nami's golden house is too old-fashioned, Vivi's palace is too old-fashioned, Robin's treehouse is too green, Sugar's fruit house is too awkward, Tina's villa is too rigid, and Perona didn't stop at all. Bayayu listened stunned and looked at Perona with astonishment. Then, Bayayu turned his head and looked at a pair of beautiful big eyes, looking directly at him. Good black-hearted gothic Alita, I remember, live you up. Bayayu disappeared after speaking. Perona shouted in surprise, Wow, wow! Did he scare me away? Nami had a look of sympathy on her face, solemnly remind you, you are finished. Kia reminded, apologized to big brother Bayayu early, otherwise, at least double the training. This small body will not be spoiled. Stussy muttered to hear the sympathetic suggestions of the women one by one, and Perona cried, Wow, I was wrong. Aqua Star Island. Inside the main hall, after reading the information collected by Kartaguri, Bayayu said casually, since the redhead and Kaido have withdrawn with interest, the others don't have to wait. Everyone, open up the Water Star Island and the Demon King Sea, and all the islands on the road belong to us. Let's go. Looking at the many working little brothers who were very excited, Bayayu couldn't help but shake his head. If it weren't for the fact that the Water Star Island and the Demon King Sea were indeed a bit far away, it was necessary to open up the sea area between them. Otherwise Bayayu wouldn't bother to fight the ground at this time. It doesn't make much sense to fight too much territory now and it can't be divided into too many people to defend. Bayayu's plan is very clear, after grabbing the plot beauty, after drawing the prize, then gather the sister and all the little brothers, take the naval headquarters in one go, and then directly march into Mary Joy. After taking the holy land, White Feather has time to slowly deal with the problems of other major seas, and before that, let the world government help Bayayu manage the world for a while, and be a tool man. Huh? Bayayu looked up slightly. At this moment, the breath of the top strong man was rapidly approaching the Water Star Island, and it was flying. Hawkeye and Riley, who had just walked out of the hall, were also footsteps. Glance at each other. Riley shook his head. I haven't felt the breath, but it's strong. Hawkeye said coolly, it's really strong, and it's very strong. The Clockdale and the others in front of them were unknown, so Aniru suddenly became excited. Yee ha ha, this breath is better than that dead fat woman. As soon as he said this, Katagori and the others stared over. Aniru coughed softly and continued to be excited. Cough. It seems to be stronger than the well-behaved and obedient Lingling. Ling. It should be an intruder, really looking for death. Leave it to Ben God. Intruders, Cavendish and the others were on guard, but they could not let the visitors disturb the captain. God's sanction. Aniru brazenly struck. A huge pillar of thunder and lightning rushed towards the high sky in front of it, crackling. The thunder flashed, leaving a thunderclap in vain, but nothing hit it. Didn't hit? Aniru was slightly puzzled. Obviously there. Yikes. Eagle Eye drew his sword in an instant, and a huge slash of incomparable brilliance rose up in the air and rushed into the sky. Whoops. Rumble. Under the gaze of the crowd, the slash seemed to split the clouds and split the sky without cutting anything. Riley raised an eyebrow slightly. I didn't cut it again, is it? Department of Nature? The sky is full of invisible flows, and if it were not for the strong breath of the visitor, it would be really difficult to detect. Down? Pretending to be a ghost. Sensing that the other party rushed down. Aniru's body exploded again. 100 million volts thunder dragon. The piercing lightning condensed into a huge thunder dragon and swooped away in an instant. Under the gaze of everyone, a hand condensed in the atmosphere in front of it, covered with armed colors, and bent to form the form of three dragon claws, tearing up. Rumble. In Aniru's consternation, the dragon's claws directly grabbed the head of the thunder dragon and tore it apart, even tearing the entire thunder dragon apart and dissipating, streaming down. The next moment, a breeze blew through and a figure appeared in front of him. Come on, a little green. He was two meters six in height, with a dark green coat, a crimson tattoo on the left side of his face, scrawled black hair, and no eyebrows, which made the whole person look a little fierce. Hawkeye's face did not change color, and he said coldly, it's actually you. Whoops, 
This is really a big man. Do Flamingo's eyes also shone brightly. And Iri frowned. Who is this mortal? Famous. Can beat you to death. Clockdial said unceremoniously. Leader of the Revolutionary Army. Munch middle.d. Dorag, the biological son of a naval hero and the biological father of Straw Hat. Because he advocated the revolutionary idea of subverting the world government, he was identified by the government as the most vicious criminal in the world, overthrew dozens of kingdoms in succession, and became the number one criminal of the world government. Uninvited. Please gentlemen and your excellency the demon king, don't blame me, I don't have any malice. Dorag looked at the main hall, and his voice sounded calmly and powerfully. If you have malicious intent, you've just died. When a voice sounded from inside the main hall, Dorag was shocked, because he felt a flower in front of his eyes. He found himself instantly transferred from outside the temple to the inside of the temple, and there was no room for him to resist at all. You go on. Yes, Captain. Luchi and the others outside the temple did not pay any more attention to Dorag and left one after another. Looking up at the white feather sitting on the tee, Dorag said, Your Excellency the Demon King. I'm busy. You only have a chance to say three words. White Feather interrupted Dorag's nonsense. Revolutionary armies like Dorag's must have specialized in shutting down their mouths. If Bay Ayu didn't block it, he believed that Dorag could talk for a few days and nights. Three sentences? But I. Two more sentences. Dot. Dorag was silent. Hakaba's tough attitude makes it difficult for Dorag to adapt, and secretly analyzes Hakaba's personality. In Dorag's database, Bay Ayu's first shot was the blood straw hat which was his son. Immediately after versus Hawkeye, versus Double General, versus Riley, versus Big Mama, versus Whitebeard, etc. are all well-known amazing battles. Rob a beauty. Dorag didn't care. At the very least, the female crew members seemed to be doing just fine. In this process, what moved Dorag the most was that Bayou slaughtered the Draco, took the Draco beauty as a slave girl, and even moved the city into the air. The Demon King, not a good man. At this point, Dorag was sure that no matter how kind a pirate was, he was not a purely good man including his son. But, the Demon King is not a cruel and bloodthirsty person who oppresses civilians. That's enough, as long as it is not absolutely evil. Dorag believes that there are opportunities to win over or cooperate, including the Demon King. So Dorag muttered, I came for the bear, he disappeared with the pirates at the former naval headquarters, I think. It should be in the hands of His Excellency the Demon King. Yes and how? Well, what Dorag didn't say, Pickleber really forgot. No wonder these days, top-notch Boney has been staring at him. He had previously wondered if Robin, Hancock, Nami, Marcino, Stasi and other women's rooms were not soundproofed well, so that Boney did not sleep well, but the result was that the sound insulation was very good. I only think about it now. It turned out that he had forgotten about the bear. You know very well about Bonnie's relationship with the bear, and I won't make Bonnie sad, so I'll cure bear. But, looking at the strange tattoo on Dorag's face, Bayou was very suspicious that it was Kapu's shoe print. If you want the bear to go back, take out your qualifications. Qualification, is it a condition, right? If White Feather could really cure bear. Dorag would be willing to cut the flesh. Seeing Dorag's thoughts, Bayou said directly, Natural or Esper species or top superhuman lineage, change it. Bears are impossible to subdue. Bayou and he are not the same person at all, unless the memory is modified, but it is really not necessary. Moreover, the bear's fruit ability, Bayou did not care. It is nothing more than a bullet and a crow's feet, but he is currently not interested in increasing the ability to increase the fruit, except for the conceptual ability of time, space, etc. Demon fruit. The dragon breathed a sigh of relief. After all, the devil fruit is a foreign object, and the role and influence of the bear on the revolutionary army are too important. Thought about it. Dorag touched the cloak and somehow found a box. This one is top Superman. Seeing this, Bayou raised his hand and transferred the box to his hand, opened it and looked at it a few times, and was very satisfied with the demon fruit that Dorag took out. Well, yes, I allow you to say a few more words. Dorag was helpless. The demon king is so realistic. This top level fruit made Dorag's flesh hurt and he was originally ready to leave it for sub, but the rest, Dorag did not want to take it out and shame people, and if he angered the demon king, he would cause big trouble, crush the fruit, not bad, recalling the demon fruit atlas, Bayou was very satisfied with this fruit, crush fruit, the basic ability is to attach pure crushing power to itself and weapons to attack and crush everything, and others can be redeveloped, top superman, perhaps the destructive power is not as good as the shock fruit, but the attack power should not be underestimated, after all, one is only a shock, and the other is directly shattered. It is a kind of famous knife, as well as the nemesis of defending against powerful things. This guy, there are a lot of good things. White feathers squint their eyes slightly, crushing the fruit, if it is given to Saab, is the top of the foundation. In the original trajectory, after eating the burnt fruit, Saab made a big fuss in the holy land of Mary Joy and won the title of Yandi. Airplanes, a figure that breathed like a dead body appeared out of thin air. It is the original seven martial sea bears. Your Excellency, Demon King. How long will it take to cure bear? Seeing the bear appear, 
Dorag's eyes were full of apologies and sadness, and he immediately couldn't help but ask Bayayu. Wait, Bayayu raised his hand, state restored. A flash of light enveloped the bear. Under Dorag's gaze, the bear's life-filled breath gradually came alive, and his eyes gradually became more and more energetic. A dozen seconds later, where do you want to go if you want to travel? Long time gone, dragon. When the bear said this mantra plainly, Dorag was calm on the surface and his heart was full of surprise. Is that okay? The bear was transformed into a human weapon by Burger Punk. The body was greatly transformed. The memory also disappeared. Only some settings were left, but it was completely restored between the white feathers and the raised hands. Sure enough, as the rumors describe, it's like going back in time. In this scene, Dorag could only think like this, and for a moment, his heart was extremely jealous of Bayayu. Success? Bayayu was also surprised. If you want the bear to fully recover and not change back, it is no less than White Feather to let Riley permanently return to the age of 40 and then slowly age. Previously, Bayayu could only keep people for more than 10 days at most. And now, Bayayu's clear perception that the bear was really fully recovered, and it would not suddenly change back into a human weapon. It is so. White Feather saw and smelled the Sky City, and the perception fell on Koya. Because Perona was crying and her eyes were red, Perona didn't feel good about it, so she ran over to Kia to help her recover. Outcome. Koya ability awakening. It's just so magical. Koya's recovery fruit awakened, and the white feather that fused her strength naturally also awakened. Sure enough, there are many people in great power. Of course, it can also be said that Koya is very talented, and the recovered fruit is very suitable for Koya. Bayayu's talent for fusing so many people was indeed better, but his energy was distracted by a lot of abilities and domineering and sword skills. Unlike Koya, who has been studying the fruit of restoration, the awakening is too sudden. If you like this audiobook, subscribe the channel for more videos like this and join my Patreon if you want to support me, link in the description. Leave some comment and let me know if you guys like this story, or you have a web novel you like and want to hear its audiobook, I will be happy to create them for you. Please like, share, and leave a comment on the video.